Hey Rayu, howdy chat. Yo, 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 how's it going, my ghostling? Grease Sam, welcome home, my ghostling. Tan Terrence, for four months. Welcome, welcome back. Hey, guys, how are you today? All right, I got two big choices for you today. Which one do you want? Do you want Yakuza or do you want Hades? <laughs> Pick one. <laughs> Hades, please. I crave Zagreus' packs. See, Exelon is based. Uh... <laughs> All right, all right. I'll give you guys. I'll give you guys a poll. Okay, it will be a fair poll. We picked the left. <laughs> Delta Alpha Gamma gets it. Here, you may fondle whatever choice you make. Uh, let's see. Yeah, da, da, da. I'll do the poll. It will be choose. <laughs> the Hades and the Yakuza Zero, and it will be a democratic poll. And you have ten minutes. Nah, or maybe democracy's dead. I don't know. <laughs> All right, all right. The poll starts now. Okay. Get those hate redeems in, too. How you doing, Monty? All right, get those hate redeems in now, too, so I can read them while you guys uh, quietly vote. <laughs> Between Hades and Yakuza Zero. And then we'll just chill and enjoy it all night. Either way, either way, uh, we'll have a good time. It's just that if we're doing Yakuza Zero, I, I hate you. I'm kidding. <laughs> Either you vote Hades or you suck. <laughs> I'm memeing, I'm memeing, I'm memeing. Why do Booba keep growing? Why not, Zorkon? <laughs> they only get bigger, more massive. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna... It will be okay. Thank you for 500 bits, Gray. Gotta be Yakuza now that you have both Kiryu and Majima. Gotta be Yakuza now that you have both Kiryu and Majima in Waifu Bot. You're right, they're reunited. I can have them kissing. <laughs> All right, all right. Let me uh, do the hay redeems now. All right, get those hay redeems in. They're only 300 channel points. You can afford it. Uh, and get them in now so that I don't miss it later if I'm gaming. All right. Hey, random guys. This is Mood, Ground Pounder, Alex, BB, Face, Hands, and Tangles, Green Bay, Peyton, Shining, Art, Jalen, Heist, Tejo, the Slayer, David, So, Q Talk, Zeon, Setsuna, Gian, Sukuma, Dealer, Rupretch, Grease, Jilo, Sericum Knight, Pete, Zorkon, Adrian, Tokafas, Gromugger, Zelix, Expansion, <laughs> Glim, Brother Day Day, Faded Hermit, Not a Fix, Gray, uh, Skelly, Rewolf, Iron, Effie, Shadowcock. Hey, how are you guys doing today? <laughs> All right, let's see how this let's see how this poll is going. Damn, the hype train's blocking my poll. <laughs> oh, it's so hard. I can't see the poll. I see, I see. Overwhelmingly, Yakuza Zero right now. All right, I I get what you want. All right, I hope you guys know if we're playing Yakuza Zero, it will be me just grinding out the cabaret, not the cabaret, the uh, real estate. So you have to keep me company and entertained the whole time. Ramses, thank you so much for 95 bits. Thank you, thank you. I'm so devastated to let you know, homie, that like to do hype trains on Twitch, it has to be over 100 bits. It's, it's Twitch's rules, not mine. All right, all right. I am never touching the arcade game again. <laughs> thank you for the 100 bits, Zion. Thank you, choo-choo. Played a marketing game, aka Yakuza Zero. God, choo choo. Uh, <laughs> can't wait. Real estate time. Hey, Ribuku. Hey, Exelon. Hey, Kiros. Hey, Yinny. Z Chill. And Meta Cream Rick. 
Oh shit. Where did I put Fat Kiryu? <laughs> Where's Fat Kiryu? You know what? I'm adding him back. Hang on. He needs to be here. Boom. Boom. There we go. Now all is right in the world. <laughs> you have silence of Nox, you have big PP energy. <laughs> hey Kai Omega. Let's see, did I miss anyone else's? No, I didn't. Ba, ba, ba. Delta Alpha Gamma, thank you so much for gift sub to your anus is like a wind tunnel. Thanks, man. You know? <laughs> not my anus perfect. Uh, not my anus. My my anus is perfect. <laughs> But my mods anus, they, they've gone through it. The daily peggings are starting to really get to them. <laughs> fat cutie, put Fat Cutie running in the boobas. I wish I could change your perspective. Grease, thank you so much for 200 bits. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> I love me some Fat Cutie in the evening. I get it. <laughs> I don't know why, but this frame in particular, it seems very cursed. <laughs> I'm coming for you. <laughs> It's like, oh, you were staring at the boobas? That's not respecting women. Kiryu has to heat move your ass for it. My anus should not be brought into this. <laughs> the mods just don't want you to know how loose their assholes have become. <laughs> hey, Justin, how you doing? <laughs> He's coming for you. Completely in character. Exactly. Kiryu drinks his respect woman juice. You too can drink respect woman juice by <laughs> using... Using my code PEGA, homie, for 10% off for gamer subs. <laughs> Consider it. <laughs> Don't you want to drink your respect woman juice? <laughs> you can use a PEGA, homie, code so it's extra fem feminist. <laughs> you sly bastard. See, Aizen, you didn't see it coming, did you? <laughs> Slickest ad ever. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, looks like it's gonna be it's gonna be Yakuza Zero. You have chosen incorrectly, chat. <laughs> I'm kidding. We'll play we'll play Hades another day. Delta Alpha Gamma, thank you for the gift sub to Loose Anus Gaper. <laughs> Mods, do you feel seen today? Hey, Erlash. Perfect way to just slide in the advertisement. They didn't even know it was coming. <laughs> we have made our choices, and you will ruminate in it. Hey, Renato. Ba, ba, ba. And then we'll just play Yakuza Zero all night and chill. Anus advertisement? Mmm. <laughs> just your gaping chocolate starfish. Ray, this is intervention. Please, no more Hades. I played it just a little bit yesterday. <laughs> and I haven't played it in a long time. Hades is so good. Plus, I just unlocked whatever it is that Thanatos gives you. I, so I guess we're in love. <laughs> Saw my booba emotes? How has he never seen my booba emotes before? They're the, the, they're the shining beacon of my channel, I think, even though I'm not allowed to use it on Twitch. <laughs> booba swipe. Booba insert. <laughs> hey, TSL Kevil. Alright, let's put let's put Kidu back over to chat. He's watching over you guys. He's like your personal guardian. Do you feel safe in his big, broad arms and nice cushy belly squeeze <laughs> god hey big bad wolf hey wall kill man wall kill and big bad wolf you guys redeemed that at like the exact same second ramses thank you so much for two gift subs thank you thank you also welcome to the piss train <laughs> hope you're happy to be on a piss car <laughs> little pee pee boy <laughs> have you guys seen the new giovanni uh like shit post i love it so much <laughs> You are a little pee pee boy. <laughs> no, no, I'm not. I'm not a little pee pee boy. I'm not. <laughs> I love how he sounds like a desperate Victorian orphan. <laughs> Show it. Uh, I have to go pull it up, though. Uh, you, if you want me to show it, you have to give me a link right now. I'm not going to go hunt it down. That's a spicy PP boy to you. Why is it spicy, guilty werewolf? <laughs> piss car pod, Yazians. This is it. You're living it big in a piss car. Check it out. Piss yellow. God, I love the little train. <laughs> I love the little hype train. All right, choose wisely. Okay, so it's Yakuza Zero time. We will do Yakuza Zero, but but you know the twenty of you who voted Hades, you're my favorites. <laughs> 
everyone else, uh, you, you go into the naughty zone. You're a little pissed boy. All right, I'll get the little pee pee boy up. <laughs> Delta Alpha got me. Thank you so much for the gifts of this spicy pee pee. Thanks, homie. <laughs> Thanks. Why is it spicy? All right, I have to go. I have to get this into a window. Hang on. Uh, window capture. Do I have anything that can dox me open? <laughs> This is the constant struggle of streaming. It's like, whoops, dox myself, and I was just trying to show you guys a little pee pee meme. <laughs> I'm just trying to show you guys a little piss piss meme. All right, all right. Uh, where'd I put it? Here, here. See, doesn't that just look like a pillow with a piss stain on it? <laughs> oh God, where is it? Slash vexillology. The flag is a pit, but it's actually this hand towel with a perfectly placed water stain. Oh shit, I just peed on my towel accidentally. <laughs> Better turn this into cloud. It was a water stain! I had a ice pack and it leaked onto the towel! I didn't fucking pee on it! You peed on it. You peed on it, didn't you, little piss boy? <laughs> The fucking post so much. <laughs> hey, a ghost and a chance. <laughs> oh, so if you don't know, r slash vexology is a like a map appreciating uh, Reddit. Thank you, Delta Alpha Gamma, to for the gifts up to pee pee piss piss boy. <laughs> you gonna piss shit and come maybe? <laughs> pee pee piss piss boy, the myth, the legend. <laughs> Sounds like a pisser to me. Yeah, dude, that just looks like he pissed on a towel, man. <laughs> thank you, my new bits, Ramses. Thank you, thank you. Reject wet towel. Embrace Reject being a little pee pee boy. Embrace being a little pee pee boy. <laughs> Do you embrace it? Do you accept that you pissed on this towel? You little pee pee boy. Jalen Hives, thank you to get up to the little pee pee boy. <laughs> I like to think that some of these accounts you guys are gifting are still active and they're like, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> I like that Aza is just owning up to it. I am a pee pee boy. <laughs> All right, guys. Yeah, because it's zero time. All right. Again, the 21 of you guys who voted Hades, I love you. Uh, the 65 of you guys who voted Yakuza zero, fuck you. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Let's go play Yakuza zero. <laughs> Have a good time. All right. <laughs> How dare you vote Yakuza 0 when we have the superior option to Hades right there. <laughs> so yeah, you can hide in the anim anonymity of the poll and all pretend that you're in the 21 who voted for for Hades. <laughs> You'll think because eventually, I know, we gotta beat Yakuza 0 so I can get to yeah, the uh, further Yakuza series. Barry, thank you so much for your bits. Thank you, thank you. Aw, thank you for coming to spoil me. I appreciate it. <laughs> I voted for Yakuza. Well, DH, fuck you in particular. I am unmodding and banning as we speak. <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's go to Yakuza Zero. Gotta set things up. Ba -ba -bum. Game light. I go in a corner. Oops, those drinking rules are not for this. Justin, thank you so much for 10 gift subs. Thank you, thank you, Justin. I really, really appreciate it. <laughs> okay, let's see. And then I can take off my kimono and we'll be good to go. The piss train is slowly inching towards my tunnels. <laughs> mm -hmm. Did I turn on? Uh, 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 I'm turning on all the wrong emotes. Hey, I'm bad. I lie. <laughs> it looks so sad. <laughs> You're just... <laughs> You're just a little piss piss boy, aren't you? Just a little degenerate pee pee boy. <laughs> I'm devastated. All right, hang on. Yeah, cause I hey, Mastang K, we'll live in next Hakusa land. Um, let's see. <laughs> Why do you want my sad face so much, you you sadist? And then play, and then. We should be good to go. Except for the fact that Yakuza is probably going to reset its volume. It's going to be loud. It's going to be loud. I'm warning you. I'm warning you. The Sega is about to blow us the fuck away. Ugh. Oh, God. I warned you. You can't say I didn't. Sega. Why is it so loud, though? Brown, brown, brown. 
All right, game catcher. Yakuza Zero is selected. Okay, come on, Yakuza Zero. There we go. Everything's all set up and good to go. <laughs> I made the red hype train card. I hope the red card isn't a piss card too. <laughs> you pissing blood, homie? You peeing blood? Oh man. Oh, I uh, forgot that my controller is on the fritz. Okay, guys, what the fuck did we do last time? We were, I remember we did a lot of real estate. That That's all we did, right? Oh, yeah. uh, real estate over and over. Aizen asks, are you a long hair or short hair, Majima? Oh, Mods, can you guys change the game to Yakuza 0? Thank you, I forgot to do it right before swapping. I like all flavors of Majima so long as he fucks Kiryu in the ass. <laughs> it's free real estate. All right, what are we doing again? I got some money. I can buy some businesses. What's left here? Oh, I actually got everything in this district. That's pretty nice. Now we can go for the Pleasure King district. Cabaret Valentine, Totenshan, Arabia Records, Quartier Latin. Okay, all right. Calm Musk Majima. Bro, don't, don't speak of Majima's Musk like this to me ever again. <laughs> I'm begging you. The classic forgetting what the fuck you're doing. Genio, it's too real. There's too much to do in Yakuza. Oh yeah, Majima did have a set of perfumes, didn't he? Crazy. Oh, Yakuza 8 is coming out. Dude, I would be impressed with myself if I managed to beat all of the Yakuza series up to Yakuza 8 within, like, the next year. <laughs> that would be all I am, a Yakuza streamer. Come on, Pleasure District, where's your buildings? Aw, oh, man. Uh. Damn, this place is expensive. Holy shit, that was all my money just now. All right, Mr. Shakedown, come come rob me now. Ugh. I think it's doable. I would have to do nothing but Yakuza forever. I don't know. I, I don't know. This game tickles my ADHD, but does it tickle it that much? Uh, but Hades! <laughs> um, do I want to do the story quest right now? Nah, let's go do that side story. Thank you, 100 bits, Ronnie G. Oh shit, oh shit, I was kidding, I was kidding, I was kidding, I was kite. Okay, good, he leaves. Oh god. Uh, you know what, fuck you. I can't finish all of either Hades in the gutter, but what if my enjoyment of Hades is that strong? Oh shit. What the fuck? Do you guys see that? I, I, I punched that guy and nothing happened to him. He stood there, like I my, my fists were phasing through him. <laughs> what? What was that? Oh, that's the guy helping me! Oh, shit! I tried to punch my friend! I just realized he's on my side! Ah, oh, thank you, buddy! Dude, I keep forgetting that's like a feature in this game. Thank you guys for hype train! Choo choo! Dude, that, f that fabric is wigging me out. I see everything. Where's our buddy? Oh. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Is that our buddy forcing him to bow his head? Or is that just part of the group? <laughs> I can't tell. <laughs> Fucking bow, you degenerates. Look what you've done, you piss piss boy. Dude, I am not going to be able to shut the fuck about piss piss boy after seeing that shit post. You there. Hold on. Hmm? Me. Fortune telling, huh? I really don't care. Sorry, fortune telling doesn't interest me. Try someone else. I don't especially care to do your reading. I need some protection for myself. I wonder if her predictions are like oddly actually true. Hey, Olivia. Protection? What do you mean? You don't seem to be in any danger. I will be. Trouble's coming. My reading said as much. I'm going to be attacked. And soon. Daddy. Attacked? Indeed. 
A customer I read blames me for his woes and means to exact revenge. It's clear as day in my crystal ball. That's ridiculous. Fortune telling isn't real. Okay, shut up, Kiryu. You fucking you fucking bought a box of aha water. <laughs> what what things do you choose to believe in? You would be right more often than not, but I'm a fortune teller who can see the future. I'm never wrong. A fortune teller who's never wrong? Didn't I hear rumors about this woman? So, this is that fortune teller. Come now, look alive. My assailant is on his way. Don't worry, you'll be rewarded for protecting me. Oi. You lying hag! I found you at last! See? Right on time. Uh. Guess you were right. I paid a million yen and all you spouted was crazy bullshit that never happened. My girl laughed up your bullshit like it was gospel truth. She dumped me because of you. <laughs> all I did was tell her what I saw. You homeless and scrounging in a trash for half-eaten food. Hey, Philistine. Uh. Are you nuts? I've been buying up buildings like crazy. No way the money's going to run dry. Pick through garbage? Me? No one gets away with throwing dirt in my face. I'll teach you a lesson you won't forget. This is where you come in. You said there's a reward? Indeed. Of course. <laughs> What's going on with this side quest? <laughs> hey, cool it. You're trying to beat up an old woman. No wonder your girl left you. Hey, yo, kill you. <laughs> He's too right. Who the hell are you? Her bodyguard? I'll just have to beat your ass first. Alright. That pointing. I love the I loved it. Kitty got a point. He's always right. Oh, oh dude, you were weak weak. <laughs> Damn it! Get lost. Thanks for that. I didn't expect you to be able to predict that. <laughs> didn't I tell you? I'm a fortune teller who can see the future. Now, do you believe? No, I don't believe in that sort of thing. <laughs> Such a close-minded man. But no matter, I'll read your fortune as my thanks for saving me. Daddy. Hey, happy rogue. Read my fortune. Indeed. It would usually set you back a million yen, but for just this once, I'll forego my fee. You should be grateful. Mm. Fortune telling is bogus, but it could be interesting. She's offering, so maybe I'll give it a try. Get a reading. Sounds interesting. I'll give your fortune telling a try. <laughs> it will be fun reading your fortune. I can tell already. Come, let's begin. First, your hands, let me see. What? You're not using your crystal ball? Shush, hurry while the stars are aligned. Uh, okay. <laughs> let's see now. <laughs> POV, Kiryu has you in a choke code. <laughs> I thought so. Such lovely hands. The sort of strong hands I'd want wrapped around me. Back off! <laughs> Back off! He's ours! Oh, oh, lady, does this have anything to do with my fortune? <sighs> oh, shush. I have a thing for hands. I'm doing your ring for free, so the least you can do is let me indulge. I don't exactly have time to burn, lady. Would you mind getting to the reading? <laughs> fine, fine. So impatient. So tell me, which thread of fate shall I unravel? My future, my family, my career. <laughs> um, family, huh? <laughs> well, yeah, let's see. How many kids are you gonna have, Kitty? This is like a mash. Okay. How about telling me about my family? <laughs> Very well. Let us look at your family. Yeah. I see. I see. Her real father. Ah, to atone for what you have done. Atone for what I've done? Wrestling a viper in Okinawa. Wrestling in Okinawa? I have seen it. 
Uh, <laughs> I like to, I, I know that the game devs are crazy enough. That's probably something happened in a future game. <laughs> Don't spoil it for me, though. I have seen it. When it comes to you and your family, the picture is complicated. Okay, so tell me about it. This, I can tell you. A child is with you. Oh my god, Empreg Kiryu? A child? I have a kid with me? Indeed, you do. This child trusts you above all others. Is it my kid? Oi. Hey, don't clam up. Shush. I told you it's complicated. You could claim it as your own and would be justified in doing so. If you said the child was not yours, this too would be correct. Hmm, hmm that is complicated. <laughs> it gnaws at you, does it? A hint, then. I'll grant you a hint in the form of a short quiz. You have a child, one you love. If you had to, what price would you put on that child? Put a price on a kid. Children, 10 billion yen, 1 million yen. Children are priceless. We gotta go with the priceless line. There's no way I could put a price on anyone, kid or otherwise. <laughs> so very true. A person's value is not measured in money. But you disappoint me. <laughs> what the fuck? Are we about to fucking deck an old lady? <laughs> What's with the battle music? <laughs> I disappointed you. Putting a price on people is wrong. Even a fool knows that. So why bother getting so high and mighty about it? So disappointed in you. Uh, sorry? I'll have you know this. You're going to raise eight kids. Daddy. Eight kids? And that's a huge family. Is this some kind of joke? What can I say? You will be like a dragon among daddies. <laughs> He's gonna be a what? <laughs> Oh my god! Oh, dragon Daddy! Oh, what's that supposed to mean? You're just messing with me, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> I only told you what I saw. You'll see. You'll, uh, you'll see too. Mark my words. My, look how hot under the collar you are. Didn't you say you don't believe in fortune telling? <laughs> I'm going to be raising eight kids. That can't be possible. What's going to happen to me? Oh, oh, okay, we get to do all of them. Nice. My future. Okay, my future then. What's in my future ten years from now? <laughs> ten years, you say? Uh. Yeah. So? <laughs> I see it. I see it. Shouldering blame for another sin. <laughs> A heavy burden to bear. And in the end, the millennium. The millennium puzzle. <laughs> What's happening? The Millennium. I saw it. But you were behind bars most of the time. So it's unavoidable. Mm -hmm. You're oddly calm about that. Mm. <laughs> eh, doesn't come as any great surprise. Hey, Princess Ratchmilk. By the way, you're locked up 15 years from now, too. Daddy. What? Still? Th that's a pretty long stretch. What did I do to get that? You murdered a man, Kiryu! <laughs> if I were to spoil all there is to tell, your life would be a drudgery. But I'll grant you a hint in the form of a little quiz. Your closest friend is in peril. You and you alone can take their place and accept their fate as your own. Hey, Tio Django! What do you think you would do? I'm the only one who can take the place of a friend in trouble? I would. Make them take responsibility. Try to solve it with money. <laughs> uh, I feel like Kiryu would take his friend's place. <laughs> Kiryu would 100% take his friend's place. I'm the only one who can save them. Of course I'll do whatever it takes, even if it's taking the fall for them. I suppose you would. You wouldn't be able to stop yourself from helping your friend. Does that have something to do with me ending up behind bars? That's... You will find out for yourself. But I'm relieved. If you hadn't chosen your friend, all this could be for naught. All for naught? What are you talking about? <laughs> didn't you say you don't believe in fortune telling? Ugh. Close friend. Could that be Nishiki? That is like your only friend. <laughs> Not a bad guess, Kiryu. <laughs> You're one friend. Well, now. We've dwelled on that matter enough. My career. Mm. Tell me about my career, then. <laughs> Your career, is it? 
I see it. I see it. Oh, oh, oh. There is turmoil. Ah, is that the city of Fukuoka? Fukuoka? Someone running out of a concert. A concert? Ah, oh, I saw you driving a car. I was driving? Maybe I'm driving one of those senior officers somewhere. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're not surprised by that? Then let me ask you. What do you think you will do for a living? I will be working as an aide, a driver, the prime minister. <laughs> I'm going straight for prime minister, baby. <laughs> I would vote for Kiryu. <laughs> Maybe the prime minister. I could be setting a course for the nation as I drive my agenda forward. <laughs> prime Minister, THE Prime Minister, you say. This day and age, no one feels afraid to speak their mind. Perhaps the people do need a wake-up punch in the teeth from a man like you with such strong hands. If you get elected, you better make this country better. Promise me. <laughs> if you vote for me, you can count on it. <laughs> now, what made you decide to go all comedian on me? <laughs> Why she's so bad all the time? I don't need your mocking. I'll end this ring now if that's going to be your attitude. I, uh, sorry. I, I wasn't trying to be funny. Goodness gracious. You can sow the wild seeds of giddy hope, but you would reap a lie and nothing more. This is the truth. You become a taxi driver. Uh, alright. Daddy? Wait. A taxi driver? What do you mean? You'll get no more from me. A jester deserves nothing more than to be the punchline of his own pitiful joke. But, but... <laughs> oh, you don't believe in fortune-telling anyway, right? Heh <laughs> Talk about blowing smoke up someone's ass. There's no way a prophecy that crazy could become true. It's a load of bull. It has to be. Oh, I can't wait to play Taxi Driving Simulator in a future Yakuza game. <sighs> That's a lot to take in. What am I going to get myself into? <laughs> Tired, are you? All I did was tell you what I saw. Don't think ill of me. <laughs> Doesn't bother me. I don't believe in fortune telling after all. Even if I did, you can't expect me to believe I'll be a cab driver in Fukuoka and living with a gang of kids in Okinawa. <laughs> no, no, I suppose not. You can believe or not. That choice is yours, at least. Well, that was an interesting way to kill time. Thanks. <laughs> Take care. Ah, yes. I'll give you one parting gift. One more vision. Today, a young man will speak to you. Your fate and his will be entangled. <laughs> Blowing smoke again. I told you, I don't believe in fortune telling. <laughs> Defiant to the end. But perhaps that's what makes you a legend. Legend? <laughs> oh, just spouting nonsense. Farewell. Someday you'll know just how right I was. Uh, I'll see about that. See ya. God, she was pro she probably nailed everything, huh? Still a taxi driver? A cutie is gonna be a taxi driver? Fortune telling. Heh. <laughs> what a load of hocus pocus. Oh, oh, it's it's a, it's a, it's a pants scrapper. <laughs> it's him. Oh, yo, pal, watch where you're stepping. Uh, yeah, sorry. Guess school trips ain't bad once in a while. So, this is Kamurocho. All this grit and glitter, what a town. Mm. Yeah, that fucking elementary school kid who looks like a fucking grown man. What was up with that guy? She said a guy who talks to me would have something to do with my fate. Oh, I can't wait to see him again! Me and that guy? Not likely. Oh, that was sub-story number one. Numero uno. Man, Kiryu's story is wacky from start to finish, huh? Can't wait. Alright, business is probably done, right? It's usually the time it takes to do one sub-story. Is there a taxi? Oh, damn it, we're just gonna have to run across town. Dude, farming this business is the worst. Kiryu's bizarre adventure. <laughs> Majima is the stand. I see it. It's all connecting. Come on, Kiryu, you can make it. Ugh. Ugh, I have to take a little break, huh? Any hey, restaurants one away? No, I already ate there before. 
Oh, who are you guys? Goons? Who's goons? <laughs> Jesus Christ, with a traffic cone, can you? Holy shit, man. Yeah, grab that weapon. That's what I've been trying to do. Oh shit, three for. Stomp! Oh, it's just a wooden sword. This isn't like a real sword. Ugh. Or like the dude from Yu Yu Hakusho. The dude with the plasma sword. Dude, what are we doing? Holy shit, what are we doing? How are you missing this bad? Ah, uh, wheel. Oh god, I always forget that you have to sometimes smash circle. Hey, come here. 200 enemies in brawler style. Oh, you get it for changing styles? I didn't know that. I think that's the first one we got here. Sorry, sorry. I'm trying to get to my business. You get it. Important real estate stuff. Can we hire the fortune teller? Oh, oh, we can! Oh, shit! I knew I'd see you again if I waited here. Oh, hey, you're that fortune teller I met before. Do you want something? Let's just say fate brought us together. I have foreseen myself helping you with your business. What do you mean, fate? Guess I could use some help, though. <laughs> Good. The matter's settled. I'll be seeing you. I wonder what she... Oh, okay. Having any entertainment? With my powers of prognostication, there's no question that your fortunes will soon be looking up. <laughs> I still don't really believe in that stuff, but I appreciate your help. Miracle? Miracle. I have no clue. I don't think I have. Oh, Mr. President, we've reached a 30% share of the Pleasure King's area. That's great. The Pleasure King. That's the most skiller one in the dress, Hi. right? Yes, that's the billionaire who controls the area around Pink Street. He made his fortune on telephone clubs and other adult-oriented businesses. I have not gone bowling in a while. We need to we need to take a break to do some side stuff instead of just hurrying through the story and doing only uh only the real estate. I'm dying. A woman's soul inside a man's body. Maybe he found success because he understood what both men and women want. Mm. Understanding the desires and instincts of men and women. That probably enabled him to figure out how to stimulate uh, uh, people's prostates, desires, and profit from it. Mm. Someone who converts biz desire into business, huh? Impressive. Mm. Yes, he certainly is impressive, but he seems to be engaged in fairly nasty business as well. Ripping off customers is a given, and he buys and sells the girls who work at his businesses. I haven't heard anything good about his business practices. I also heard about girls disappearing the next day after getting into an argument with the Pleasure King. And that does sound suspicious. Is he connected to any criminal organizations? That area is full of hooligans from back in the day, but it seems the Pleasure King controls them now. After spreading around money and providing women, they now do his bidding without question. I see. So the Pleasure King basically has those hooligans by their wallets and their balls. <laughs> Gotta give them credit for understanding what makes a men tick. <laughs> uh, ahem. I have very few managers and, and security people, so I think I've done something wrong where I didn't do enough sub-stories yet. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. There's no doubt he's a tough opponent. I have no clue what he's going to do, but please be careful. Uh. Will do. The Pleasure King. Someone who harnesses desire for the sake of business. This won't be easy. Kitty says that about everything, though. Pleasure King is ours. For sure, for sure. Anything we level up? Anything left? Guess this area is done. Yeah, go. Yeah, I'm gonna do every sub-story, but I really hope the game keeps track of the list because I have not been keeping track. Sachiko, come on, you're so powerful. If the game doesn't keep track, I don't know what to do. I have no clue what I will do. Oh damn, Fortune Teller is actually kind of good. 
Actually, she's kind of insane. Like, I feel like I should use her for everything. She even costs the most, and I feel like that's with good reason. But I feel like this guy might be better because he's double circle. Damn, she costs a lot, but she's she's actually worth it. And then food. Finally. Oh shit, I'm out of money. <laughs> I'm out of money. I didn't think that this would be a problem. Oh, she was too expensive. I shouldn't have been so greedy. <laughs> Come on, Sunio, you can do it! You can do it! You're powerful! You make that back in 45 minutes? <laughs> Top dog, don't, don't say it like this. I'm dying, Pekko. I'm dying, Pekko. I can't do this. Why is everything so expensive? Last one is this one. All right, you guys need to. You guys need some replacements up in here. Okay, there we go. <laughs> this take this grind takes so long. Yeah, I prefer to cabaret club because I was actually doing stuff. If you encounter a sub story, you can check the next step in the menu. I did not know that. What is in the menu? Oh, it tells you what you're missing. That's pretty nice. Wow. Cool. Go do all the karaoke twice. Are you telling <laughs> for uh, for activities? All right, where's the bowling alley? Let's go bowling. I'm really bad at this, you guys. Actually, I'm bad at most of these mini games. Especially pool. I can't tell you how much we appreciate you joining us, Ida Gun. Hmm? I'm grateful and honored to hear that, sir. I'll give it my all. Good, good. That's the spirit. I'm glad we decided to hire some new staff this year and that someone as qualified as you applied. Hiring new staff, huh? We're still short-staffed, among other things. Posting job openings, uh, posting job openings might help. Huh. Okay. I guess we're posting opportunities. Nice. She need to go to a little open area near the Western Rice Bowl place. Is this the what Rice Bowl place? You mean a beef bowl place? Beef bowl? Baseball? Hey. I thought you'd never come. Something wrong? Oh, don't tell me you forgot. The challenge has already started. I vaguely recall you saying something about that. So, what kind of challenge is it? Get a turkey while you're bowling with us and win an amazing prize. What's a turkey, you guys? Turkey. That was three strikes in a row, right? Thanks, kid, you. <laughs> Three strikes in a row. Oh shit, dude, we're gonna be here all night. Hi. Yes, that's it. And what's the prize? A turkey. So you get a turkey for a turkey? Precisely. Someone thought it'd be very funny. It's me, I think it's very funny. <laughs> Bow a turkey and get a delicious turkey to eat. It's perfect for the Christmas season. To be honest, I've never had turkey before. What? Are you serious? That crispy skin, that juicy meat, nothing beats a plump bird roasted to perfection. You've been missing out big time. Roast turkey is the best. She made it sound so good. Now I really want to try it. Alright, in that case, I'm up for the challenge. I knew you would be. I hope you do get a turkey in both meanings of the word. Alright, let's do it. Uh, can I do it solo? Yeah, $5 is pretty reasonable. Yeah, Christmas in Japan is all about fried chicken, liquid break. Uh, 10 frames gives me more opportunities to do this. Mm -hmm. 
All right, okay, fuck. That's so cool! Adonis Gifter, thank you so much for gifts up to Glarficus. Thank you, thank you. Okay, so you guys say to the left a little bit. Uh, let's go for the heavy tank. Go for full power. Let's adjust a little bit for um, the fact that I fucking sucked at aiming. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> this one motherfucker just to cuck me. Just to cuck me, and now I'm never gonna be able to hit it because it's just one thing. Ah, shite. Hmm. Just get that one dude. Yeah. Hey, Salty Watch. God, guys, how are we gonna get three in a row? This seems impossible. Hiya! I am going to throw a goddamn fit. <laughs> I am about to, like, wreak havoc on this place. You ever see a bowling ball go into the ceiling? Maybe two. Nope, should've gone with one. Fuck! Bold queen. Oh, this is so hard. I don't get it. I just don't understand how to bowl, I guess. I feel like I'm doing everything right mechanically, and yet I am fucked up. Huh. Do it! Give me a str- Why?! I swear to god they glue down those two pieces just to fuck with me! Uh-oh. This is not good. Welcome back, Abel. Mm. Come on, come on, yeah! No, fuck! Too, many, too much spin, too much spin. <laughs> Almost salvaged it, okay. How are we going to, you know what? Heavy tank has to be the answer here, right? Right? Give it a bit of a spin. Mm. Oh, thank god, a strike! Yes. Thank god, a strike! Okay, we just have to do that three in a fucking row. Uh-oh, not enough power. Hmm. Two in a row! Baby, just need to get a third one. Uh-oh. I'm throwing. I'm throwing. Huh. God damn it! <laughs> Piece of shit. Now, now how are we gonna do this? I don't even think we have enough sets left. No, we do. I think. Fucking, just give me the gutter ball. How hard can you salvage this? Huh. Can't. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. Guys! They robbed me. They robbed me. Hmm. Fuck. Should've done three there. I apparently get something for doing well in bowling. <laughs> we get a turkey! Alright, we're, we're, we're gonna leave this now. Can we leave early? Yeah, let's get- then we'll start another ten sets. So, Cause we have to get three in a row. And we're out of tries now. Why the tank though? It's so fast mm -hmm. when you're aiming. Well, I assume it's heavier so it knocks over the stuff better. That's what I assume, at least. There's no reason for it to make it harder than you with no, like, benefits. And my biggest problem is, like, I can aim for the center and it still won't knock stuff mm. over. The lighter balls work just fine. Yes. Is I use a straight... <laughs> so you guys want me to use a, this one just go... Ah, uh, that did not work, dude. Mm. Fuck. 
Sasha and Quinn tell the final throw. Why? Hmm. Well, then this doesn't fucking work at all. This was a terrible idea. Oh, what if I just do like this? Huh. Not enough curvy. Probably because... Actually, I think the curving is better for the heavier balls. Alright. Vote ban. What is this? TF2 rules? Do you control the spin? I do. I do a little bit of a spin control. Get the fucking. Are you fucking serious? They must glue it down. I'm certain of it. <laughs> Those bastards must do this. That fucking son of a bitch. They really must just glue that. Those two in on the left, I feel like they glue it down. Just to fuck with me. The turkey is the one who glues it. Yeah. <laughs> Shut up, Sabrata. Ray, you do like my dick and oh. hang left. <laughs> Yo. Uh, maybe three. This one be like one or two. Probably two. I'll go with one. Huh. <sighs> I'm not fucking shit up, okay? It's this game. The game is just insulting me. Save for real bowling. <laughs> I went to a bowling place once, I think, a long time ago. But it wasn't real bowling. It was like tiny, tiny bowls. Mm. Wow! Mm. I'm insulted. The music's kind of popping off, though. Do you hear that? Yeah, we would get three strikes, man. I don't think that's gonna fucking happen, but... Hey, I got two in a row. Fuck the power, I fucked it up. There's always just one. There's just, there's always just one. <laughs> I'm, I'm reacting maturely, I promise. <laughs> Stop howling! Stop laughing at me! <laughs> mm. I hate bullying! You. Oh. Mm. Come on, we just need several strikes. Why is there always just one that wants to cuck me so bad? Uh, <laughs> I just want to annihilate that one pin. Go, kid, you <laughs> fucking kill it. Damn. <laughs> uh, I think I should probably reset. Fucking, I guess we'll restart. I guess we'll, we'll fucking restart. How? I don't know. I generally think the game's just cucking me a little bit. I don't know. It's always just one, one straggler ruining this for me. Dude, I would rather be doing wee bowling right now. <laughs> wee bowling was superior. 
That's so unreal. Oh, dude, I just have really bad luck. Does less power help? I can't imagine how it would be. At least I can throw it to the crowd. <laughs> I've seen a video where somebody was at a bowling alley and they threw it into like the ceiling. It made me like laugh. I'm just gonna try throwing it straight on next time and seeing what happens. I'm just gonna try it. All right. Huh. Damn! It's even it's just just one. Is there? How, what did I do? <laughs> just one. This is the worst way to throw a ball. Don't do it like this, just so you know. Anyway, can we save it? <laughs> huh. <laughs> Launching a ball into the TV above the lane, the chaos. Ram Ram, welcome on my ghost lane. Thank you for four months. Welcome, welcome back. Impressive ball control, Rayu. Gotta give it a 10 out of 10, Rayu love. Thank you, Ram and Ram, even though this game is shitting on me right now. Mm. Me too, it's too much there. Mm. 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 I'm being insulted by the game, man. Uh. <laughs> I'm going insane a little bit. I, I, I need to go turn my AC up. <laughs> Thank you for five bits, straight Crimson Lionheart. Shirtless Men Simulator is the best. Go Team Majimo. Mm. <laughs> you know Majima himself will be on Team Kiryu, though. Okay, go, 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 go. Why does bowling suck? Huh. Fuck! <laughs> you piece of shit! Just fall! Oh my god, you only get good. Shut up, dude! I'm, I am, I'm landing these shots. This is like shooting a head- like a headshot and doing 99 damage. Yo. For the side, I'm gonna fucking lose it. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking lose it. Fuck! <laughs> Why is it always one piece of shit pin just- here to tease me. What is going on? Huh. The consistency. Oh my god. Hmm. So you say it's going right and aiming straight, but with enough spin so it hits between a one and three pin, and the ball carries itself in a middle pin. Okay. Going right. Shooting straight. What the hell is one and three? Hmm. Maybe I gave too much spin there. Dude, I, <laughs> I think I executed your plan to perfection, and I, I still can't get these fucking pins to go down. Hmm. Fuck. Mm, okay, let's keep trying. We can do this. I don't know. I don't know what I need to change up. This time we're gonna go further, like as far as I can, and I'm gonna go straight for the middle. I'm not gonna spit, I'm just gonna see what happens. Huh. And I, I, they, I, dude, I, I swear to you, I, I swear somebody is coming in and they are gluing down one random pin each fucking time to fuck with me. <laughs> I am not joking, I think this is what's happening here. <laughs> I got a rigged version of Yakuza 0 that somebody pre-hacked to it just inconvenience me. Yo. Oh, oh, oh god, what's going on, man? Alright, we're going straight for it. It's gonna hit that middle pin. 
And what happens after, I cannot control. Yes. This time we got a strike. That was our 10th strike of all time. I want to know, nine of the strikes we got happened today. Hmm. That's my fault. I didn't give enough spin to that. I own up to this. I'm ghost enough to admit it. Uh... Mm. Guys, this sucks. <laughs> I could be playing Hades right now. <laughs> I'm going insane. I'm going insane. If only chat voted for Hades. Mm. You know what? I'm just a slave to the pins. <laughs> exactly. Next thing is right. Remember, chat, you wanted this. <laughs> this is what you wanted. Play solo. Let's go ahead and do. I would be 100% more interested in doing this if I could somehow invite Majima to play with me. Give me that 10 frames. As many choice, as many chances I can get. Ah, shut up, Sabretta. You were, you weren't even here to vote for the game. <laughs> How dare you try to own to the punishment that others stole out? Yikes. Just a bit of spin to the left, maybe. Mm. Imagine that might make you miss the middle pin. My fault. Dude, I swear the pins are just falling in a random way to perfectly evade each other. Oops. Dude, what? How, how, how would a homie even, like, fix this right now? I guess he would hit the five and pray that it nicks the other one. Hey, Gemini Frank. Hmm. Ugh, missed it. Okay, okay, come on. Come on, we can do it. 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 Just go straight through, ball. Go. Go for that. Oh, thank God. Thank God. Thank God this time it decided to be go easy on me. Fuck, that's my fault. Should have given it two spins. Uh, I don't even want to try, but it's fine. Let's see, maybe this one will be two spins. Maybe not. Maybe it's only one spin. Nope, it's two spins. <laughs> God! God, you just hate me. You just hate me, don't you, you stupid bowling pins, you piece of shit bowling pins. <laughs> ah! Okay, it's fine. Yeah, Jing, what happens if I just go full spin on the left here? Perfect. Yo. Oh, whoops. Uh-oh, can't back out. Mm. All right, spin, save it, save it, go spin, yeah! Let's go spin! <laughs> Maybe this is a strat here. <laughs> Do it again, no, dude. I, that was a one-time thing. Huh. Go, 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 go! Yeah! All right, one more. Come on, just one more. Come on, you can do it. You can do it, cutie! You're big! You're sexy! Huh. Come on! Fuck! <laughs> yeah, I keep getting robbed, dude. I, I swear to god, it is just RNG fucking me in the ass. Okay, dude. That fucking sucks. Just, just die, Kiryu. Let me go. Let me try again. 
Don't say Ray, you please! Ask if I can do anything to change this! I can't! The game is just fucking me in the ass, man! I don't know what to tell you! Huh. It's, I'm fucking hitting it from the middle pin, alright? Ray, you difficulty. I haven't done anything! I'm not adding challenges to this! <laughs> Stupid bullying! We need to get three strikes in a row. <laughs> I thought the ass fucking was what this chat was about. Not my ass! It's supposed to be your ass, homie! Well, it's supposed to be Kiryu's ass. <laughs> No, I'll say four spin. Four spin. For your four skin. Bam! Guys, I'm getting I'm becoming the spinning master. <laughs> it's a useless skill, but I'm starting to understand these spins. Psych. A spin user. Man, this sucks. Alright, I'm just gonna quit this one and try it again. This really blows. All right, what's the cheese, you guys? I don't want to be here all night doing this and getting cocked by the RNG over and over. <laughs> Do you need a bigger curve? We'll be here all night. I will not be having fun playing bowling all night. I will be sitting here resentfully being like, I could be playing Hades. I could be playing anything that isn't this. Oh, so cool. Oops. Mm. <sighs> Just one, huh? Just one little piece of shit every time. Mm. <laughs> Just one. <laughs> How does this happen? How does this happen to us? Mm. It's Majima. He's coming in and gluing down these pins preemptively. Yo. Huh. <laughs> okay, thank God. <laughs> thank a fucking God. Hmm. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. <laughs> why? Seriously, why? It really is just a random hmm. way the pins fucking fall sometimes. Alright. Uh, let's see. Uh, Pete says 10 ball. Oops, I already moved from center. I assume the center two steps right. <laughs> One and three straight. Like, just go straight? Oops. Well. Mm. Knock it over! Knock it over, you piece of shit! I can't believe this. You can literally see the gravity system trying to figure out if it is spinning it, like tossing a fucking coin in the air and being like, are we going to knock it over or are we just gonna fuck with her? <laughs> Who fucking knows? I'm just being fucked in the ass, man. All right, all right. So you say two steps, go straight. Huh. This is so sad. I like to play Despacito. Uh, this, uh, the, 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 Guys, I can't do this anymore. Oh, I hate this. I hate bullying. <laughs> this is entertaining as fishing to me, and both are very not entertaining. You.
Mm. Set an alarm for eight hours. How? Like, seriously? <laughs> seriously, what's going on? Did I piss off some god today? What did I do? Huh. Nah, it's gonna gut her. Oh, no, it's not. Lucky. Hmm. What the fuck is going on? It's my luck, man. I'm gonna be telling you guys I have really bad luck. Literally, the physics system itself is now hmm. taking place in that luck. Okay. That one pin is mocking me. It's spinning a little in place, even. Lias ball, move all the way to the left, hit circle really quickly. Once to start direction, once to stop it. By fast, I mean tap, tap. Alright, so the cheese is to go super light. By spin. Ah, uh, I see. It's a cheese. cheese can work for me that that one pin has to be fucking glued down just to fuck with me and nobody else no one else has to go through this excruciating pain except me for some reason <gasps> why what did i do you did it wrong what did i do wrong kusalan Go, red ball, go. Bonk. Okay. <laughs> All right, what I do wrong that time? Okay. All right, what would I do wrong? Tell me, tell me with words what you saw just happen. Huh. Fuck, I put too much spin into that one. No, I'm just very supremely unlucky. It's a shame you didn't get a turkey. In any case, I'll see you again. All right, I am I am too dedicated to this craft to not do this. Psych, I don't want to play with you anymore. I changed my mind. Never mind, thanks. <laughs> All right, let's do it again. Come on, cutie. Come on, you're sexy. You can't let this bowling ball get uh, ruin you. Oh, so cool. I would watch that in animation a million times. Alright, so the cheese is to go here. You go... Ba -ba, and then you go close to 100. Or 100. You go... Shwing. Yeah, you know what? Fuck this. <laughs> I'm executing your cheese to perfection. I literally just can't catch a goddamn break. I just can't! The game itself has decided fuck Rayu in particular! Hmm. I can't do this. Dude, I'm just gonna try this with the heavy ball and see what happens to us. Just go straight. Brother, I'm not winning. I'm miserable. Alright. So I'm just gonna have to adjust for it. I should have added one more spin. Mm. Oops, too much spin. Look at that curvature. I have masturbated to an extra curly trajectory the other day. Uh, oop. Maybe one spin. Maybe two spin. Mm. Use your force powers that don't exist. <sighs> Sometimes I feel
feel like the physics system itself has decided to forsake me. Well, Castle, I, 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 I am now the VTuber going through it. He moved the pins. I fucking would. I, I, I ready to watch a grown man just suddenly clamber on top of the roof, <laughs> on top of this slippery surface, just knock over some pins. Huh. How did you avoid it so perfectly? Like, like there was like three pins that headed towards the left direction, and none of them hit these. Uh oh. In tonight's stream, watch Rayu lose her mind. I would rather be doing a Dark Souls boss over and over because at least it'd be more entertaining than this. <laughs> I'm literally just... I feel like I'm just inputting variables into a spreadsheet. I hate this. Oops. Hmm. Rigged. It's just so rigged. I can't tell you how rigged it is. <laughs> you don't believe me. You don't believe me that it's rigged, but it's rigged. You, you see this with your very eyes, don't you? We have the bot as evidence. <laughs> your honor, <laughs> tap my nuts. <laughs> it's insane. It's insane. I feel like I'm going fucking... I'm being gassed by Yakuza Zero right now. Hmm. It was rigged from the start, Your Honor. Uh oh, this is actually pretty bad. Mm. No, too. Oops. Too late. Oh, it still worked. Yes. Congratulations! And that's what happens when I don't hold back. And the special prize for customers who get a turkey is an actual turkey. Here comes my delicious turkey. Hi. So I won't keep you waiting. Here's your turkey. Ta-da! Chicken, though. Mmm, <laughs> a turkey with a crispy skin, juicy inside. A plump bird roasted to perfection. It's a bit fresher than I thought. <laughs> Thank you, Roger Bisberry J. <laughs> Kitty, are you man enough to kill this turkey with your bare hands? <laughs> Oh, yes. Well, we didn't specify when we ordered it, and this is what they sent us. And it's not even a turkey. It's a chicken. Look at it. Oh my, you're absolutely right. How did that happen? Oh, come on. What am I supposed to do with a live chicken? I'm terribly sorry. The least I can do is cook it for you. We've got a, chi a kitchen in the back. It's fried chicken, okay? You're going to cook it now? Hi. Yes, so you'll at least get a meal out of it. But that means you have to kill this bird. <laughs> Guys, this is amazing. Q 
Hideo's eyes is tracking his, like, chin ball sack. Look at it. Look at this. This is not one of those things where Kiryu stares into, like, space and not staring at, like, anything. His eyes are tracking the ball sack. <laughs> you can see the subtle shift in his head as he follows along. <laughs> He's hypnotized. He sees it. It's swaying. <laughs> But that means you have to kill this chicken. That's no problem. I grew up on a poultry farm. Oh, you did. No, wait. Give me a minute to think about it. I want to keep it. Mm. What? You're going to keep it? As a pet? Uh. Is that not allowed? Yeah. No, it's fine, but I thought you wanted it cooked. You know, a juicy roast chicken with a crispy skin? <laughs> well, I can have that some other time. Um, okay then. This is your chicken now. Congratulations. Hello, chicken. Your name will be... Nuggets. <laughs> tracking a ball sack. It's still tracking it. <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> Nugget has joined your team as a manager. As a manager? Let's go, Nugget. I had to pay my chicken $3,000 to run my fucking business. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck you mean I have to pay him $3,000? Thank you for 100 bits, Barry J. Random thug, look out! It's a legendary dragon key to you and his legendary pet, Nugget! <laughs> oh, God. Did he just push me? Hey. Oh! 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 Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, jeez! Uh, holy shit, Kiryu! Oh my god, what's wrong? Do the thing! Spin the homie around! Make him kick his own buddies! It's what they deserve! are kind of beefy. Or maybe I'm running I'm falling behind in damage. Because I haven't leveled Q to you in a long time. That's my fault. Hey man. Hey man, calm down for a second. I'm trying to do a new heat move or something. Hiya! Oh no, this is just a tr this is just the batting on. <laughs> How does it feel to be hit in the face with the Sichuan stew banner? This is easier than bowling. It really, really is. Oh, he's too strong. This is all my pent-up rage from fucking bowling. What's the event here? Is it us doing advertisement? It is. I'm so glad we have Nugget on our team. Oh, Mr. President, I'm sorry. Could you get the phone? Do you fucking see Marina right now? She isn't fucking writing shit. She's not even looking at her notepad. She is literally just scribbling a random goddamn line on this notepad while making eye contact with me and not answering the phone that is right next to her. <laughs> she's that good? Hold on, I don't think she's that good. I think she's fucking with me. Uh. <laughs> don't give me the other point of view. It's a goddamn crossway puzzle. She's not even filling it out right. <laughs> <laughs> sure. <laughs> <I'm fired. laughs> 
Hello? Greetings, Kiryu-kun. Mm -hmm. That voice. And the electronics king, what do you want? Are you free? I'd love to hang out and play a game with you. Take me to the arcade one more time and I am uninstalling Yakuza 0. <laughs> you make me do that goddamn card game again and I am not going back. I'm not looking back at this goddamn game. <laughs> again? Games are so much more fun when you're playing against someone. Come on, humor me. I'm at my base, okay? I'll be waiting. Better not be the goddamn arcade again. It better not be the goddamn arcade. Was that by any chance the Electronics King? Uh. Yeah. He wants me to play a game with him. Mm. I wonder what that means. Please uh. be careful. Yeah. What's he mean by game? I've got a bad feeling about this. Better make sure I'm ready before heading out. Ba -ba -bum. The arcade game isn't even that bad. Bro, I, 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 the arcade game has wounded me. My soul is not the same after all of the times that OutRun has violated my ears. Alright, you guys say there's some kind of miracle next to the beef bowl place. Here? Nope. Guess not here? How's it going, funny kangaroo? Oh. Uh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my gosh. Hmm? Wait, you're kidding, right? Come on, tell me you're kidding. Uh? Come on, just tell me. What are they talking about? Uh. Oh my god. It's like you and I watch news from different planets, I swear. Okay, I'll take pity on ya. Prepare to be enlightened. <laughs> the pop star Prince is coming here to Kamurocho. Is he coming to piss on me? No way! Do you mean Miracle Johnson? <laughs> None other! It's unbelievable, yet 100% true! He's coming to Kamurocho to shoot a new <laughs> music video! Whoa! Miracle what now? Uh... Get this! He's supposedly in Japan already! Word on the street is that there's some kind of problem though! Doesn't matter! I'll get Miracle's autograph no matter what! I want to see him too. I hope that he solved the problem so they can start filming soon. That's why I've been hanging out here and keeping my eyes open. Some of the production staff could already be nearby. I guess some global star named Miracle is here, and his crew's run into some kind of problem. Whatever. All right. Uh, do I? Is he at my base for some reason? Is that what I'm seeing here? Also. Wait, no, wait. Where is the Electronics King? <laughs> Where is the Electronics King? Is he at the- Oh my god, please don't say it's a Sega. Is a Sega his base? I don't think my heart can take this. Uh, 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 god. I'm gonna go to Kanye. Guys. Oh my god, I have to go to the fucking arcade again. <laughs> fucking I can't do this anymore. <laughs> All right, let me eat real fast. I'm going insane. Here, here, drink some oolong tea, and then uh, eat whatever you need, Kiryu, to get full. I feel like I need to level up a little bit because I'm kind of behind on levels. I have a very weak Kiryu. Maybe beast mode a bit? Oh, I don't have enough money. Oh, I'm poor, man. I'm so poor. All right, fuck it, let's go. Where's the fucking arcade? Oh God, I hate this. I hate the arcade. It looks like those two dudes are like holding hands and they're like also twins. <laughs> Girl in a red dress, like we're in the Matrix right now. Become business game Kamurocho. Buy your way up through power leveling. If only I had money. I should have saved. Hi, Kitty Kun. Thanks for coming by. Shall we get started? Start what? <laughs> a fighting game, of course. It's got this radical action-packed PvP mode. Heh, <laughs> you mean an actual fight? I'm better at fighting in real life than in video games, so that sounds perfect. 
Are we going to bet anything this time? Yes, let's bet. All the properties that you and I own. Here's the deal. If you win, I give you all the properties in this area and log off the grid. If you lose, you give me all your properties. Sound fair? Just one catch. There's no guarantee that you'll still be alive if you lose. I may not look like much, but I'm strong. That's fine by me. I have no intention of losing either. <laughs> <laughs> you'll regret this. And you bring goons. What, we're not doing this one-on-one? -on -one? <sighs> That's how I would have preferred it, but unfortunately, I really have to make sure I win this time. You've put me in a tight spot. I never calculated that I, a super gamer with an IQ of 190, will be put against a wall by some two-bit gangster. Maybe I just don't have that much business acumen. Uh. Yeah, I agree. Hmm, it's really annoying when someone else says it. Well, anyway, <laughs> I can't make you just like, yeah, you suck. <laughs> I love him. Thanks for stealing my area. It was fun. But you know, you kind of went too far. I'm going to have to kill you and get it back. Huh? Remember, if you die in this game, you die in real life. <laughs> Let's see if you can survive. OP gave me 10 seconds. <laughs> Please. If you die in the game, Nugget dies too. No. <laughs> not, but I'm not my boy Nugget. All right, gonna bring this somewhere more favorable, and by favorable, I mean bike. Come on, man. Oh, God, so many of them at once. <sighs> Come on. Oh, it's hard being in beast mode for this. I gotta go. Oh god. What are you supposed to hold here? Kitty, get back up. What are we gonna do? What can I. Oh, okay, are there more bikes? Yeah, there's more shit to throw. <laughs> Let me just deal with your piece of shit posse, man. Adding the. Give it, putting the posse into posse, please. Are you guys okay? I know, I definitely need to spend more on Kiryu. <laughs> I've been too busy investing, dude. <laughs> I've been get I've been trying to get Kiryu into uh, NFTs. Dude, get your <laughs> get, your <laughs> get your dude off of me. Forgetting about that one. I need to remember the ones where Kiryu like breaks something over their head, uh, he can even smash buttons to do more. Ha! Ah, grab him by his stupid hair! Someone back into a standing position. Brutal. Come on. Ha! Ha! And I'm gonna stomp on. Oh wait, I missed. Yeah, let's go. Oh shit! Look at the blood. Oh, he's so cool. Oh my god. <sighs> A complete domination! <laughs> oh god! So cool! The blood only adds to his flavor! Poster check kicks you in the balls! <laughs> Come here, darling Dwyer, let me test it! <sighs> You've got some powerful specs there, cutie you could. <laughs> Shut up, don't call it specs! Yo, SMX, welcome all my ghosting! The interior runs up for 15 months! 
completely dominated for 15 months. Ah, oh, pegged for 15 months straight. How does your asshole feel? You want another round? Yeah. No. Uh, I've had enough. You win. I'm out. As of right now, I'm pulling out of this area to come to Ocho's money game. And you're all right with that? Yeah. I lost in business and got beat fighting, too. It really doesn't make sense for me to go on. E even if I did, you'll just continue to get better than me. All I did was grind for money to purchase more properties, but you devised a tactic to level up your business by micromanaging the time and resources you had available. <laughs> in video games, the player who comes up with his own unique strategy can beat even the most practiced players. Your playstyle evolved as you went, so it's only natural you'd win. I don't think I did anything out of the ordinary. I just did what I could. <laughs> Well, I still got beat. I set a financial high score by investing in tech stocks. Then I got into this money game. The people who would call me a nerd came to fear me as one of the five billionaires. I tried a lot of new things, but to tell you the truth, I'd rather play a game in arcade than, than sit around making billions of yen. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, nerd. <laughs> piece of shit. <laughs> Fucking piece of shit. <laughs> I think I'm more suited to being a gamer than a billionaire, okay? <laughs> I see. Cutie, you can. Let's play again sometime, but next time, no betting. Yeah. I'm not motivated to play when nothing's on the line. So, how about betting on who pays for dinner? Ah, oh, kitty! <laughs> I love him so much. <laughs> Sounds like fun. I've learned my lesson that I have zero talent at running a business. I'll go back to being a gamer, but you know, I'd still love to help you out. Just play some Reset here, Electronics King. You'll, you'll figure it out. I wish I could do more to help you, but I can't afford to be seen doing that. I need to lay low for a bit. First you say you don't want to be a billionaire, then you say you can't afford to do something. <laughs> Pick a lane, nerd. Why is that? Oh, uh, you're better off not knowing. Let's just say I've been betrayed. Uh. Let's just say I've betrayed five billionaires, so now friendly fire's activated. You can probably imagine what kind of danger a traitor like me would be up against. You watch yourself too, Kirikun. Uh, right. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Blocks have been unlocked for the rush style. New items have been opened on the ability screen. Additional upgrades are now available. Okay, for the rush style. How nice. How pog. All right, now I'm gonna go get my money. Where's Miracle Johnson? Is he, for some reason, inside our business? Oh, uh, actually, there's something more pressing to do. Uh, we need to go to that place to invest money back in, uh, what's it called? Majima. <laughs> I have never seen you sit in that chair in my life, and this is so awkward. Mm -hmm. Does he just sit there waiting for something to happen? <laughs> like, not a thought in his head, no TVs? <laughs> hmm, is that the phone? Did you make her- <laughs> Did she- she- Did he just sit there, like, staring at the phone while it rang until Marina came over to pick it up for him? <laughs> Kitty just staring at the phone like, ah, the phone's ringing. <laughs> Marina! Well, at least it's equal, equal after what she did to us. Yes, hello. Oh, our president. Please, hold on a moment. Mr. President, someone named Marui-san is asking for you. Marui? Don't know anyone by that name. <laughs> Hello. Hello, are you Kiryu-san, the president? Uh. Yes. And who might you be? I'm with the Criminal Investigation Department of the Regional Taxation Bureau. Hi. A tax inspector. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh no. I don't know how to do any of the taxes on all the money we stole. <laughs> Explain to the IRS where we got this money from. I got this from beating up guys on the street and taking their wallets. Money just flies out of them. Yes, are you familiar with us? Oh, I know that investigators from the Regional Taxation Bureau do all kinds of things go after tax cheats who can't be caught by normal audits. Yes, we go by Marusa. I'm surprised you've heard of us. Yeah, Kiryu sounds very, uh, very educated on this. Maybe because he speaks, he scared them. So, what does Marusa want with me? 
I'd love to have a chat with you, Kiryu-san. I'm thinking about dropping by in the near future. What do you mean by chat? I'll discuss things in more detail when we meet. Oh, and I have my hair in a bob. Please remember that so you can spot me when I visit. What's a bob? Like a hair bob. A ponytail? A tax investigator from Madusa. What does she want with me? <coughs> the tax lady? What's the matter, Mr. President? Are you okay? Hmm. Uh, yeah, no problems here. At any rate, a woman with a bobbed haircut is going to come from the Regional Taxation Bureau. Guess I'll find out what she wants when I talk to her. Doom, doom, doom. Alright, grab this, grab that. I'm not gonna use a fortune teller lady even though she's so amazing, just because she costs a lot. Pleasure King, stop! Stop, you just keep taking money! Slowly taking over that region too. Any level up here? Nope. And looks like security is a-okay. Alright. Ugh, it's so tempting to use her, but I have to resist. Mm, what if I don't resist, though? No, I'll resist. I'll resist. It'll take us longer, but we're gonna be, like, milking this anytime. Anyway, I mean, money making time. Yeah, spaghetti. Over and over. <laughs> Come quite cats and asks. Kiryu can dodge punches, but can he dodge taxes? <laughs> I feel like it's his number one nightmare. You guys know, like, uh, Parks and Rec is actually a pretty funny Western show. And I'm saying this after complaining about having to watch The Office to fit in. <laughs> Parks and Rec was really good. There's a character in it named Ron Swanson, and he, like, lives off the grid, and him getting audited by taxes was hilarious. <laughs> You're just like, oh shit! The, the, the IRS! It's way better than The Office. I think so, too. I think, I think if, if for Western shows, Parks and Rec and Good Place are both really good. Like, actually good. Like, I know, I know most of you guys are probably weebs like me, so you're like, Ugh, why would I watch a Western show when I can watch an anime? And I agree. <laughs> no bullshitting you, I agree with that, but... But those are pretty good, and I don't regret watching them. <laughs> the man who kills me shall inherit all of my possessions. <laughs> Isn't that a sentiment that you feel, though? Yo, Ian, you have big PP energy. No, 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 not the fortune teller. She's, she will drain me fucking dry, the succubus. And <laughs> shut up, Barry. We finished the bullying arc of the anime. We don't have to go back anymore. So close to getting an S rank in that one. There go. Okay, I know you guys say that Kiryu can eventually make more money, but I, I just... Uh, oh, uh, the grind. Huh? Hmm? Huh? You're going really heavy on the blush, ma'am. What's that odd-looking woman doing? Is she checking out the office? Come to think of it, there was that call. A woman with bobbed hair is coming from the Regional Taxation Bureau. So that woman must be from the Investigation Department, Madusa. They're the taxation experts that investigate companies for tax evasion. She's one of them. Okay, Kiryu just said that like five times. Like it's fucking Cusco's poison. He's like, that's the tax evasion lady from the IRS Bureau. The the lady from who does taxes. <laughs> the, the, the tax lady from the the bureau lady from the taxes. <laughs> Kiryu, I got it the first goddamn time. <laughs> He's panicking. He's scared as fuck. God. It's okay. It's okay. We can't win every battle, kid. You. We might lose against Tax Lady. Oi. Hey, are you maybe? What is it? Are you uh, Madusa? Madusa. What do you mean by Madusa? That's definitely not it, kid. You. 
Oh, well, you, you have a bob haircut. You must be the woman who called me, aren't you? <laughs> Kitty, not everything's about you, shit! <laughs> Kitty, you fucking idiot! No, dude! <laughs> Clearly she is not the woman, Jesus! Huh? What are you saying? I'm not Marissa. My name's kind of close, but I'm hungry. I'm the one from Marusa, Kiru-san. You are? Thanks. Yes. Sorry for not introducing myself sooner. I'm Agent Marui of the Regional Taxation Bureau's Criminal Investigation Department, aka Marusa. So, you're the one who called me. You wanted me to talk to me about something? Yes, I was hoping to ask you something, Kiru-san. What's that? Kiru-san, I need your assistance in a delicate matter. What kind of assistance? You mean, Marusa needs help? Precisely. Kiru-san, have you had any dealings with your neighbor Makuro Enterprises in the office next door? No, uh, I didn't know the name of the business until now. Good. That's ideal. We're investigating Makuro Enterprises for tax evasion. Really? Tax evasion? Shh, keep it down. We were tipped off on Makuro's infraction by an informant who has dealings with them. Our source promises to deliver evidence to back it up, but then we lost all contact. Come on, Kiryu, we're not a snitch! Your source might have been silenced. Forever. <laughs> Holy shit, Kiryu! <laughs> Your source is fucking dead. I'm afraid so. I need to get the goods on Magrito Enterprises, but if I did it myself, Magrito might notice a stranger sniffing around and becoming suspicious. But, if you were seeing with me, his next door neighbor, your presence can be explained. That's why you want me to help with this. Nice. I couldn't put it better. You catch on fast. Yeah. I get the picture. But, I don't really have much of a stake in this. Nope, you're not obliged in any way. But, if you were to offer assistance, you won't regret it. In more ways than one, I would think. What's that supposed to mean? You're taking on the five billionaires, right? That's on top of figuring out how to run a business. Not too easy for you, is it? How do you know that? <laughs> I'm with Marusa, remember? That's nothing compared to the kind of information we work with. Here's the deal. Help me and I'll help you with your business. Not a bad deal, is it? You're serious? Yep. I know the industry inside out. My support's invaluable, wouldn't you say? True. So, decision time. Will you help me investigate Maguro Enterprises quietly? Agree to help. Uh. Fine. Tax evasion is a serious crime. I'll do my part for the good of society. <laughs> good. We have a deal. Why are we so intimately close to him? I can smell his aftershave. Hey, Marusa lady. Yes, Kiryu-san? By the way, I told you, my name is Marue. <laughs> Marue-san, you're, uh, kind of close. <laughs> it's a brilliant cover, though. By pretending to be a cover, we can loiter without arousing suspicion. I'm so jealous. Ah, it's a fake relationship premise. I love these fucking fanfics. Thank you, 100 Fist Guild, you're a wolf. Mm. Yeah, actually, it's glasses time. I forgot. Bam! Glasses time, baby. Uh, all right. Ah. Uh. Mm? What's the matter, Maruesan? Shh. Quiet. It's Magro. The head honcho for Magro Enterprises is coming. Hmm. Mm. <laughs> hey, he's staring at us. It's okay. We're just a couple on a date. Mm. Yes, but just go with it. Kiryu Ken, I love you. Huh? Hey, what gives all of a sudden? I don't love her. <laughs> Kitty, I know you're stupid, but how many? <laughs> I know you're dumb, but fucking keep up, Kitty. <laughs> I don't love her. <laughs> it's so funny. Play along, will you? We have to convince him we're a couple in love. Come on, Kitty san You need to perform. <laughs> Gaze at her ardently. Declare your love. Go in for a kiss. Let's, uh, let's. I, I, I can't choose! <laughs> Alright, we're going in for the kiss of homie. We're going in for the kiss of homie. Madara san, I. I 
can't hold it back anymore. What? Kiryu san? Oh, it's happening! It's happening! S stop that! Slow down, I'm not ready to take this step! Hey, Maru san! So, sorry. It's been so long since I've been with anyone. I didn't need to know that. But I overdid the acting thing, sorry. Wait, what about Maguro? <laughs> this is so awkward. <laughs> oh shit, he's giving advice even more awkward. Hey, buddy, it's a process, you know? You can't just jump to the best parts. Uh, yeah. At least he's not suspicious. Hmm? Huh? Wait a second, you're... Uh-oh. Does he suspect something? Yeah, you're from the office next door, aren't you? I've seen you going in and out. Uh, uh yeah. I I'm kidding you. I was recently put in charge here. Sorry for not introducing myself sooner. Oh. I'm Maguro. I'm in real estate. And no, I should have introduced myself sooner, too. Mm. Anyway, Kiryu-san, I'm impressed you're the man in charge at such a young age. You must bring a lot to the table. Mm. No, it was really just circumstantial. <laughs> It was really just circumcision. <laughs> ah, and modest too. Listen, may I invite you to my office for some tea? I'd like to get to know my neighbor. Huh? Oh, wait. I shouldn't be interrupting your fun. Sorry, that was inconsiderate of me. Interrupting our fun? Oh. President Makoto, please pay me no heed. I'm President Kiryu's secretary, after all. Mm -hmm. What? Kiryu-san, you're dating your own secretary? That must be nice. <laughs> now I really have to get to know you better, Kiryu-san. Please, do come for a visit. Hmm, mm, I don't know. Kiryu-san, this is a perfect opportunity. Huh? We've gained entry into Maguro Enterprises. I knew you were the right man for the job, Kiryu-san. Oh, right, that's true. But what if your cover's blown? Danger comes with the territory. I'll do whatever it takes to expose Maguro's shady underdealings. Heh, <laughs> got it. I'm in this with you to the end. Something wrong? Yeah. No, no. We're just saying we should take you up on your kind offer and visit your office. I see, I see. Then please, this way. <clears throat> Oops. There's no one here. The staff and even my secretary are out. No matter. I can prepare to see myself. Have a seat and make yourself comfortable. <laughs> Look at those random magazines. I like it hot and steamy. Okay, Marue. Okay, hot and steamy it shall be. Marue, you weirdo. Who describes tea like this? Hot, steamy, filled with cum. This is our chance to search the office. Oi. Are you sure about this, Marue-san? There's no telling when Magula will come back. Kiryu-san, tell me. What's he doing now? Making our tea. A standard tea boss capacity is between 400 and 600 milliliters. To prepare tea for three and some refills, he would need two pots, so he needs to boil a liter of water. To boil a liter of water in a kettle takes about 45 minutes, uh, four minutes on high heat. The man likely gets his secretary to make tea, so he'll need some time finding the tea leaves. All in all, we have about seven minutes to conduct the search before he returns with our tea, follow? <laughs> Maru is something else. This isn't so much Maru as it is just common sense. Yeah, keep up, Kiryu. <laughs> Who doesn't do the mental min-maxing math to know how long someone's gonna make tea for? Also, rather than working those gums, how about getting busy? I doubt financial statements will be mean anything to you, Kiryu-san. Look for anything suspicious instead. Got it. Oh shit, I can look around? Okay, there's lockers. There's this horse thing. I'm gonna check this thing. A dharma and prancing stallions. The man's got taste. Uh... Guy, it's gonna take him even longer to make the tea because the teapot's right here. <laughs> I see it right here at the top of my screen. He's missing his teapot. Hmm. This video rack, is there something odd about it? I'll say nothing's wrong for now. No, there's nothing strange here. These lockers are locked, of course. File documents and books, they don't appear to be suspicious. I guess it is just the uh Piles and magazines. Magoto appears to be a man of many interests. It's gotta be the like <laughs> videotapes, huh? There are some machines here, I better not mess with the desk. Okay, it's gotta be. 
the, this. Tiny Tiger, thank you so much for raid. Welcome, welcome in. I hope you had a nice, cozy stream. Yakisakiwami? Ah, oh, good taste. I'm working my way up there. Soon we're gonna be able to do Yakisakiwami. <laughs> for now, we're on Yakuza 0. What's odd about it? <laughs> it's location. The video collection. It's presence. Oi. Mother-san, don't you think this video rack is odd? Huh? Odd? I don't see anything odd about it. There's nothing wrong with the video rack itself, but it's strange that it's here in this room at all. It being here is odd? <laughs> this investigation music, oh. though. Oh, you're right. There's all these videos, but neither a TV nor a VCR to play them on. Uh. Right. It's too bulky to be just placed here on a temporary basis. Besides, there's dust here that shows it hasn't been moved recently. There's something clearly unnatural about this video rack. <laughs> kiryu -san, that's on the money. They must be hiding something in these videotapes. Do you think he would hide evidence in plain sight in his office? Maguro's bow, I'll give him that. It's definitely just porn tapes. So if you were to examine these videotapes... Kiryu-san, sorry, but can you open the door for me? I'm holding a tray. Uh, sure, I'll get it. He was quicker than expected. What do we do? You know where to look now, so maybe we should come back another time. Mm -hmm. No, I can't risk having him move the evidence. We're selling this now. Yeah, but Maguro's back. We can't keep searching. True. I don't have any choice. It's time for the last resort. The last resort? <laughs> Sorry to keep you folks waiting. I usually get my secretary to serve tea, so I'd track down the tea leaves. Nailed it. Yeah. Uh, thank you very much. Speaking of, why isn't your secretary taking a seat? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry for any awkwardness. I threw out my back and sitting is simply agonizing. <laughs> Ouch, that's rough. I know how bad it is to throw out your back. It's me. I'm the one who threw out her back. <laughs> I'm a fuck machine, Maguro. Yes, so I would much prefer to stand. Please don't mind me. Remember what I just told you, Kiryu-san? Keep Maguro focused on you while I examine all the video cassettes. There's no way this is going to work. He's sure to notice. Okay, this is now dead ass tele telepathy. We are across the goddamn room from each other. Earlier, it's like, okay, maybe they're whispering or something. But right now, we are just reading each other's mind. <laughs> We got some crazy chemistry. You can do it, Kiryu-san. You're a man with the balls to do this, and Madrasa gets men by their balls. That made no sense. What's wrong? Can't take your eyes off each other? Oh, no, it's nothing. Ah, <laughs> uh, it must be nice to be in love like that. Anyway, Kiryu-san, if you don't mind me asking, how did you get to be in charge of your own office at such a young age? Well, it's a little complicated. I was approached by this man. God, Jesus Christ, she's not being discreet at all! <laughs> Marison's got nerves of steel. If Maguro were to glance behind him, we'd be toast. Oh, I see. It's amazing how a single chance meeting can change your life completely, isn't it? Mm -hmm. You seem a little distracted, Kiryu-san. Is something bothering you? Huh? Uh, y you think so? It's just... Something seems to be distracting a lot. What's bothering you? My secretary's so hot. <laughs> this is the wrong one. <laughs> this is the wrong one, but I want to say it so bad. <laughs> I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it and ruin the whole plan. <laughs> My secretary's so hot. <laughs> Watching Madurai-san's body wiggle around is distracting. You mean your secretary? She's just standing there. <laughs> All right, so you just can't keep your eyes off her, can ya? I know what that can be like when there's dad and not much else on your mind. 
Uh, yeah, th that's what it is. I'm, uh, totally in love. Hey, Kiryu, why would you direct his attention my way? S sorry he caught me off guard. Don't let it happen again. Got it. Kiryu-san, I have to tell you I'm very impressed by how well your business is doing. Oh, I don't think we're doing anything too differently. <laughs> How modest of you! I wish your success would rub off on us next door. The world being the way it is, the one with the money wins. It doesn't matter how they got it either. Doesn't matter at all. Oh, excuse me. Got lost in my own thoughts there. Tell me, Kiryu-san. You obviously well off, but is there something else you want? Something I want. Let's see. A VCR. Woman. A house, maybe? <laughs> In this economy, Kiryu? Fucking insane. Shut up. <laughs> this is also like, this is actually pretty insane uh, in Japan standards to own a house and also during this time, <laughs> during this time period. Jesus, that's dreaming big. <laughs> you're, you're more likely to have a harem than you are to have a house in this economy. <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm trying to decide between woman <laughs> and house. VCR is definitely the wrong answer. Mm. Do you want to triple down on all the wrong answers? Oh, woman is too funny though. I want to see Kiryu say woman. All right, Kiryu. Woman. Hmm? Woman. You're in love with your secretary, but you openly declare you want other women. That's bold! But you better be careful, women can be fiercely jealous creatures. You're right, I should be more discreet. Hey, Kiryu! We're supposed to be a couple, don't draw attention to me when you're talking. Sorry, sorry, I got careless. For heaven's sake, be careful! Got it. <laughs> well, I must say I'm glad I finally got to meet you, Kiryu-san. I enjoy chatting with you, too. Uh, yeah, same here. My girl is trying to wrap things up. Is Maldoy son done? Oh, nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad you managed to finish it. Oh no, she wants more time. Oops. She wants more time. Oh boy. Easy for her to say. Well, Kitty san, I enjoyed your visit, but I should be getting back to work now. Magro san. Yes? How do I buy more time? I like the power move of being like, hey dude. <laughs> and just passing the fuck out. Hey man. <laughs> I had to see it. I had to see it. <laughs> huh? Hey, can you son? Huh? Are you asleep, Kiryu-san? Is this guy narcoleptic? He's out like a light. Hmm. 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 This is a problem. <gasps> um, Miss Secretary, Kiryu-san fell asleep on me. <laughs> oh my goodness, how gauche. Kiryu-san, please wake up. Uh-huh. I'm up, up, up. I'm okay now. For goodness sake, poor President Makuro had to ask for my help. Please do be careful. Sorry. Makuro turned to Maruri-san for help. I guess I can't blame him if the guy he's talking to falls asleep. <laughs> I ruined Maldurai's life. <laughs> hey, Kiryu-san. Thanks for visiting. Feel free to drop by anytime for some tea. Uh, uh yeah. There. Gotcha. This is it. <clears throat> what? Present Magro, I found this bank book in a videotape. Interestingly, these numbers don't seem to match the revenue figures in your tax filings. <laughs> what? That's... you... are you from Marusa? I was merely invited along as Kiryu-san's friend, but yes, coincidentally, I happen to work for the Criminal Investigation Department of the Regional Taxation Bureau. I'm rather dismayed that I stumbled upon evidence of your tax evasion on my private time. Uh -huh. D damn you! I'll kill you! You want to consider the consequences first? If you kill me, you're guaranteed a life sentence. Stay on your best behavior and you might be lucky enough to get parole in 30 years. How old will you be then? If you're willing to stay caged that long, go ahead. Kill me. Ugh. <laughs> what was that? Wait.
they go. The feet. <laughs> Cue your son. Thanks to you. Yeah, thanks to me. That was all me, baby. <laughs> All me, man. No need to thank me. I know. I did incredible. Kitty san, thanks to you, we got evidence of Magdo's tax evasion. Although you weren't very good at keeping Magdo's attention away from me. Sorry. Like I promised, I'll help you with your business. Of course, I will expect to be compensated fairly. Daddy. What? It's not free? <laughs> of course not. Besides, it's peanuts to you. In this day and age, money is flowing like water. Mm. I feel like I got the short end of the stick. Agent, by the way, from Mata says, join your team as an advisor. Nice. Oh, okay. And Kirisa? Make sure your office keeps on filing your taxes properly. Got it? Uh. No argument from me. I just got a first hand demonstration of how scary Madrasa can be. <laughs> you know it. Crime doesn't pay. This is for you, as thanks for your help. I want you to have it. You got a trouble finder. Watch your back. Manasa lurks everywhere, sniffing around wherever dirty money leaves its stench. You never know. Manasa could be watching you, out of sight, but never far away. Nobody wants to fuck with the IRS. They're so scary, dude. Oh my god. She's still here. <laughs> Cutie, that's so scary. Cutie, you have a stalker. Alright, business is done, I assume? Yeah, yeah. Just the time it takes to do one sub-story. They'll take your balls if you don't pay. <sighs> what now? Oh, dear. What's the matter? Oh, Mr. President, I was just thinking about our workload. We're really short on staff. I was thinking the same thing. We've been managing more properties these days, but our hiring hasn't kept pace. So, I wanted to ask if you were or uh, I wanted to ask you if it was alright for me to try and recruit some new employees. So it post a job opening? Hi. Yes. At this rate, we're going to be overwhelmed by the workload soon. We should take steps to avoid that now. Right. I was just thinking it might be good to get some new blood in here too. <laughs> Yay! That settles it. I'll start recruiting. Uh. Great. Go ahead. Make us look good. <laughs> Definitely. Oh guys, am I still connecting? Homies? Hey? Am I here or did you guys die for a second or did I die for a moment? L let me know because I saw the red uh, icon for a second and I was like, uh, am I dead? Alright, hopefully it doesn't die. Dude, I hate when internet dies. It's the worst feeling. Okay. Alright, alright. We'll keep going and, and hopefully it'll be alright. I might be dead, but then I don't want my internet to be dead. Okay, we're back. We're good? Okay, we're good. For now. Let me know if it happens again. Just start spamming the chat. Definitely. Oh, yeah. I'm going to have you handle the applicant interviews, Mr. President. Daddy. Interviews? Me. Uh, I can't do that. <laughs> He's shy. What are you talking about? You're the head of this company. You're definitely on the hook for this. Mm. Mm. Okay, you're doing it, Mr. President. I'll let you know when we get any incoming applicants, so please be ready. Marlena, what do you do? <laughs> I know you set up the office at the start, but what else do you do? Got it. If we get a new applicant, I'll let you know. Please be ready. Got it. Man, there's this whole... I, I wish that we knew more about this earlier. Oh, yes, Kudusan. I forgot to tell you about upgrading the interior. You mean a decker here? Why does he look so angry about it? Yes, I have an old connection who can help us change the interior of our office. For free, even. Free, huh? That's great. Now that you mention it, it's kind of boring for looking at the same four walls all the time. Might be good to change things up. I completely agree. If you want to upgrade the interior, just let me know. Okay. Oh, how do you CP for it? Eh. Finally, some money! Oh. oh, why do you have to do this every time, Pleasure King? <laughs> Wasn't a chicken enough? Yeah, I know. Isn't Nugget the only employee we need? 
even better than Marina. Alright, now we can level stuff up. Alright, Madrasa's kind of expensive, but reasonably so. Like, way more reasonable than our uh, <laughs> entertainment lady. Uh, she might be our best bet for food, though, because we don't have anyone to level up food with. Maybe Sushi Jin would be one that we can get. We should try to get Sushi Jin now. Let's do some fishing soon. Oh, even though I think fishing is like the most boring thing ever. It's already bad enough in Hades. <laughs> and it's just a reaction game in Hades. Alright, now I can change some managers around. Where's our nugget? Yeah! Nugget! Let's go! Cluck, cluck, cluck! <laughs> yeah! Nugget! That's what I'm talking about! Alright. No interviews? Probably when I come back, huh? Okay, okay, we can't keep getting distracted like this. I'm going directly to a taxi so we can go to the uh, bar in the top right of the map so that we can send Majima money. Whoa. How the fuck do you legally hire a chicken? I don't know, but he's also making 30,000 yen. Or 300,000 yen. Have I unlocked pocket racing? I have, Withers. We haven't done that in a while either. I feel like it's easier to, like, do one game a lot in a row than it is to not do it. $100 taxi is not bad. Imagine walking to the manager's office just to see a chicken with a tie. I would think that's a very great business, Zeons. Man, I am never in this corner of the map. Kiryu, buy that and wear it right now. Don't be a coward, Kiryu. Machima would love to see it. <laughs> Which is a you? Do I invest with you? Why are you so hidden away? No, you're just a darts guy. Oh, I see him! <laughs> it's you again. Mm -hmm. I didn't catch your name during our little money scattering encounter before. It's Kiryu. You always hang around this place? Yes, when I am in Japan. I travel the world a lot, so I don't get to spend much time here. Don't you ever go home? I'll go home soon, on my next trip overseas. You live in another country. I guess when you're rich, that's an option. No, no. I live in a jumbo jet. Oh my god, fucking boss baby. A jumbo jet? Well, think of it like a mobile home. When you're a global businessman, you spend more time in the air than anywhere else. Hey, Mr. Faded. You guys probably don't notice about me, but one of my favorite, like, YouTube... I, when I watch YouTube videos, some of my favorite YouTube videos to watch is, like, luxury, like, first-class airplane uh, videos. <laughs> I love to see it. Even it's like they'll pay like twenty thousand dollars for like one ticket, which is something I could like. We will never do, you know, like us plebs. There's no way we'll ever do that. But being able to watch it, it just feels nice and luxurious. <laughs> I was like watching uh, food experiences, like dancing bacon's. I have several private jets, and I switch between them depending on my mood. They're hangered at different airports around the world. Hangar space is at a premium with the soaring land prices these days, so it cost me an arm and a leg. <laughs> anyway, I guess you could say this place serves as my office while I'm in Japan. Welcome to my investment fund, Kirikun. Investment fund? You wanted to know how I earned my wealth, didn't you? Uh. Yeah. Business may be booming right now, but there can't be too many people earning more money than they know what to do with. You must have a few tricks up your sleeve. 
<laughs> well, cat, that's what we're all doing. We're coping with the injustice of capitalism by living vicariously through widow uh, video uh, videos. Well, this is how it is done. I just sit here enjoying a drink and wait for the phone to ring. That's it. Sorry, I don't follow. Can you tell me a little bit more? This is just like an FT home maze. It's like I sit here until the new uh, curious ape drops. Mm. Sure, but it might take a while to explain. You want me to go on? Uh, fine. Explain it, guys. I am not gonna like, sit here and actually listen to the explanation. I'm just gonna skip to the end. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty much how it says. Hmm, I see. So, when I put in money, it only goes to this M son, and when I take a cash injection, it's always from him, too. That's right, you catch on quickly. Hmm. Then why do we need to go through the fund? Hmm? Yeah. Well, wouldn't it be quicker for M son and me to just exchange money directly? <laughs> oh, c come on, Kitty Yukun. How on earth would you find someone you can entrust with that kind of money? Our fund has all the connections to ensure that investments only go to trustworthy parties. That means you can contribute without fear of putting your money at risk. Hmm, mm, you have a point. No, Kiryu! I have to admit, I know next to nothing about investing. Hey, you're far better off using our fund to send money to m -san. Okay, I get the picture. <sighs> so, who would m be in my case? Mm. Well, we have candidates all over Japan. And I'm the face of the fund here in Kamurocho, and we have also have a representative in Sodenbori, Osaka. Sodenbori, huh? I hear the nightlife industry is really booming over there with cabaret clubs and the like. That would probably be a good place to invest in now. So you're saying the money I contribute would probably go to someone running a cabaret club in Sodenbori, huh? So, so. And the reverse is also true. Any money contributed by the individual in Sodenbori would come to you in Kamurocho. However, we'd take a cut for our commission, so you wouldn't get the full amount. That's just the way it is. Yeah, yeah. That about sums it up. I think I get how systems work. As a gesture of goodwill, let me make a little contribution to your business, Kirikun. You sure you want to give me all this? <laughs> Use that money to make your business thrive. And if you make a profit, invest any extra cash you have with us. Like I said in the beginning, we just juggle money. Our business relies on people using the fund. Okay, understood. Build your friendship with Fukushima. Alright, invest money. Yeah, it's a set to 10 million for some reason. <laughs> Let's go ahead and do it. Just do it. I wish I could invest more, honestly, is a thing. Oh, we have a friendship with him. Money you find in the papa. If you say so. I wish I could invest more, but I have to swap between Majima and I can't. Okay, well I guess that's it. That's all we're doing now. I didn't even I didn't even get the money from Majima. All right. Let's order some. Kitty, how many can you drink at once? Okay, not a lot. Yes, I would. Why didn't I check it off? Oops, I kind of was interested. Glend Glenfiddich 12. This bottle set the industry standard for a single malt. You'll find it light and fresh. The bouquet is fruity and the finish clean, making it exceptionally easy to drink. Its light flavor makes it popular with anyone new to single malt whiskeys. Whoa. I love these little trivia about alcohol. <laughs> One of the first games I played that ever did something like that was, uh, Catherine. I'd like another one? Bowmore, 12 years old. This is the standard of the Bowmore line. Sherry barrels give it its uniquely ripe floral overtones. It also has a distinctive seaweed and salt notes of Islay, with a distinguished flavor that has earned it the title of Queen of Islay. Yes, Islay Queen! <laughs> It stands a cut above the rest of the single malt 12 year old whiskeys. 12 is such an odd number. If I waited longer, does it get better? Or, uh, this is like a real question if you guys know. So, you know how like some whiskeys are only like 12 years old? Like, does it get better in my shelf as I wait another 12 years? Or, or is there a refining process that I'm missing at my at home? <laughs> I don't know if that makes sense as a question. 
Yamazaki aging years. No, it won't matter if I have it at home. Oh, hey, this whiskey! I actually see it uh, sometimes. Fans of Japanese whiskey are on the rise, even overseas. And one big reason for that is a right here. Uh, it has to be in a barrel. All right, all right, today I learned. Thanks, guys. Yamazaki whiskeys has always been prize winners, but the 18-year-old variety has earned the most accolades. It has an irresistibly aged flavor with depth and a taste like dried fruit that comes from the sherry barrels in which it is aged. This, along with its fragrant chocolate notes, makes for one full-bodied whiskey. So cool. But it's in a wooden barrel where it slurps up flavors. It's so neat. <laughs> Walked around Tokyo for a single bottle of Yamazaki twi 12. That rare, huh? Alright, now we're drunk and it's time to play darts in hard mode. Yeah! Sure. I'm gonna lose this 100,000 just so you know. So you don't say his wine on the other hand was still aged and the bottle one left unopened. So interesting. Alright guys, what's the rules of 301 again? I'm supposed to get like 300 points exactly? How? 301 points exactly? So intense, Kiryu. So cool. Alright, how do we do this? Oh, I thought the drunk would be worse. Oh no, it's pretty bad. <laughs> So should I aim for this 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 ring in the inside or the ring on the outside? I have no clue. Do they do th something different or is bullseye just better? I don't know anything! Teach me about darts! Aim for the 20 inside ring? Okay. Hmm. Ugh. Kitty, go home, you're drunk. Hmm. Fuck. Huh. Fuck. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Kitty, you, you are so drunk, please. Hmm. Your triple 20 was too powerful! Wait, what? Why does it say bull bull triple 20 at the top? What does that mean? Is that what he got last time? Huh. It's a recommended. It's what you need to get zero to win. Oh, it just tells you, huh? That's pretty interesting. Well, tell me what to do here. I have a really weird number. Bull, single, 15, bull. Okay. Uh-oh. Was that a bullseye? Wow. <laughs> I need to get a triple 15. What's a triple? Is that the outer ring or the inner ring? <laughs> I don't know what a triple is. I know, where's the 15 on here too? There's a 15. Inner ring, 15. Huh. Fuck. <laughs> it's a GG. Oh! He busted! A nut! Alright, we're gonna have to get a double 15. Is that- is that this right here? Uh-oh. Double 12. Where's 12? There it is. <laughs> GG! Yeah, your ass toasted by a drunk man. <laughs> Damn. Hey, what 
to bet 400,000 and play one more game? The drinks are on me. I got the winnings from before, so I'll be down 300,000 if I lose. Uh, is there something for finishing this guy is like... Oh, uh, should I do it? <laughs> I mean, I'll do it for fun, but... Is there like something for winning several of them in a row? Oh shit! Oh shit! I didn't know there was a Kiryu shot animation! Let's go! I want to take shots with Kiryu. Three hundred one again. Okay. You <laughs> say. I mean, we can't get more drunk <laughs> at this point. Kiryu's pretty fucking toasted right now. Okay, Kiryu, that was none of the places I was hey. aiming, man. Wow. Oh, Kiryu. Damn, he at least got 120. Triple twenties, she show me. Really show me the works right now. Kiryu, oh, something. What's going on? I know you're drunk. Maybe I have to wait until his vision stops being blurry. All right, what's the what's the recommendation here? I guess triple twenty and a single seventeen. Hmm. Triple 19. Ah, uh, you guys just told me this, but is the outer ring double or the inner ring triple? <laughs> I forgot already. I think it, I think the inner is triple. Hmm. Fuck. Oh, I busted! I that was what I needed earlier. Oh, he's gonna kick my ass! He's kicking my ass! 77, huh? Triple 20, single 17. Triple 19. Double 19. Yeah! Let's go! <laughs> yeah! Take another shot, QD. We're masters at this. No. P play me again. One more game. For one million yen this time. And I'll pay for your drinks. I've won 500,000 so far. If I lose the next one, I'll be down 500,000. I like these nut. Uh, I like these odds. You're in then? Then let's get started. Let's go, another shot. Yeah! I didn't know he had this animation. This is so good. Dude, I want this on my channel. Like, every time I take a shot, I want to I wanna have Kitty take a shot with me. I like these nuts. Stop, dude. I fucking Freud and slipped it in there. It's not like Kira can get much more drunk than we've already been. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, let's aim a bit higher then. Oh my god, Kiryu, you're giving me like triple vision right now. Fuck! Oh, I'm getting my ass kicked already. Hmm. Huh. Huh. Fuck. Oh, did I do it? Low ton. What the hell is a low ton? 
Alright, what are we gonna do? We got something. Is there a way to do this? A bullseye and then a triple 17. Bull, what's a triple 17? Triple 17, okay. Hmm. What? <laughs> okay, what can I get to not fuck this up? Uh, is there a 19 on here? Yeah, there is. Huh. Oh shit. Is he doing it? He's doing it. Alright. So we're gonna need like a double 15. A double? A double's really hard, you know that, right? <laughs> you know that's really rough, right? What if I do it like this? <laughs> GG! Right? Mm. Yeah, Bloody. I was gonna go for the double. <laughs> I was too scared. Beat the gambling guy. Won three games of darts in a row! Ugh. You got 1,500,000. You get fucked! Get fucked! You should have come to this bar tonight! This isn't my day. Oh, you don't have a special story or anything? <laughs> Honestly, did all that because I was hoping that he had like some kind of special story. Cricket darts? No, we're good. Drunk at the same time. Yeah, I gotta add those challenges, comrade. <laughs> you just beat his ass and walked away. I did. I did do that. Uh, so it looks like there's a sub story here, so I'm gonna go ahead and go back in because. There's no way I'm gonna be able to go back here. There's no reason for me to go back here for anything else. Um, I'm assuming it's him saying that we got something from Majima. <laughs> Wait, this place doesn't serve caviar with meals? <laughs> well, that's different. But never mind that. Uh, get financing? I guess I'm financing. Eight million five hundred thousand. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Sure. Have you gotten to train beast yet? I haven't. You're right. I should do that. Caviar is fish eggs. Six rounds. It's a very uh, 100 million yet. No problem. Okay. Uh, it's a, it's like a rich person food. I've never had caviar before. Oops. Fuck. I just did the. Yeah, I just fucking stupidly pressed down. It sounds gross. I never had it, so I can't say. I have not done Miracle Johnson yet. We've been. I have no clue where he is, to be honest. Okay. I'm assuming next time you're gonna need, like, a billion. You craving for that sub-story? I'll see if I can find it in a second. I'm gonna take a taxi. Unless I see the sub-story for Miracle Johnson. Is that Miracle Johnson? Probably. Why is this taxi so cheap compared to the other ones? <laughs> if you like the fishy f taste of fish, you will like caviar. Hmm, interesting mayday. I like fish, but like, I, I don't know, like, do I like the fishiness that much? Hey, second Milo. Do we have to do an interview now? How fun, an interview. Let's go and get the money first. I found out how much we started making from the cabaret club near the end. I'm just kind of waiting for the break-even point, I guess. Go, go, go! Then we can level up! Level 
leveled up. Gonna... Well done. If you ever had salmon rolled and you had some form of caviar, that's the best one for me. It doesn't really break the bank. Yeah, I've had I've had fish eggs at like sushi places before. Those aren't too bad. I tend to enjoy them. Ugh. Don't tell second Milo what coochie smell like. Where's the health guy? Is masochistic man really the best I have for health? I guess it is. Please take it to S rank. Nice. Maybe the PS Force fan <laughs> smells like fish. Who knows? Health. Yeah, that's what those businesses are. Don't worry. <laughs> Shit, actually, I, I've just been looking at the heart, but now I realize these are all like cabaret clubs, aren't they? <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> it's for your health. It's for your health. Listen. Your mental health. Invest now. You know, one of my favorite subreddits used to be r slash meme economy, which is basically supposed to be a place where you could invest in memes. <laughs> it used to be, but nowadays it's just people post whatever memes. It's supposed to be meme formats, but it's been lost in the sauce. <laughs> meme economy is not the same anymore. Alright, tier 41. All right, let's go level up beast mode. Because I think we can get everything in beast mode right now. Shit, well, actually, let's go find Miracle Johnson. I guess Miracle Johnson's here. I had an interview to do. So much to do. I know, right? Three steps far. Even the meme economy is in decline. It's been rough out here. Here? Who are you? Huh? Oh, it's a producer! Oh, Kitty John, ciao! Hmm? Hey, it's been a while. Are you still making shows that bring hopes and dreams to people's lives? <laughs> oh. Easy for you to say, big Mr. Producer. <laughs> Listen, I've got a chance here to drive viewers bananas, not just in Japan, but all over the world. How do you figure? <laughs> You're a real producer after all, Kiryu-chan. The chance to whip the whole world into a frenzy got your attention? You know I'm just an amateur, but okay, I'm willing to listen to your fairy tale. What's going to drive the world crazy? Yeah. The crazy thing is, it's no fairy tale at all. Daddy. What? <laughs> is this enough of a hint for you? Woo! I don't think this is enough of a hint of anyone for what Miracle Johnson is. <laughs> what was all that about? Kiryu chan, don't tell me you don't know who Miracle Johnson is. Miracle Johnson? Ugh, oh, I get it now. I just heard about him. He's some kind of lead singer, huh? Eh? Seriously? Kiryu baby, are you telling me you haven't heard of the pop star Prince until today? He's world famous. Famous to the world, maybe. But this is Kamurocho, Japan. Why should that matter? Kamuro chose part of the world! Fine, it's not important. Say la vie. Basically, Miracle is in Japan to shoot his new music video. But, and this is strictly hush hush, there's been a little problem holding up the El Shuto. Yeah, catch my drift. Yeah, you're saying there's a problem. Uh. Yes. And I'm convinced there's only one man capable of solving that problem. That's you, Kiryu-chan. I've been looking for you everywhere. Papillon, are you sure? Do you not remember the time we punched some dishes? <laughs> Papillon, have you forgotten? 
I can't go into details because it's a top secret mission, but will you help? Let's set this road ablaze, you and me! Fine, let's hear it. Whoa. Now you're talking! That's what makes you an ace producer! So, what's the problem? It's the superstar himself, actually. Miracle's refusing to perform until his demands are met. We're at a standstill. What a... What, is this guy being a diva? Not really, no. He's just really insistent on doing a music video exactly right and you won't compromise. What is this music video about? <sighs> to be honest, I don't really get it. Apparently it involves Miracle dancing his way through hordes of attacking zombies. <laughs> zombies? Yes, but if they were to really attack, he could get hurt. So we told the extras to take it easy when they swarm him. But Miracle got wind of that and blew his stack. He says the zombies have to attack like they really mean it. Otherwise the action wouldn't feel real. So he's refusing to do it. There's a lot I don't get here, like how can a zombie f video feel real to begin with? Who knows, these westerners, man. They're so crazy, but this is gonna be a surefire hit if it happens. Yes, yes, it's a thriller, I get it. <laughs> I, I, I knew it was Michael Jackson from the start. I mean, it's Miracle Johnson. Well, I understand the problem now. What I don't get is how I fit into the picture. I just can't go over the part where he was like, Woo! Instead of, <laughs> You're the man to keep Miracle safe from the zombies, baby. You want me to protect him? <laughs> Do you guys see the guy in the background who came in just to, like, look and then, like, fucking dipped? <laughs> Damn, I'm so sad I pressed the X button so quickly. Yeah, for the sake of realism, the zombies are gonna go all out to attack Miracle. Try to eat him and everything, but we don't. We can't let the pop star prince get hurt. That's where you come in, my old friend. Hmm, sounds like a strange gig, but it seems simple enough. Of course, of course. Isn't it just a perfect job for you? Let's go get the deets from the music video's director. Sure. A bit, Clover Rabbit. Finally got the man for the job. Oh, it's you, Poppy. <laughs> Sorry to keep you waiting. Introducing the powerhouse producer with the biggest brains, brawns, and balls in modern mass media. Here's Kiryu-chan. I'm Kazuma Kiryu. Good to meet you. Oh. oh, so you're the famous Mr. Kiryu. I was told you have an extraordinarily cool aura. I see it's true. <laughs> Who is this guy? <laughs> I'm Mr. Spinning, the director. Steven Spinning. Welcome to our team, Mr. Kiryu. That's a white guy. Oh, Mr. Kiryu, I should also introduce you to my PA, Louis. He's on the team, too. <laughs> Howdy. Welcome to the family. Uh. Good to meet you. So, Kiryu-chan, is this blowing your mind or what? I'm sure you know already, but just in case. This man here is none other than the director of the massive worldwide smash hit movie, Indian Jeans. <laughs> I hate this so much. <laughs> Indian Jeans. <laughs> India what? You're breaking my balls here, Kiryu-chan. Are you a hermit? How do you not know this man's films? Sorry. <laughs> Mr. Kiryu, perhaps you're more of a sci-fi guy? Oh? oh, right, right. Kiryu, even you have to know this one. A.T. You know, the one that... The <laughs> you know, the one where the boy who rides with an alien on a unicycle over the moon? <laughs> Uh, sure, I, I guess I might have heard about it. <laughs> yeah, see? I knew even you had to know. Mr. Spinning is an amazing director, right, Kiryu-chan? Right? So uh, yeah. Amazing. <laughs> it's no big deal, honestly. Though, it was number one at the box office, worldwide. Oh. Sure was. So, Mr. Spinning, with you at the helm of this music video, are we anticipating another worldwide hit? So does Nick. Absolutely. The fans all over the world are waiting for this one. I don't want to waste any more time, but I need to confirm one thing before I describe your mission. Is that okay? Uh. Sure. We're here to film Miracle Johnson's latest music video. Do you understand what that means? The whole world's gonna be watching? Clever boy. Uh. But that's only half of it. The full answer is that this has to be the most exciting music video ever made. Failure to achieve that is unacceptable. Oh. No fills here. Yeah! 
Wow, th that's heavy. You have to hand it to Hollywood. They work on a skill we can only dream of. Don't you agree, Kiryu-chan? Uh, yeah, oh. it's huge. Good. I'm glad you get the picture. <laughs> hey, guys. Mr. Johnson is ready to enter the room. Oh, good. Sounds like Miracle Johnson is about to join us. Let me introduce you to him. Hey, come on in, Miracle. Looking rad as ever. You know it's spinning. I was born cool. Born to do it. Hey, yeah. Man. Hey, man. You my partner? No. <laughs> nah. I don't know you. Fuck off. <laughs> I give you. <laughs> Kiryu chan, what are you saying? Of course you're partners. Oh, that's right. Miracle, that's Mr. Kitty, your partner today. He's a little shy. Okay, okay, no problem. I heard about Japanese people being shy, so that's just human nature. It's all good. I'm kidding you. Glad to meet you. How do you animate this? Woo! And I'm Miracle Johnson. Nice to meet you. Uh, yeah, likewise. Hey, man. Hey, man. Have they told you about the mission, Mr. Kidu? Yeah. A little, but I don't get it. I could use more information. Okay, since you're all here, I'll explain what's happening. The setting is here. Kamurocho, one of Asia's, no, one of the world's premier entertainment districts. Zombie hordes suddenly emerge and attack Miracle on the street. Miracle evades the attacking sword and dances his way through the land of the rising sun. The very picture of cool. It's a tableau truly befitting our pop star prince. It's gonna be funky, yeah! Woo! <laughs> Hey, so, uh, why zombies? I still don't get what's going on. <sighs> Apparently, they're really into that sort of thing overseas. I mean, if it's a big Hollywood director is behind it, it's gotta be a new trend, I think. I think this city's fabulous. It's always glitters and shines. Love it here. Kamurocho's like an amusement park. Yes, and once the stage is set for a close encounter of the undead kind, Miracle will spin and weave his magic dance. Why is his lip, his lip syncing so bad? Steven spinning talks like a puppet or like a Half-Life NPC. Hey. Mr. Kiryu, this is where you come in. Hello, Kiryu. Your job is to escort Miracle and protect him from the walking dead. I told the extras playing zombies to attack me like they mean it. If the danger's not real, the thrill is a nighter. And you want it to be a, a thriller? I tried to stop him. If the pop star prince were injured on set, uh, the whole world would be screaming for my head on a stake. That'd be really bad. Oh. Who's bad? No. no, spinning. I told you how serious I am about this. Compromising my artistry will be a betrayal to all of my loyal fans. <sighs> ah, miracle. Oh. You're the ultimate entertainer. Yeah! Oh, oh stop spinning. That's... Nothing the whole world doesn't already know. <laughs> how many how many times? Let's get a prediction. How many more times they're going to do that animation before the mission is over? <laughs> they animated that whole spin so they you know they're gonna milk it for all it's worth. How many more times do you guys think they're gonna do it? <laughs> I want a prediction mods, please. Uh, let's go from anywhere from like uh, one more time to five plus more times and we will count. We will count them each time. 15 at least. More than once. I think I think maybe two or three more times. That's that's the number that I think would be reasonable here. I'm not even gonna press the next button until you guys vote so that I, I can be ready. Yes, not Kingdom, that's Steven Spielberg, but he's Steven spinning now. Silly girl, you really think they'd only use it in this game? <laughs> in future games too, I guess. Were we counting how how many times this guy spins? <laughs> he does that special Michael Jackson move. <laughs> All right, polls up. Vote anywhere between one to five plus. Okay, you don't have much time to vote, so you better vote as fast as you can. Go 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 go. What you got? Like three seconds now. Three, two, one. What if it's zero? Well, we'll give it to the ones. <laughs> it's okay, we got the fastest poll in the world. <laughs> I'm sorry about this, Kiryu-chan. I feel responsible. 
No, that's all right. I know it's not your fault. Fagin's face is restarting to pull. Let's go. So, there you have it. Surely you can understand now. What part of that was understandable? Whatever. Let's just start filming. Ooh. Yeah, kitty. I like that fire. You're gonna rock my world with passion like that. Uh -huh. That's enough. <laughs> That's the spirit, Kiryu. Hold on to that anger and let's roll them. We're going in. Woo! Mirako. And Kidu, let me explain what you two have to do. Miracle, you unveil your new miracle walk dance. Shimmy and shake your way from here to the end of the street. I know you know this, but please try to keep it elegant. Okay. No problem. This dance is gonna bedazzle the world. So does Nick. <laughs> Mr. Kidu, your job is to protect Miracle from the zombies by whatever means necessary. Uh. Yeah, got it. <laughs> Good. Kiryu, you're the man. Samurai! Samurai! <laughs> Can we get on with this? <laughs> Kiryu is so sick of this shit. Alright, it's, oh, it's an escort mission. Okay. Protect the civilian. Oh, zombie assets. Wow, they even put like zombie sprites in here. Crazy, huh? You're just gonna fucking. Wow, damn. All right, come on, Mirko Johnson. Just keep doing your your fucking moonwalk, you weirdo. Oh, the other one already died. Come here. I need something else, a bike. No, the bike. Give it to me. Missions. Just keep keep doing your thing, man. Don't stop. <laughs> god damn it. Oh thank god they missed. No, you piece of shit. No. Enough! Half a- Whoa! Kitty, what the hell was that move? Mirko Jossa, where the hell are you moonwalking to? Holy shit, split him in half. I wish that was me. Oh, there's four. This is we're nearing the end, I see. God, they they like made it they made these uh zombie assets just for this. It's insane to me. Ah, god damn it. Get off of him! Come on. Anyone else? Here we go, Johnson. Keep shimmying. Keep doing your thing. Oh, nice. Oh. Excellent. Amazing. Magnificent. <laughs> that was stupendous, Miracle. I can tell you right now that I just shot the greatest music video of all time. This will be the stuff of legends. <laughs> Spinning, please. I only did what was expected of me. The real honor goes to Kiryu. Ooh. He was cooler than nice. Too cool. So does Nick. 
You are so right. Kiryu, if it weren't for you, this masterpiece would have never happened. From the bottom of my heart, I thank you. No need for thanks. Being that hostile guy seems like a part of my daily oh, routine. Man. Hey, Kiryu, how would you like to be my personal bodyguard? You would be like another part of me, man. Kiryu, baby, <laughs> this is it, man. The golden ticket. The pop star prince is recruiting you. <laughs> Babysitting a superstar might be a decent life, but the world is too big a stage for me. Cabernocho's plenty big. Oh. Oh, how disappointing. But I guess I can't deprive Kamurocho of its star. That's the way you make me feel, Kiryu. Kiryu-chan. Very well. I'll leave you a gift then. It's gonna be a spin. It's gonna be a spin. No, it's not! Hey, zombies, come on! <laughs> black or white, just tell me. A large black box and a small white box. Black or white? Which should I pick? I chose the white one. I don't think the poll predicted this. It really didn't. White. Okay. Yes! The number one, baby! My gift to you. This. What is it? You got a baseball shirt. Isn't it delightful? Uh, sure. Gratefully accepted. Thank you. Thank you, Kiryu. You're going to be the Kabodocho King, I can tell. After all, I'm the popster prince of the world. Two spins! <laughs> Woo! Hey, hey! hey. <laughs> I still don't get your American groove, but it was a thrilling experience all the same. At least I'll never have to fight zombies again. And if I'm ever back in Japan, I'm gonna look you up, Kiryu. You wouldn't mind, would ya? Now uh, think about hey. it. Hey, Miracle, we better get going! The world needs to see what we've got waiting for them. Looks like my time is up. I'll see you around, Kiryu. I got a feeling this isn't the last time. Uh. Sure. I look forward to it. Three spins? Nope. Nope. Two spins, guys. And we did it. Two spins. <laughs> I think he did four spins total this entire encounter. <laughs> Mirko Johnson thinks I'll meet again. <laughs> Maybe we will. Whoa! Miracle on Tenkaichi Street with a 30 Kiryu sub stories. Hey, yo! <laughs> I like all of the Michael Jackson remixes for this. It was so silly. I <laughs> can't. <laughs> can't wait to listen to Smooth Miracle. <laughs> There's one more Miracle substory. Oh, he's still out here? He's still here? Oh shit. Can't wait. Oh no, Yamanoi, I didn't mean to talk to you. Sorry. Alright, where do we do the interviews even? Let's go ahead and do get our money and then do the interview. Can't believe there's another one. Oh, he's gonna be at the disco place? Oh, I love doing... Actually, I don't really like the disco that much, but I, I don't mind doing it for you guys. I'd be lying if I enthusiastically said I love the fucking disco. I'm okay with the disco. Finally to A. And now for health. Karaoke, but hard. Karaoke is fine too. It's just the uh, moving around parts of the disco that makes it hard. But we're cracked. We can do it. Sexual harassment cop. Still, what a name. You like the disco that much, Pete? Oh, I really went overkill there. Whoops. Oh, well. Lost some money. Alright. Here we go. Where do I do the interviews, Marina? Marina, where do I do the interviews? Here? 
Oh, Mr. President, about that job opening, we have an applicant. Great. What do you want to do? Do you want to do the interview now? Yes. Uh. Okay, sure. I'll interview the candidate. Great. Let's get going. Oh, but wait a minute. You're not going to conduct an interview looking like that, are you? I wear this every day, Marina. I All business is conducted in this suit. You know this is my drip. <laughs> You see, you, you kidding me, Marina? You know this is what I wear. What's she gonna do? Is she gonna just put glasses on us and call it a day? Sure I am. Mm. So? Well, you don't really look like the president of a company. We'll need to make you look more dignified and sagacious. It's gonna be glasses, isn't it? It's just glasses. Saggy what? <laughs> Saggy, what? What does that have to do with anything? No, not saggy. You know, sagacious, like intelligent. Oh, I know. It's just the glasses. It's the same drip, but the glasses. Let's <laughs> 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 see, they look good on you. Those glasses you left lying around really suit you. They make you look both dignified and intelligent. Didn't expect to be wearing these again exactly. Looks like we're all set. I'll call in the applicant. The applicant will be here soon. Please evaluate him to see if he is really motivated to work for us. Test for motivation. Right. Hey. Yes. Apparently, dear, there are applicants out there who only attend interviews to get cab fare from companies. Are people really sinking to scams that low? Don't worry, I can spot people like that from a mile away. Where does that confidence come from? It's a glasses. Here he comes. Why doesn't he come in? You have to tell him to come in. No applicant would enter without permission. No, I don't get it. Please, just tell him to come in. He'll hurt his knuckle if he keeps knocking. Come in. Excuse me. He's also wearing glasses. I'm Haruhiko Ejun. I'm honored to meet you. Yes, likewise. Please, have a seat. Doesn't he see the chair? Why doesn't he sit down? You have to invite him to sit. No job seekers would take a seat without being asked. Daddy. What the hell is this about? Is this supposed to be funny? He's not fooling around. Job seekers are dead serious. Please, let him sit. But please have a seat. Thank you. <sighs> this is already exhausting. Is this going on much longer? It hasn't even begun. At least ask him a few questions. You need to determine if he would be a good fit for us. A question. Hmm. Why do you apply with us? What kind of woman do you like? What color is your underwear? What color is your underwear? <laughs> my, my underwear color? Does, does that have anything to do with this job? Yeah. No, not especially. <laughs> is that what you ask at interviews? I don't even want to know where you got that idea. Besides, what are you going to do with that information? Well, nothing I can think of at the moment. <laughs> you, you'll figure it out later. I'm, I'm so sorry. That last question never happened. Uh, yes, of course. That would be for the best. A question. Huh. What kind of woman do you like? Huh? Well, what kind of woman do I like? That's right. We're just talking here man to man. Hold on. Hold on. What on earth are you asking? What? This is important. It's an effective approach to establish rapport. Well, that might be true, but can't that wait until after you decide to hire him? Actually, she's right. <laughs> uh, well, your secretary is my type. Oh, no way, really? <laughs> oh, what a flatterer. Ijunka, what would you like as your starting salary? Hey, we haven't hired him yet. Oh, uh, I beg your pardon. A question, hmm. Why did you apply with us? Hi. Real estate is a business that serves one of the three basic human needs, food, clothing, and shelter. It's one that is closely tied to people's daily lives. 
Someone working in such an industry would have to be trustworthy. They would also bear great responsibility. But that is where I see a worthwhile change. I have also heard that your firm isn't afraid to put new recruits in charge of accounts right away. I felt this job would give me a great opportunity to really grow. Damn, Adrian, this guy interviews. <laughs> wow, that little speech rolled right off his tongue. He must have practiced it a lot. Huh. I'm impressed, Mr. President. You can actually run an interview. <laughs> Yes, yes, I'm very impressive. Nailed it, totally. First try. Please keep going and see if ichuen san is the sort of person who would work out for us. Uh. Got it. What should I ask Nesk? Have you experienced... <laughs> Are you willing to do anything? Ijuin, if you were to join my company, would you be willing to do anything? Mm. Yes. I eagerly await being able to exceed your expectations. So, anything? Hi. Yes, absolutely. I came to this interview to prove just how dedicated I can be. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? There was no hesitation at all. He sounded primed and ready to go. We'll see about that. Just next. What are your strengths? What are your strengths? Hi. Well, I'm fluent in English. I lived in the States as a child so I can manage most business dealings in English. <laughs> also, I was the head of our university's tennis club. I often organize events and socials, and I think it makes me a good planner and organizer. Ah, I see, he's fresh out of undergrad. <laughs> he does appear to be very communicative. He seems like he has many friends, too. Yeah, maybe. What should I ask him next? Have you experienced failure? This is actually a pretty good interview question for Kitty Pla out of nowhere. Have you ever experienced failure? Failure? Hmm, no, not especially. I feel like I can deal with just about anything life throws my way, so no. I can't say I know what it's like to fail. Ah, uh, and Ron answer! He must be especially blessed, or maybe he's just lucky? Who knows? I think that's all about all the questions we have for you. Ijuin san, do you have any questions for us? Questions? Uh, no, nothing in particular, except maybe the cab fee. <laughs> oh, yes. Actually, I heard that your firm makes hiring decisions on the spot. Is that true? Yes, you heard right. The president and I would like to confer about it, so if you could just give us a moment. What shall we do? Uh, right in front of him, Marina? What shall we do? Shall we hire him? Huh? We decide now? Right now? Yes. The longer it takes, the more it will cost. We can't afford to sit on our decisions. Mm. How tight-fisted can you be? Ichuan's son was eloquent in describing why he wanted to join us. He can also speak English, plan events, and work well with people. What shall we do? I'm so... <laughs> See, when he said the no-failure thing, that showed lack of experience. <laughs> Do the true simulation of the job market. <laughs> See yourself out, Ijuin son. Sorry, but you can show yourself out. Okay. What? I failed. Why would you turn me down? See, I wanted you to taste failure. <laughs> you said you never tasted failure before. Well, this is it. How does it taste? Just a gut feeling. G gut feeling? Yep. Everything you said was perfect. So perfect it sounded like shallow bullshit. Huh? huh? How dare you? You should be glad I came out here to interview for this pissing company. Oh, his true colors come out. Huh? What's with this rinky-dink operation anyway? The president doesn't know jack about interview and my knuckles are sore from knocking. What a waste of time. Hey, I came all the way down here for this interview. You can at least cover my cab fare, can't you? Uh, okay. What? Wait, this scammer doesn't deserve one shiny yen. Huh? What? I took your interview because I heard I get cab fare. Don't try to weasel out of it. Oh, sure. You were able to rattle off all those perfect answers without a moment's hesitation because it's the same script you use everywhere you scam for cab fare, right? You never intended to join us from the start. When you said you'd do anything, I knew right then and there. Everyone has their limits. Ugh. You, well, yeah, so what? Uh? We're a real estate business, not some loan shark where sorry punks like you can come beg for change. Now beat it. Ugh. Get out of here, bozo! Yikes. You can be really scary, Mr. President. Uh, yeah. Sorry for raising my voice. Yeah. That's okay. I'm glad you saw through him, though. He he had me completely fooled. I just went with my gut. <laughs> well, I'm impressed. 
Oh, but I guess we have to start over on this recruitment process. Uh, yeah. Thanks for taking care of that. No problem, sir. I consider it an honor. Let's go, cute you. Easy dub. Okay. Hey, Obsidian Panda. Alright, I think we could probably get more money out of that. Yeah, another payout. Yeah! We're slowly gathering money. Slowly but surely. Oh, hey, no money battle this time. SSA. Level things up. Oh, that's it. That's all we got. Electronics King, your turn. I should have them looking over their own districts, honestly. That would be a, a funny way to do it. <laughs> it's like, look at this empire that you you once had, but it's now mine. Hey, Spider-Man. Food place. You know what? Fuck it. Old lady, how's your food? You know what? She levels up the food pretty well, so we should probably use her for that in the future. Because we have no other way to level food, really. You go here. Oh, you're so sp you're so oddly specialized, Lilian. Taka Uametsu. There we go. Yeah, I've seen that, uh, Zen, the little meter at the end. Alright, guys. So, it's 10 p.m. PT, so I gotta go take a little break. Uh, I'm probably gonna take, like, a 15, 20 minute break. I'm also gonna, like, eat a sandwich really fast. So, snack break, pee break, whatever you gotta do, alright? Uh, and then I'll be back. Ba -ba 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 -ba. And Kiryu will be out here smoking a joint or whatever he does. <laughs> Alright. B R B. Oh, I have to go. Oh, yeah, I have to click back into the game, which makes him throw a bunch of money. <laughs> Hang on. See you guys in a second.
Yo, 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 I'm back. All right. Gotta... <laughs> hey, fill aside. <laughs> Thanks, and thanks for the thank you guys all for the welcome backs. Okay, up to the building. Sorry, cutie, I know you just pulled out that smoke break again. <laughs> that sounds so upset. <laughs> I appreciate you. All right, get that sweet payout. Good thing Mr. Shakedown didn't come and totally tear up our ass while we're gone, right? Right? Uh this is harder because Sunio isn't that good of a financial manager. Hey, hey, Pax. We're slowly taking over that place like one person at a time. But we should definitely buy some properties. <laughs> we should definitely buy some properties. Are these all masks? No, no, no. We still got a couple. Soon it will be max though. Soon. All right. Very expensive old lady. It's worth it, I think. This music though. So jazzy, so sweet. I don't know why, but it vaguely reminds me of a lot of like DS and uh, Wii games that I played as a kid. But I don't know what. Was Wii Sports music like this? <laughs> Am I thinking of Wii Sports music? Oops, I uh, was too much into old lady. Damn, she has drained me dry. The succubus. The minx. All right, gotta invest in ourselves. All right, uh, actually I saw, I saw as I came back from the break, the two dudes. Hang on, you guys will also see the two dudes in a second. There they are! Oh, hey, Kiryu, baby! Kiryu. Oh, you mean Mr. Kiryu. If it isn't Papillon Kato and Director Spinning, what are you two doing here? Bling bling, ka-ching! We were just talking about you, Kiryu. Talking about me? Yes! You helped us with that music video for Miracle. Now I want to do something for you, Kiryu. You, you helped me out big time too, so I want to hype up your psychic. Bada bing, bada biz. Uh, what does that mean? We want to help you, Kiryu chan. Yes, we will put our world class abilities at your disposal. Come on, Kiryu, let's do the thing together. Sh sure, it would be great to get top names like you two to help me. Aren't you really busy with your day jobs, though? Don't sweat the deet. We're jazzed to work with you, Kiryu chan. Just let us in on the gravy train. <laughs> I don't think I've ever heard that before. Gravy train? And we'll smash box office records together. Director Spinning has joined your team as a manager. Damn! I'm not too sure about this, but oh well. Thanks for your help. They are pretty good. Their forecast, like, seems to peak at the middle, so that's pretty interesting. Alright, what shall we do next? You guys said disco, right? Now where the hell is the disco place? Am I crazy? Vincent, bar and pool. Uh, it's up here. Okay. To the disco zone! Thanks, I'll take it. It starts in the same spot as last time here? Oh, thank you, Pete. So, what's this big scoop you got? Hmm? got some good news and bad news. Which do you want to hear first? Bad news first, then. Miracle's gone missing! What? What do you mean, missing? Oi. Are you nuts? Keep it down. If they hear you, they'll kill us both to keep to keep the secret from leaking to the paparazzi. <laughs> yeah, they'll kill you over that. Oh, oh sorry. Uh. This is serious stuff. The whole world's in an uproar because the pop star prince has gone AWOL. Makes sense. He's a global superstar. I hope he's alright. Okay, so what's the good news? I saw him. Miracle, the missing superstar. What? You're pulling my leg. Where? I told you, keep it down. If the wrong person hears this, they'll grind us into hamburger meat. 
Sorry, sorry. So where? Mahara. I saw him go in with a security detail. I bet he's traveling incognito. Oh, yeah, I get it. He's on a private visit to Japan. <laughs> Bingo. It's too bad the security guards have Maharaja locked down tight. There's no getting past them. Oh, yeah, I guess oh. not. Hmm, how am I going to get in? Miracles and Maharaja? It's just a rumor, but maybe I'll take a look if I'm in the area. Let's go. Let's go directly to Maharaja. I cannot wait for the one sub story where pocket tissues will be relevant. <laughs> I seriously can't wait. Oh, there's another. Oh, actually, it's just the it's just the Miracle Johnson one. Hey, absolute unit of a man. Hmm. And there's a big foreign guy in front of Maharaja. That rumor about Miracle Visiting Maharaja might not be wishful thinking after all. Hey! Hey! <sighs> <laughs> that jump scared me. <laughs> that jump scared me and I was mashing the X button so it went by super fucking fast. <laughs> Sorry, private booking. No normal business hours now. Is Miracle here? <laughs> Where'd you hear a bogus story like that? What would a global superstar like Miracle be doing hanging out here? I'm an acquaintance. Give me a chance to say hi, and then I'll be on my way. Huh? Yeah, yeah, as if someone like you is a friend of Miracle's. Get real. So why are you trying to lie your way in here? If you're not gonna leave, I'll have to make sure you do. Damn. I feel pretty weak. I don't know if I can do this. Oh shit. Oh my god, he dodged. That was pretty scary. On his face, or punch him in the face, grab him by the <laughs> by the cap. Do it again. What's his move set? It honestly looks like me when I play Kiryu. Holy shit! Never mind. Oh my god, he's a pro wrestler or something. I want to use some different heat moves, but he just gets knocked down so easy. One more time. Four punches to the face. <laughs> You're gonna have to kill me to get through here. A bodyguard doesn't just give up. Bodyguard, huh? So Miracle is here. Man stands out like a white glove. You can't expect people not to notice. What do you mean? Like fucking Mario? White glove? I haven't heard this phrase either. What are you gonna do to Miracle? I told you. I just want to say hi. I'm an acquaintance. Huh? You're lying! Pretty stubborn, aren't you? Hmm? What's all this noise? Th this guy's the man you see Miracle. What? This guy? Hey. Oh, hey! It's Kiryu! Miracle be so stoked to see you, man! You're Lois from the video shoot. Miracle is here, isn't he? Yeah! Come on, Kiryu, let's go see the man! Hey, you sure it's alright taking that guy to see Miracle? Dude, this is D Kiryu! Star of Kamonocho and friend to Miracle Johnson! <laughs> I see! Wait, so you weren't lying? I'm sorry about that. Yeah. Don't worry about it. <laughs> hey, you want to get Guardian Miracle with me? We'd be an unbeatable team. Heh. <laughs> Thanks, but no. It's the Kiri, you guys! I got a disco ball. Swing! What the? Nani? Mara is really close to the public. Dude, he's just out here dancing by himself. Thank you, Sterling. Come night. <laughs> He has a sequence. 
<laughs> Looking sharp as a superstar. <laughs> of course, they say he's the one. <laughs> that he is. Hey, Miracle, look who's here. It's Kiryu. Who? Oh. <laughs> He's just on here posing. Hey, it's been a while, Mirko. Oh, oh Kiryu, did you come to see me? Yeah, you could say that. Count Rover, thank you so much for so Welcome, welcome to the Ghostling family. I hope you enjoy your stay. Enjoy your ad free viewing as well as the sexy emotes we've commissioned. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Just as shy as always, I see. I'm happy to see you. Uh, yeah, looks like you haven't changed much yourself. What are you doing back in Japan? Another video shoot? It's been like a day. No way, this is my ninja vacation. A, n a ninja vacation? Buying this place out is your idea of keeping things quiet? This is it! <laughs> okay, but why did you decide to come back to Japan? Mara has my kind of place. It's a real wonderland. I may even build one back home. Wait, you're telling me you came out to Japan just to visit Mara? Yes, on my private jet, it's just a hop and a skip away. Right, you're the superstar. Ha! This says the superstar of Kamurocho. Look at this DJ. <laughs> Trying to keep things hype for like one man. Now, kid, you are you ready to get your groove on? Nani. Dance me? Ooh. Come on, don't you want to dance with me? Hey. He's the king of dance. Only the best dancers from around the world can do dance with Miracle. The best of the best. Come to think of it, I was too busy protecting you to get a good look at your dance moves throughout the video shoot. Spin number one! <laughs> then shall we? Did he just go chika chika? <laughs> chika chika! Hmm? Uh, sure. Oh. No, no, kiddo you. Can't you see? I need more positivity. I'm all about the excitement. Show me how you feel. Right, sorry. I'm about to hit the dance floor with a global superstar. <laughs> That's the spirit. Let's have fun uh, with this. Yeah. Okay. okay. Let's break it down now. Spin number two. Chika chika. Time to get funky. Woo. <laughs> <gasps> Let's go, Kiryu. Let's go. <laughs> chika chika. Let's go, Kiryu. <laughs> that was amazing. All right. <laughs> okay, I'm ready to fuck this up. Let's do it on hard. Let's do it on hard. He he's gonna style on me. So cool! It's Tuesday night. Uh, yes, Tuesday night. Holy shit. Holy shit, he's kicking my ass. Holy shit, guys, this is not happening, dude. He is gonna just kill me. God, this song is so hard. Oh shit, my dancing people. Ah, he kicked my ass. <laughs> he spanked me. Kitty leaves the dance floor like a petulant little child. Kiryu, why does- why are you wounded like he stabbed you in the gut? Ugh. What was that at the end? Haha, <laughs> Kiryu, you know how to bust a move! Now it's seriously crazy fun! You know, I can see why you're the superstar. 
For about a second, I thought I had a shot at beating you. Boy, was I wrong. <laughs> Don't be so tough on yourself. I haven't had this much fun in a while. Forget being my bodyguard. You'd be a great fit as one of my backup dancers. <laughs> I had fun too. That was so much fun, I want to commemorate the moment. Hey. Lois, you're up. Fuck. Stop doing this weird box thing. <laughs> take your pick. Black or white? A large black box or a small white box? Which do I take? I took the white one last time, so I'll take the black one this time. Okay. Black. Okay. Black it is. You got an encounter finder. Are you sure? Isn't this really expensive? Who do you take me for? I'm the pop star prince. Heh. <laughs> You certainly are. Then I accept it with my gratitude. When I'm around you, Kiryu, I feel like I can never ever get bored. Maybe I'll even extend my stay here in Japan. What do you mean? I owe you big time, Kiryu. You helped me thrill the world and I want to repay the favor. Anything I can do for you? Are you sure you can do that? What? Don't you remember who I am? It's no problem at all! I'd be worried about what I'd have to pay you. There's no way I could afford a pop superstar. <laughs> no problem. You'll get the miracle discount. <laughs> So you do still want to be paid, huh? That's fine. I could definitely use your help. As an advisor, holy shit! <laughs> well, oh, Jesus Christ, what an advisor! Samurai. Kitty, you're a real good friend to me, man. He just said the samurai line again. I'm looking forward to spending more time with you. Look at the two dudes in the background just going for it. Yeah, of course. All right, what do you say we strike a pose to finish? Huh? But... Don't be shy, guy. You can't get all self-conscious of disco, can ya? Good point. Alright, let's do this. <laughs> Ready? Oh! <laughs> let's go! Oh my god. I love that so much. You know, Kiryu probably will never do this in any of the Yakuza games, but he would love ballroom dancing. Damn, that was the best. Does Kiryu have a dancing fighting quest line like uh, Majima does? Actually, I shouldn't have eaten that. I could have just eaten at a restaurant. Whoops. Let's go to Kondai and go ahead and eat the whole menu. Boom, 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 boom. Kitty saying, whoa, it's amazing, yeah. Still can't believe Kitty's friends with MJ. Well, you better believe it, Zabretta. I really hope it comes up in future games somehow. Oh, can't go in from that. Five bits. Thank you for the five bits, Drake Crimson Leonhard. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Drake. Take care. Have a nice sleep. I'm gonna take your order. Yeah, I'll have one of everything. All you've got. Oh god, this is a barbecue place. Oh. Salted ton, grade A salted ton, kalbi, grade A kalbi, sirloin, grade A sirloin, harami, grade A harami, tripe barbecue, seafood platter, kimchi combo, stone cooked bimbap, spicy beef soup. Oh, that all sounds so good. <laughs> yeah, can you kiss a barbecue? It is! This place is a specifically Korean one, right? I don't know if I misread. Never mind. Oh, yeah, it is a Korean barbecue place. <laughs> Let's see. That guy teaches you rush style, right? Yeah, let's go ahead and learn some rush style while we're here and nearby. Ba -ba 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 -da -ba -ba -ba. Thank you guys for the blesses. Hang on, direction of the quick step. That seems like so much. Oh, these are getting more and more expensive. Can I even make it here? I can. L1 went on first heat bar. 
Weaving guard? What is weaving guard exactly? You remember his training? I do remember his training. We have to dodge a lot, which is kind of scary to me. Maybe I should go get my money first. <laughs> Maybe I should go get money first and then come back. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Oh, we haven't gone through this tiny little app. Oh, I am so sorry. You'll be fine. <laughs> I knocked a man on his ass. Do you only sell weapons here? Yeah, you do. I was hoping that you would sell other things too, but that's fine. <laughs> you bodied that motherfucker. I didn't mean to. Absolutely ran him over. Are you trying to show me your business card after I fucked you up? How much of a bottom are you? Here's some money, you need it. <laughs> He's looking at his pager. Oh, that was a pager, not a business card. I misunderstood. <gasps> Mr. Shakedown, do not turn around. I, I just need to get past you. He won't know. He won't know. You knocked him into Shadow Realm. He's okay. He, he, he's recovering. I think you're a five bit Drake. Oh, I can't read all that though, just glancing over at chat. Something, something. Reporters show up in a plane. Mike Jackson first showed up in Japan with 50,000 reporters. Jesus Christ. It's a lot of homies. These two girls are wearing the exact same jacket. Oh, it's tense when you see Mr. Shake down in the distance. Yeah, devil. I know he can take me. And all my money. Oh, uh, let's go ahead and do it the slow way and see how slow it is. Yeah, I think we'll do it by next time. This might be bad. No, it's not. You know what way, Clover. Oh, that one's slowly inching its way there. You know what? Let's see it. Let's see the effect of Miracle Johnson. Wow, that was like nothing. <laughs> These last couple buildings are like nothing, huh? Alright, let's go ahead and start making some Muda. Alright, now we're gonna go try to unlock stuff for our quick style since we just unlocked all of that. Ugh. Soon we'll get to the main story. More like never, Ground Pounder. Maybe every time we play, I should swap point of views at the end if we didn't if we did too much on one person's side so I don't burn myself out. <laughs> this is the main story. Don't sweat it, Drake. I just don't know what the full fun fact is. All I know is Michael Jackson in Japan equals a lot of reporters. Go to Japan. Oh, look at this. Look at this cutie buddy. <laughs> so adorable. Okay. What are you guys just doing in here? Okay, dude, save me. 100,000. Okay, this is gonna be rough. Guys, you're gonna see me get my ass kicked here. It's because I have no patience. Yeah, but with the entry fee at 100,000, I think we're only going to get guys drunk enough to have impaired judgments. 
I'll be holding on to that 100,000 yen then. Relax, I'm not gonna f I'm not fixing to do a runner on ya. It's going well, Jalen Heiss. La ba ba, 100,000. Come one, come all. Better not be lying about doubling my money if I win. Wouldn't my dream of it. But you do gotta pay the entry fee up front. Sweet. Now, I'm a gambling man, so let's gamble. Hi. Hmm. Pro wrestlers in Japan. Good thing. Let's go over it. Pay Kamoji amount. Time limit six seconds. You get knocked down or knocked out, you lose. This is the worst thing to try to do with ADHD. Hmm? All right, let's do it. Died of six seconds. <laughs> Alright, let's try it again. <laughs> Thank you for 100 bits, Drake. I have ADHD too, so if you ain't doing this, is a struggle. I had to pay attention for 60 seconds, and I couldn't even pay attention for six seconds. Alright, let's do that again. I wish I could skip through this dialogue faster. Hundred thousand penis to you now, that is true. Oh, I have to go through the dialogue. That's the worst part. I got ah, Come on. Sure, I got this. You evade for 60 seconds. Kidu, can we do that? Can we evade for 60 seconds? Damn it, I zone out for like two seconds is too much. Uh! Yeah, 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 let's try it again. Oh, it's a test, it's a test of patience and I lose every time. I wish I could brute force this. What kind of coat is this, Verum? Test of pure strength. This isn't strength, brother. This is patience. Hi. Hmm? I am zoning out as we speak. Oh, God. Uh, it would help if I counted the seconds. That's just... Wah! Also, Kitty, your One Piece aura is blocking me. What is this, Dragon Ball? I can't see shit. That was a punch than a stomp with you, huh? Twenty seconds. One dude blocked me for a second, but eyes on the prize! Whoa. Oh, thank god. <laughs> oh. Ugh, I didn't move so fast, I don't get it. Nice effort there. Thanks for trying. Always happy to do a rematch. I lost so much money. <laughs> I lost so much money for this, and it's only amping up, isn't it? Uh. Quick as a wind there. Yeah, it was a better challenge than a drunk, at least. When you take a hit, swing your head around so you don't eat another mm. big punch. Swing my head. Like Bobby and Weaving? Okay, I remember that. Are we going Ippo in here? 
You learn damage weave. Press L1 or X when hit by an enemy attack to perform a weaving move and dodge out of the way. That's some good advice, Kamoji. I'll put it <laughs> to use. <laughs> About the winnings. Alright. We're gonna go Dempsey roll on someone. With a quick style. Alright, we still got more to do with him. Uh. A million yen? A million yen's a lot. Ugh. Punch out artist taking another challenger. Million in a shot. Do you knock him down? Money comes in double. Million yen, you say? And all I have to do is knock this guy down once before a minute goes by? Yep. I'm bursting at the seams with protection money at the moment, so why not? Give me a shot at this punk. You sure want to gamble with your family's money? If you lose, you end up in the creek. No chance. I've done a little boxing. No street punk's going to dodge my punches. I just might not. You sound confident. Good luck to you. Jordis Kiss, thank you for redeeming the Asabone guy. If you send a message, uh, a homie will get to you or I will get to you eventually. Alright, we're gonna fucking die here. Gotta put up your guard or you can't dodge a blow. Alright, ready to go? Alright. So, this is the L1's the guard, I think. Oh, I'm supposed to do this? Fuck! <laughs> I didn't understand what it wanted me to do. Did it want me to do weaving? Or did it, or is it fine however I dodge? Hey, I'll be taking that million yen. That'll cover what I need to deliver to the family and leave plenty of change. Time to paint the town. How we do is fine, or let's do that again. Can we not do this excruciatingly long losing scene and then I have to go through the whole dialogue up to it? Oh my god, dude. Uh, this is like an ADHD nightmare. I can't do this. Come on, just skip it. Go. I'm holding down the buttons. It's just there's so many fade ins and fade outs for some reason. And they, they just had to put so many in here. Uh. Oh my god. Hey. Fuck! <laughs> that one dude blocked my vision for like two seconds and I got fucked. <laughs> I hate this so much. And I have to go through like a minute of this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> it's like all the like fucking uh. straight up a minute to do this. I hate this. Oh my god. Maybe this is why I didn't like unlock any of my moves when I first played Yakuza years ago. I would I would have never had the patience to do all this. Thanks, Philistine. <laughs> oh, it's like you saw me. Welcome, welcome in. Thank you so much, Rain. Hey, how's it going? You were also playing Yakuza Zero. I hope you had a great time. <laughs> I am kind of getting my shit rocked by this fat dude. <laughs> it's an absolute unit. Oh god. Hank, welcome, uh. welcome in, Raiders. I'm not behind Fennec. It's just I had to focus for a second. Alright, let's do this shit again. One punch for real, for real, on God, Teddy. All right, so should I stick a good distance away and then risk getting blocked by my view blocked or what? Hey, Asagi, think it's a raid. Oh my God, dude. <laughs> I hate this. <laughs> I hate this so much. What am I even supposed to do? He just goes in so fast. Oh. <laughs> my, my 
my shit is being wrecked. Dude, I'm gonna keep doing this. Just quick step immediately? Sure, first thing we do is just quick step. Give sub to Jordis, cause thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. I just keep doing it again and again. Making progress. I honestly feel like if I just misread him at the start, I would just get punched in the face once and die. Give him that Dempsey roll. Let's go. We Ippo in here. Surprise him with it. I feel like Ippo fighting Takamura right now. <laughs> I hate this so much. I hate how long it takes to load the mission back up, honestly. Oh, I can't even imagine doing this. How many more times? Three more times? Going broke from getting one punch to what okay, we're getting there. Taking the 15 seconds of MSS style music I'm here in the background during the fight. Yeah, all 15 seconds you get for MX. <laughs> You're being generous with that 15 seconds, I want you to know. My my average time right now is like fucking five seconds, I think. Uh. Fuck it, I'm gonna try the weaving thing. I'll try the weaving thing. I'm probably gonna immediately get decked in the face. But that's what the game wants you to do, so let's try it. Fuck! I fucking Christ walked up to him. Oh god, kitty, you fucking wasted. Dodge into him. I, I, I was trying to close the distance a bit. Not just fucking get. Uh, not just fucking run into his fist. Fight. Okay, come on. Focus. Three. Don't look anywhere else. Don't look at the timer. Just look at him. Okay! Oh my god. He just went straight into it. Uh, I, I honestly can't tell what the game wants me to do here. Do you want me dodging around? Do you want me weaving? He invade during a light motion leading up to L1 guard stance. Press button at the right time to evade enemy attacks. Can I weave twice in a row? Too bad I don't have anything tested on. Dude, I'm doing this one more time and then I'm gonna go. <laughs> I wish they, they didn't make it so long to get to the event itself. It's straight up actually like 20 seconds just to get to him. Uh. Oh, 
I'm holding down a skip button so it's going as fast as I can and that is as fast as it can go. I totally was dodging it. Yeah, so please give me fast forward button. I'm tired of this. Now, now I have to do it. All right, let's do this. I'll just keep trying over and over until I either go broke or he goes de down. I wish that after it, I'm allowed to beat their ass up. <laughs> I wish that was how the game worked. Flicker fist from from Mipple. Oh shit! You went into that. One ah uh, fast. So close, they're so close. You just have to keep dodging. Thanks, comrade. Thank you guys for cheering me on as I stubbornly throw myself into the same wall, praying, praying for a crack to form somewhere that isn't my sanity. A heart man, a heart monitor for this part. <laughs> Never thought about playing like Souls like with a heart yeah. monitor. Welcome back, Circum Knight. Fuck! I can't do this thing. I get distracted for one second, it's too much. <laughs> I hate this so much. And then it we have to go through the whole 30 seconds to get back into it again. I feel like I'm queuing into matchmaking just to get my ass kicked in Apex Legends. <laughs> it's the queuing aspect for me. That's like the worst part of like, oh my fucking god, and I fucking miss him, but no. I'm gonna eat ass. Leave be why you do this. I will be here. You guys are the only thing keeping me entertained as I do this over and over. Uh. There's a Deku skin in Apex. It doesn't even look like Deku to be honest, but I unironically love Mirage. Like Mirage is exactly my type of himbo. I love him so much. Oh, it's a strafing. I see, but I don't really see because I guess I, I'm. I guess I'm just gonna be holding L1 and praying desperately. They really should not have made it so hard to queue back into the game. That fucking mode. Dude will. Uh, he's in. He's he's interesting because he will strafe with you as you walk, or dodge. Ah, uh, Kitty, come on, we've lost billions. Billions! Uh. Okay, let's do this again.
Luigi. Oh, okay. And I'm surrounded by women too. <laughs> TNT, man. Damn, you're hard to pin down. All my earnings is gone. Yeah, that, that was a bad track record for me. Thank God I only have to win once. Thanks for trying. I hope you figure out a way to pay your boss. If he lets you live, come on back and try again. <laughs> Good work, Kiryu-san. That guy sure packed a punch, didn't he? Uh, yeah, I wasn't so sure about that one. When you can't evade and your guard is broken, you got to be s you got to stay calm and put your guard up again. Then you'll be protected. Mm. Hey, watching leaf, putting up my guard again, huh? You learned floating regard. Press L1 after your guard is broken to move away and put up your guard again. Great idea, Kamuji. That'll come in handy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Interesting. All right, two more moves. Ugh! Ten million yen course. Uh. <laughs> okay, let's go. I guess. This is getting worse and worse. <laughs> Nobody wants 10 million gun. No takers. Guess there's not many around who'd stay 10 million on a street fight. Maybe not. Hey, you guys. Aha, uh -huh, a bite. You two set the stakes pretty high. You that confident you can win? Confident as can be. You use looking up to take the gauntlet? It will cost you 10 million yen up front. So okay if I use a katana instead of my fists? Huh? Uh, sure, why not? Hey! <laughs> you bastard! <laughs> You'll be fine, Kaylee saw. Whatever get in there, nibble at 10 million yen. If I get cut to shreds, I'm blaming you. <laughs> Kitty! <laughs> okay, is it alright if I try it out on this guy, Kabusan? Be my guest. It will chop him in two, no doubt. I've been looking for a place to test this blade out, you see. What's the deal with the katana? Kabasan here deals with antiques. He says this is a historic katana, an enchanted blade said to strike out even the wiliest ninja master on the spot. <laughs> An enchanted blade? Okay, Zoro. If it's real, it'd be a national treasure. A bargain at least several hundred million yen. Ten million is a fair price for testing it out. Uh, I'm getting a bad feeling about this, Kirisan. <laughs> you think? Let's see if I can dodge that thing. Well, I'll be needing that entry fee. <laughs> okay. We're so dead. I got faith in you, Kiryu-san, already. Let's fight! Uh, we're so dead. These guys are all here to witness a murder. <laughs> ah, I was dodging! I was dodging, why did it hit? Dead. What do you think? The guy was pretty quick, but he still sliced him a good. I was hoping the sword could slice him too. I'm still not really convinced. Mind if I mull over it a bit more? <laughs> mull over it a bit more? <laughs> Let me see if I want to cut this guy in half. Mm. Yeah, top-down view would be nice, comrade. Actually, yeah, maybe I should have read that hints thing. Uh. Next next time we die, I'll read the hints. Oh. <laughs> Let's see. Made for sixty seconds.
Oh, GG. Oh, okay. Gotta cut him down. Is this blade really enchanted? Let's talk about this, Kabusan. I don't think this is going to work out. But. So your name's Kiryu, huh? Well, thanks to you, I just lost out on a big payday. You're blaming me for your shady business deal going bust? Get a life. <laughs> You'll get yours. Alright, I guess he's the next one. <laughs> thanks, Tommy Ow. Was that really Enchanted Katana? No, in fact, it had mostly lost its edge. He was probably just trying to get a better price for that junk. I had a feeling. Who can afford to slap down 10 million like that anyway? Must have all his priorities, Ron. Maybe. Just shows we're not likely to get any takers for 100 million, of course. Yeah. Oh, I got to tell you something. What's that? When you're in a pinch and can't get away, shoving the enemy is another option. Then you move around behind them. Shove them, huh? You learn counter quick step. Hold R1 and enter fine stance and it's... Okay. I'm quite excited to try that out. Thanks, Kamaj. That'll be useful. <laughs> <laughs> no rules broken as long as you don't attack. About the winnings. All right, all right, all right. 100 million yen cores. I'm kind of excited uh. to test out this uh, shove round. Let's try this. <laughs> Who do Is it just going to be those dudes from earlier? Hi. 100 million yen. Dream match. Hey, you two. Uh, do we have a challenger? I didn't expect to find one so easy. Y you realize the prize money's gotta be paid in advance, right? Oh, calm down. He doesn't pay the prize money. I have 100 million yen right here. This should cover the entry fee, right? P perfect I hear you went up against the guy wielding a katana. You okay with me using a weapon too? It's nothing as big as that old sword. Hi. It's a gun, isn't it? It's a gun, isn't it? Uh, I guess it's okay. Right, Kirusan? Uh. Sure. <gasps> then we have a deal. Go over the rules. Alright. Seems normal enough, eh? You weed out all the dodgy types. I hope you're right. Why the long face? Come on, let's fight! That's a gun. <laughs> Still alive. Ooh, dear mister, guns taking things a bit too far. Close but no cigar. If you want me dead, put together another 100 million yen and try again. I'll take you on any time. Kiryu-san? I know you can hear me. I'm talking to you. Oh. Huh? You knew? Oh. Hey, it's a guy who was fixing his own sword. I lost a lot of money thanks to you. How are you going to make this right? That's why you send a guy at me with a gun? Too bad it didn't work out for you. You really get on my nerves. Fine, I'll just have to take care of you myself. What are you waiting for, then? I've spent enough time dancing around. Punching someone will be great right about now. Kiri-san, don't try to stop me, Kamuji. This guy's got it coming. Wasn't going to. Hope you give him his just desserts. Now you can put all you've learned Daddy. to the test. Huh? To completely pulverize the enemy, you got to evade all their attacks real smooth-like. Dance out of their way and smash their face and you to your heart's content. Anyone not a customer gets no mercy from me. Gamoji. This is exploit the gap in enemy's defense to unleash a combo attack. This technical move also incorporates feint. Press tr triangle near a frightened enemy. Okay. Got it. You just watch. You're a good teacher, Kamoji. I'm glad you made me your apprentice, but I'm afraid I have to call it quits on a punch out game after this. Kirisan. Let's see if you can punch me up before I flatten you. I'm glad I don't have to do, do more dodging, to be honest. I need to heal real fast. Just let me- give me a second while I, uh, shove some drinks in my, uh, body. There we go. I do very little damage. Come on, Kiryu, 
get back up. Okay. <laughs> Dude, there's like three homies here and just one me. And I do so little damage. Maybe I should have leveled up this style more. my fists. Like, like this isn't hurting him at all. I thought I was supposed to slowly stun them over time, you know? Alright, yeah, got one. stuck. <laughs> I'm actually stuck against that corner. Okay, there we go. That's pretty funny. didn't level up my damage enough or what, but this is taking so long. Style, you don't. I was trying to use that heat uh, move. I don't know what triggers that heat move that occasionally comes out. Uh. a wall and an enemy. It's just like I am right now, but it doesn't trigger right now. So, go. See, like, uh, there's just no heat action. Oh, there it was. It's a counter, so it only shows when they attack. Okay. Oh. All right. 
feel like the only time you can get openings on Rush Style is after they attack. I just tried to use it again and I just got cut. I do like quick style or playing quick style. It just feels like responding, so it's kind of fun. Nice. <laughs> I guess things didn't work out like you hoped. Don't show your face here anymore. If I lay eyes on you again, you won't get off easy. G got it. I'm done with the punch-out artist business now, Kamuji. Thanks for the pointers. Yeah. Hey, it should be me thanking you. Being your teacher made me a little famous around here. <laughs> well, there's nothing special about me. I'm more impressed by how long you've stuck with the gig. Hitting folks is scary, but getting a hit doesn't bother me at all. That's why this suits me better. You gotta enjoy your job or it never lasts. Uh. You're probably right. Oh, oh yeah. Let me pay your winnings. Here's your 100 million yen you staked and 100 million yen you won. Okay, I'm glad that there's like no way you can lose your yen here. Huh? Thought we'd do an even split. What about your cut? No use carrying that kind of cash for a guy like me. A man who gets rich overnight just finds trouble. But with 50 million yen, you could leave the streets behind and live a normal life. I'm planning on getting an apartment with some of the cash I made up to last time. I, I won't be homeless anymore. Even a shabby old apartment could be a palace for me. That's all I could ask for. Aw, Kamuji. <laughs> I see. I owes you big time, Kirisan. I'll be sticking with the punch out artist gig. Come see you when you get time. Okay. <laughs> Shut up, Eric. There's nothing special about me, Kitty says an actual Jeep in a well tailored vest. An absolute unit. Hey. Oh, damn, they caught me. Alright, so now I can use the other style, so. Dodge. Oh, the spin! The, the, he didn't have to spin! That was the longest way around you could take him to beat this guy's ass! Oh, that's not a. <laughs> whoops! I thought that was something I could grab. Whoops. Beast mode for not. Ha! Ha! And stomp. Oh god! Oh god! We stomped him in the face so hard he flipped like a pancake! Man's dead. I see every one of my friends list playing that kitty cat game that came out today. Have you guys seen it yet? Does it look good? Does it, it seems like it's fun because you're a little kitty cat. I plan to play it someday myself. Oh, it's really good. Ho, ho, ho. Kitty cat game is good. I can't wait to be a kitty cat in, in, in space. I don't know what it is. Sci-fi? Sci-fi versus kitty cat? I'm sorry, lady. Stray seems intriguing. I just love the premise of it. <laughs> I think something I would really love in a game was if you could somehow pick your color. That'd be so cute. Like, you customize your kitty. I don't know if they let you do it, though, because I think it's always the orange cat. You do many adorable cat things in the game. Ah, oh, fuck. They're taking my property.
minus two. We need someone else on the biz here. Let the Leisure King have his own place back. Cool messages, I get that. Is there purring a smart? There better be. There better be! Garfield, what a curse. Ever since Sir Arkham Knight showed us that documentary, I see him everywhere. Garfield. If you leave it to me, I promise to deliver never before seen. Oh, oh, it's spinning. Is it worth it? Yeah, if he's only a million yen for like 76 million yen of uh, profit. All right, now we gotta go fight off the Pleasure King area. Where is it? Ugh! Oh, it just has to be in that little corner, doesn't it? Restaurants along the way. Let's try this ramen shop. Maybe we don't have the CP yet. Yeah, get a bit of everything, kid. You eat up, enjoy. Oh, those look amazing. Um, going to invest in Kiryu. It's been a while since we invested in you. We should really do the beast mode unlock soon. Maybe next? Let me see. <laughs> I actually- I think I probably use the beast mode the most out of everything because it feels so efficient. I like being a big hulking beast. health bar is so low compared to Majima's and I don't know what I've done wrong. <laughs> Haven't invested in his health enough, clearly. Yeah, maybe improved quick step could have helped us for that series of quests there. It probably could have. Don't 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 even bring it up. I want to think about how much easier of a time we could have had. Cabaret club mess <laughs> music still in my head. <laughs> I'm I still hear it in my head. It's never left me. Ryu difficulty every single time. Oh god. I'm not trying to make it harder. It just somehow ends up this way. <laughs> Where are they? Oh, they're down that alleyway. This way. Oh! Oh! Card! Damn. Oh! <laughs> they saw me pick up and marvel this card and they decided to go the other fucking way. <laughs> they're like, oh shit, this man's a freak freak. Okay, guys, let's head out. All right, stop causing, stop, stop, stop being hooligans here. Oops. Let's go rob someone. Ha 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 You weirdos. Hey, look who decided to show up. So you're the ones causing trouble around here. I'm going to need you to stop. That's cute. You think we'll drop everything and stop just because you said so? The Pleasure King said to bring down the house on anyone in our way, and you are. Any objects? Probably not. My headcanon is that Kinu picked it up and immediately started sniffing it. 
These aren't scratch and sniff cards, give you. <laughs> it's like, if, do you think they touch these cards with their coochie? That music is so good. The guitar comes in swing. S spread like peanut butter. Please never say it like that again. Sweet. That was a resolved problem. Can you make some scratch and sniff cards? That's even more cursed to me. Excuse me. That's true. You can meet all the girls in the game. So who's to say he hasn't? Chat with friendly girls. Erotic videos, bar. Can't find. We should do more pocket uh, circuit stadium sometime. Oh. Hey, do I have anything for you? Hey, buddy, you're out on a prowl again, are you? I'm not like you. I just happen to be in the area. I have to keep tabs on what's going on around town. I'm sure. All right. Telephone card. <laughs> Working hard. I just pick up what I find, he says. Here. Yeah, I see it. Wow. How did he get away with printing this stuff on cards, man? It's almost criminal. Don't worry. Most people don't see what you do. Oh, yeah. You watch a lot of porn. Not really, to tell the truth. Why do you ask? You know how they pixelate everything and censor it? Lately, I've been able to see past that, too. <laughs> Seriously? You can do that? I, I, once again, I would like to think that Kiryu's confusion that this man can imagine people naked is because, <laughs> because Kiryu has never seen a nipple <laughs> or a coochie in his life. <laughs> so he just can't picture it. He's like, what is under that? <laughs> oh god. As you can imagine it, the first time I pulled it off, I was so pumped I got a nosebleed. Now I don't even need devices to bypass the censoring. Huh. I'm all done. Boy, that was a masterpiece. And I guess you're heading to another girly place now? You don't seem the type to stop at just looking. <laughs> now that you mention it, I do have an itch to scratch. Thought so. Okay, stay calm. I've got to keep my cool. Now what is it my body really craves right now? Mm. Yeah. It's cougar time, baby! See you around! Okay... <laughs> okay, you weirdo. By the way, guys, where does Kiryu go to fish? Cause I don't imagine when there's like a river, but here I have like no clue. Nothing to buy. Building-wise, I mean. The dogs via the taxi? Oh yeah! <laughs> Oh yeah, the, t the dogs that we have to go to! We still haven't gone there. I've never seen it. Oh, fine, let's fight. No, I'm trying to grab this motorcycle. What? But I can't? I can't. I want to do a heat move with the motorcycle, damn! You guys are really ruining this for me. There we go. No, I split it, and now it's just half of a motorcycle. I love that so much. Every heat move feels so good. I wonder which ones I haven't done yet. Is there a list of heat moves I've done in the game and it'll tell you which ones I haven't done? He you can't grab bikes in Brawler because he's too weak. He just puffs his chest out and beats and is able to bench like 500 more pounds. I see, so that's how it works then. It makes sense now. I was like, why can't I grab the motorbike? <laughs> He needs to eat his spinach. Alright. Everything 
here's leveled. I'll eventually remember I have it all leveled. Eventually I'll remember. And then these two are almost ready. Oops. Uh, just like, probably, oh no, she did it, yeah! Nice. And then let's get these guys over. Start leveling up these dudes. This one's taking a bit, but we'll get there. Food-wise, this is probably worth it for us. Yeah. And then start. Nice. Take care, stick of butter. Okay, we're starting to make money with this. Starting to make some good bucks with it. Soon I'll be able to level up more things. Alright, now let's go see what these beast missions are. dollars for this? Okay. I see. To the pier. Very well, sir. Oh, we're gonna catch a bunch of fish here and we're gonna do beast mode. Whoa. So this is where you live? You live like this? Ah, Kitty, so you showed up after all. Uh, yeah, I got curious about the trading you mentioned. Glad you remembered. Can't trust the word that old drunk says, really. Hey, I'm not like him. Oh, relax, I'm just messing with you. Shall we get started? Uh, sure, I'm all ears. My training method is simple. Just grab whatever you can, swing around, and throw it until everything's smashed to hell. <laughs> Ah, I love it, Miss Tatsu. Let's go. Unga bunga. Sounds like taking your frustration out on things. But I guess there's gotta be more to it than that. Does this help you impound furniture then when you go collect? Ooh. Pretty much. It takes muscle and explosive force to grab heavy objects and swing them around quickly. This gives you the oomph you need. Uh. I see. No taking your time with it either. You have to be under pressure as if it's a real situation where there's no point in training. A real situation? You mean when collecting a debt? I guess you're pretty used to a rough time. Hey, don't act like you don't know. I may even call on you to help me out sometime. Huh? You want me to go out and collect for you? Let's not jump any guns here. First, I want you to do this training to get a feel for it, alright? Uh. Yeah, got it. We'll start with the primer. This way. <laughs> hey, Sea Cheeks! So we're just gonna grab and smash? The mannequins are filled with play money, which burst out when you break them. The boxes have money in them too. You have to smash all the mannequins before time runs out and recover a set amount of money. You good to start? Uh. uh. Yeah, I'm good. You have 120 seconds to go, so two minutes. Feels so slow. Can I get this guy? There we go. He's been bisected. Shit! Who needs a fucking katana when you have Kiryu's fists, man? Let's go. And this. Ha -ha. Damn, I'm taking forever, I feel like. Mm -hmm. 
thought all of the guitar songs in this feel so good. It also has a bit of like a retro feel to it. I can't really describe it. Locking on. Oh shit, you can do that? Uh oh. Alright. Dead. Yeah. These look like the stonks, Radicus. No, Sweet Cheeks, you're so right. Stonks. What do you think? Pretty tough training, right? Uh. Yeah, I haven't done anything like this before. Then I'll make it even harder next time. Be ready. Uh. Great. By the way. I'll have to ask you to pay if you want to keep going with this. I can only do so much for charity work. Uh. Understood. She's gonna make us do debt collection for her, isn't she? Ready, uh. go beast mode? Yeah, sounds good. Which training will you take on? Target 1 million yen. Okay. Thanks, ground. So why did they rotate this time? <laughs> it's gonna be like back damage is a thing. They so gotta time it. Holy shit, kitty! Where are we going? I see. So locking on does make it better, huh? Grab this and smart start smacking. Alright, let's go ahead and get this guy done. Oh whoops. <laughs> I tried to grab him and it made him like glitch out a little bit. And the mannequins and fight back? <laughs> and they're not mannequins anymore. <laughs> not bad. You're getting the hang of more aggressive fighting style. Here, take this. Tatsu brand drink. Come back whenever you feel like more training. You have a drink company? Is this an MLM thing? You're gonna ask me to start selling it for you? Uh. No. Training number two. Uh, I'm trying to learn the moves. I don't think I learned anything from her. Was it because I did training one and that, that didn't count, but training two will count? I guess it is. Uh, I, I can't think of no other way to do this, so I'll just go ahead and do number two now. Cost you 500,000 yen. You do make up more money than you lose there, so that's kind of funny. Alright, what's with the pimp? Does he have a gun? Does he have a gun that he shoots randomly? Oh my god! He shoots you? Can we defend against the bullet? Can we defend against the bullet? Okay, well, you know, it doesn't matter. I fucking brute forced it. Oh, you can block with your items. Dude, come on. What are we doing? Alright. With the stuff you're picking up, it makes sense. <laughs> this is the worst way to do it. Beast is a fat Dark Souls role. You're so right, though. Alright, come on. We got this box. I do like that her training is just unga bunga. It's pretty nice. After after all of the involved uh, ways to train, this is pretty good. This is pretty kind. Whoops. 
I'm just make a bit of money off of it. Alright. It lets you finish your combo, which is kind of funny, too. Unga bunga! Not bad. You're getting the hang of a more aggressive fighting style. Here's a little something for you. Come back when you feel like more training. Guys, I don't get it. How am I supposed to do the training? Oh, you must be bored of getting all this training. Let's talk about those real situations I mentioned at the start. Sure. Yeah, sure. Basically, I'm gonna ask you to help me collect on some, some scum suckers who owe big money. Some cum suckers. I'll give you a target and use what you learn to get it done, okay? Uh. I see. Oh, one thing, though. What? You gonna chicken out now? Yeah. No, I just wanted to know why you don't do this yourself. Well, I just got a little too notorious for my own good. Mm. What do you mean? Lately, I've been running into this problem where my targets already know I'm coming. So I get there and they've already flown the coop. Or worse, they're aiming guns at the door. I'm good, but I'm only good while I'm breathing. So if I get jobs that I catch a whiff of stank on, I'm going to send you. Nobody knows you just yet. I get it. You must have really made a name of yourself. <sighs> it's a pain in the ass. Anyway, I'm sure once the real battles start, your training will pay off. You'll know that I'll learn a few new moves along the way as well. And I'll even let you keep all the money you collect. How's that for a little incentive? Uh. Sounds good. I might take you up on that sometime. I get the soothing ocean sounds. Uh. Your jobs. I have a job for you, you interested? Yes! Uh. I'm in. Let me tell you who you're up against. The target's a guy named Tetsuya the Gigolo. <laughs> He's gonna make do with the money from the girls he lives off, so he has been taking out loans he's never gonna pay back. Then once the loan sharks see him drowning, he foists the loans onto some unlucky lady and moves on to the next gullible floozy. Scum of the earth, basically. Mm. And why would this be a job for me? Mm. Well, this is your first job, so I figured we'd start with someone easy to handle. Besides, guys like him just end up pissing me off too much. I see. Oh. I figured this would be a kinch, but remember, he'll do anything it takes to get away. If you slip up, you could get yourself killed. You ready for this? Yeah, I like how Miss Tatsu is like, I might accidentally kill him. Yeah, I'm ready. Alright, let's go. Tetsu the Gigolo, I take it? So slow, this walking. Mm -hmm. Huh? Is that what you're calling me out there now? <sighs> Only one thing they're gonna be calling you out there is Tetsuya the dead ass, so if you don't give me what you owe. Do that and I'm gone. Mm -hmm. You're Miss Tatsu, aren't you? I've heard all about you. I was picturing a broad built like a gorilla. And who's this guy? He your pimp? Yeah. And he's ten times better at it than you'll ever be. When did I become a pimp? <laughs> okay, kid, you. <laughs> He's like not following at all. <laughs> God, zip it, you fucking himbo! You're here to put the screws on this loser. <laughs> you two done with your little circus act? This meat sack couldn't put the screws on a plank, much less me. You think so? You're about to see what it feels like to get screwed. Mess him up, kid. You collect the debt. Uh, ah, okay. <laughs> this thing stopped to end it all. Back to the relaxing ocean ASMR. Good work, kitty. You see the look on that guy's face? He'll think twice before he gets into any more mischief. Uh. Yeah, I hope you're right. He didn't look like a quick learner, though. All that just means is you were way too nice to the guy. Have it been me? Well, nice isn't in my vocabulary. You still have a lot to learn. I may ask you to help again if something else comes up. Come back when you want to train. Holy shit, that's a lot of money. Guarded weapon charge skill. What does that mean? Tell me what it does. Tell me what it does. Uh. Okay. 
Let's go to the next job. No jobs? You're lying to me. Yes, you do. All right, we fishing? Hey, random dude. I don't know much about fishing, but is that how you hold a hook? Won't your arm get, like, hella tired? I thought you... Uh... uh, 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 uh uh, why is he holding it like that? <laughs> Got an easy starter. Thank you for the starter fish pack. Yes, I do. That guy's just cocky. He's training his fapping arm. <laughs> How do I do this again? Yeah. What am I supposed to do? Oh, yeah. A squid! Yosha! I assume this is like Persona 4 mm. Golden, where there's like a mega giant fish, and, and you're gonna hope that you luck out to get the mega giant awesome fish. Lock on already. Lock on already, you mosaic. Alright, it's drifting further and further away. It always has to be on their right? Really? Hmm. Please, tilt your head just a couple degrees downwards towards me. Fuck. Take care, Jalen Highs. If I do it like this. Mm. Come on, fishy. Please. I hate fishing mini games. Oh my god, you can you put me on my misery. Maybe we need the better rod here. Mm. Dude, I'm missing by like a million miles, but it doesn't look like it from the other screen. First bowling, now fishing. I t I literally said while bowling that it's as boring as fishing to me. I don't. Re I <laughs> I still think that's the case. I've got no bait right now. Okay, now why do you let me do that? Sea classic. I have a different fishing rod. I don't know where I got it from, but I have a different fishing mm -hmm. rod. Oh my god. C please just. Just latch on with your teeth. Give it a good bite. Nibble on it. There we go. What's that? A purse? A Boston bag. You found a gold plate inside. Oops. Mm. Okay, to the right a little bit. Hmm. Okay, latch on, you very, very... Like, I assume you're an eel? You're very long and thin. Gobby. All right, one more fish. I think, and then I think we'll have a good amount of fish for sushi gin. I think. Oh. It's edging me. Here we go. That goes to zero the mention of Gobby. Oh, what is that? A fugu? It's kind of cute. Yeah, let's stop fishing for now. All right, are you ready to give me the next, like, mission? Uh. I have so many moves unlocked. 
Okay. Is it... Are they just gonna make me come back to the dock? Is that what... Hell if I know which of these is the one that I normally go to. I... Uh... Oh, you had to do training between it? Oh my god, damn it. <laughs> I thought the beast mode was gonna be less of a pain. Is Fugu just blowfish? I don't know if I'll ever be adventurous enough to try blowfish. I know that they, 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 I know that like pro sushi chefs, it's like a, it's like a test, you know, for them. That's like a, a real good sushi chef can can cut blowfish uh, uh, sashimi and you won't die eating it. But I don't know about the odds, man. What another applicant? What kind of person is it this time? This time the applicant is a girl. I read her application and she's neat handwriting and her photo was pretty cute. Mm. I see, so she's cute. Mr. President, you better not hire her based on her looks. Uh. Uh, of course not. What do you want to do? Do you want to do the interview now? Sure. Uh. Actually, I should have done it after getting my money. Ah, mistakes were made. Great, let's do this. You need to look respectable for the interview, of course. Mm. You know? It's kind of a pain to put on glasses every time I do an interview. Can I just interview like this? Mm. Oh, heavens, no. It's important for you to look intelligent. Good God. <laughs> I see. If you say so. Merlina just wants to see Kitty McGann a QD. You. <laughs> you look really good in those, you know. Oh. Wait a minute. Are you just making me wear these because you liked them? <laughs> Well, um, actually, this is this is the equivalent of the uh, the Metal Gear Solid post I showed you guys the other day. <laughs> so what's the corset for? Uh, it's for the mm, fucking uh... <laughs> shit. Damn, I'm gonna pull this up right now. I, I I'm sorry, I'm breaking your immersion just so you can see this because it's really fucking funny. <laughs> You don't know what I'm fucking talking about, but hang on, you are about to understand. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, shit. All right, it's on my Twitter, which means we're going through a minefield. You might be- I, I need to be super careful so you're not blasted with some titties. Uh, there we go. <laughs> Let's see. I'll go with... If I put it here, there we go, there we go. <laughs> alright, alright, you ready? You ready? You ready? What's this corset even for? God, it's for. Uh. Fucking. Uh. <laughs> What's this corset even for? God, it's for. Uh. Fucking. Uh. <laughs> I love it so much. The hesitation, the eye roll, it's so oh, shit. Come up with a reason, bro. <laughs> oh, God, it's so good. Anyway, that was exactly that, except except for the glasses for Kitty. <laughs> mm. Okay, I guess you're off the hook for now. Come in. Excuse me. I'm Sakurako Jogasaki. Please meet you. Yes, likewise. Please sit. Kiryu, please just say it. Oh, right. Please have a seat. Thank you. There's so much awkward distance between the seat and him. She seems so ladylike. Yes, apparently her family runs a traditional Japanese inn. Maybe she helps, uh, helps out there? Makes sense. I can see her wearing kimono. Well, we better ask her some questions. We need to figure it out if she'll be a good fit here. Right. So, Jogosaki-san, why don't you take a minute to tell us about yourself? Hi. Yes, certainly. I'm impressed. This sounds like a real interview. <laughs> <laughs> I picked up a book on interview techniques. Oh, I kid you! No, Vera Rex, I thought the exact same. I was thinking about Yukiko from Persona 4 because she's the, like, inn's ke do keeper's daughter. Oh god, Kitty's so cute. He got a whole book just to get better at this. <laughs> He's so cute. You're studying on your own? I'm so glad you're finally taking your presidential responsibility seriously. <laughs> well, naturally. Um, may I begin? 
Oh, right. Sorry, please do. Hi. Okay, my name is Sakuraka Jogasaki. I majored in business administration. My biggest strength is that I have actual work experience. My family runs a traditional inn, so I work with guests daily while growing up. When we were short staffed, I was even put in charge of the kitchen. I learned how to cook from pros. If I ever get the chance, I would love to bring you a traditional meal. I'm confident about my eagerness and fitness. I mean, I don't give up easily. I very much hope you will give me the opportunity to prove myself to you. Also, I often get asked to interview, so I will save you the bother of doing so. I'm wearing plain white underwear, thank you. <laughs> See guys, that's why I asked the question earlier. This is just standard interview questions. What color underwear are you wearing? <laughs> wow, that was solid. She even told us the color of her underwear to shut that down quick. She's amazing. Yeah, now I don't have to ask her. <laughs> You're gonna ask her, Kiryu-san? Let's talk about what she told us. Was there anything you want to get more details on? What should we talk about in more detail? Why aren't you taking over the family in? What can you cook? Why do you feel confident in your fitness? Uh, I don't wanna... I'll, I'll ask her what she can cook. <laughs> you said you're a good cook? And what are your signature dishes? Hi. Let's see. I'm quite good at meatloaf. Omelets with rice filling. Hmm, what else? I think I just said omelet rice here. Oh, I make a pretty great white sauce. I often use it for preparing gra gratin, gratins? Gratin. I'm pre preparing gratins and European pasta dishes. It's gratin in Fr French, so I don't know what else it is. Oh, that's impressive. You can make a white sauce from scratch and you're so worldly. That's impressive. It's easy to overcook white sauce, you know? Until I got the hang of it, I found it a challenge, too. Assuming I get the job, I'd be happy to bring mo some in for you to try. <laughs> oh, really? Yes, please! Good. Hey, this is a job interview, not a restaurant. What should we talk about in more detail? Alright. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Matthew! <laughs> you know Kiryu can make a white sauce, too? <laughs> You're not special! <laughs> That's messed up, man! <laughs> Why aren't you taking over the family in? Well, I do find a job rewarding in its own way, and I love interacting with the guests. However, it's also a very small and closed world. The entire day revolves around the inn and nothing else. Even if I were to eventually inherit the inn, I would like to broaden my horizons out there in the real world before I settle into that role. Wow, she's got it all figured out. She does. What should we talk about in more detail? Why do you feel confident in your fitness? You said you have confidence in your fitness. Why is that? I belong to a dance club in my university. Dancing is more physically taxing than me up here, so I think it has helped me build up my endurance. I see. I imagine you do traditional dancing for your guests. Or maybe you can do that once you take over the inn. Perhaps. But for now, I would rather find fulfilling work at your firm than think about the family inn. So, she dances? I bet she'd look great during a traditional dance in kimono. Yeah, I wouldn't mind seeing that. And that's about all the questions we have, I think. jogasaki kusan do you have any questions regarding our firm? Hi. Yes. Not to be too forward, but is there a large inequality gap between men and women here? Yeah. N no, I wouldn't say that. <laughs> Thank you. It's a great relief to hear that. Times are changing, you know? I was hoping I could find a job that would let me work just as hard as any man. <laughs> We have to hire Jogosaki Sochan, Mr. President. She's a keeper for sure. Hmm. I'm not so sure about that. What is there to think about? A girl this courteous and so eager to work is a rare find in this day and age. She seems that way, sure. But there's something not quite right that I'm trying to figure out. Is there something wrong? I have no clue what's wrong. She does sound like a keeper. <laughs> yeah. Something's off. Something she said doesn't jive. What is it? Was it the dancing, the inn, the the the, 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 the figuring things out? She cooks, she dances, she works in the inn? <laughs> Something's wrong here. You mean she's lying about something? Uh, yeah. I can't quite put my finger on it though. Neither can I! Hmm. What did she say that struck you as inconsistent? Ask for her summary. Summary again. 
asked why she isn't taking over the family inn. She said that it was because she wanted to, uh, you know, expand her horizons. Oh, wait, she said that she wasn't taking over the family inn, but then she said she might take it. She might take over it in the future. <laughs> uh, all of the food that she could cook was foreign. I thought that was interesting. And her fitness is just because she does dance. Uh, I don't know. I guess ask for a summary again. Hi. Majored in business administration. Actual work experience. My family rather there's no inn. Or a short staff charge a kitchen. I'm confident about my eagerness and fitness. It means I don't give up easy. So often I ask it's in for you, so I will save the butter. So blah, 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 blah. Foreign food as a signature dish. Yeah, yeah, she works at a traditional restaurant. Ah, oh, a traditional inn. Ah, oh, that makes sense. They would expect Japanese food, right? Uh, holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit! Okay, let's do summary and signature dishes. It's her summary under signature dishes. Those two statements don't add up. Mm. Really? Well, now that I think about it, maybe you're onto something. Jogazaki, there's something inconsistent in your story. Inconsistent? Oh, what might that be? You said your family runs a traditional Japanese inn, and that you helped out there on a daily basis. Yes, that's correct. You said you were put in charge of the kitchen, which made you a better cook. Is that a problem? If I'm working in a kitchen, it's only natural that I should become a better cook. How could that be inconsistent? Marina, let's say you were to stay at a traditional inn. What kind of dinner would you expect? <laughs> well, if it's a traditional inn, it would of course be Japanese cuisine like sashimi and niimono. Oh, and in winter, a hot pot would be wonderful. Oh, that does sound so good. <laughs> Damn, you guys! I want some of these luxuries! Uh. Right, and what's Shogosaki good at cooking? Meatloaf, omelette with rice, white saucer gratin, and- Oh! I don't know about you, but no traditional inn I know of would serve those dishes. Have anything to say for yourself, jogosaki san I should be playing, like, the Ace Attorney music. <laughs> wow, so you're really gonna nitpick me on something that minor, huh? I bet you're a real hit with the ladies. Jogosaki-san! Yes, you're right. I made it all up. Grew up in a traditional inn? Are you kidding? I came up with that to spruce up my resume, so what? But... Incidentally, I also lied about being a good cook. I got too carried away with the details, I guess. Was everything a lie? Even the part about doing traditional dance at school? You're the ones who assumed it was traditional dance. I really do belong to a dance club at school. But my kind of dance is hip-hop! Hip, hip and hop, Marina, you boomer. <laughs> I'm so done here. Hurry up with my cab fare. I'll settle for 20,000 yen. Uh, okay. Wait, we don't pay scammers. Huh? huh? That's not what you promised. The posting said I'd get cab fare for taking an interview. Why else would I bother coming? You should be ashamed, you liars. Seems to me you're a liar too. It's okay for you to lie, but not us. Huh? huh? What's that supposed to mean? You don't make a damn bit of sense! Uh? You just don't want to face the facts. Get over yourself, princess! Princess! Can you? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> huh? I bet you got everything you wanted your whole life, huh? Well, wise up. Out in the real world, nobody is going to pay you for self-centered lying through your teeth. Uh? Unless you're a politician. Ah, gah, 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 gah. The real world is a jungle, not a playground, and nobody gets anything they don't earn, so get out of my sight. <laughs> Sheesh. I hope I never get on your bad side, Mr. President. Uh, yeah. Sorry for shouting. <sighs> it's okay, but wow, that was impressive how you caught that inconsistency in your story. I didn't realize until you pointed it out. Yeah, it was kind of impressive, wasn't it? <laughs> I'm beginning to find a new respect for you, President Kiryu. Oh, but I guess I have to start over with recruiting. Uh. Yeah, thanks for taking care of that. Of course, sir. Your ace secretary has your back. I feel like we're doing fine without another recruit. <laughs> but I'm doing it for the sub-stories. Nom nom. Yeah, uh, 
You know, does security even matter in these areas anymore now that we own all of it? I assume it probably does. Oops, I forgot to level that last building up. Protected your properties. Hey, Blind Lurker. Alright, let's go ahead and swap some people out here. Takeshi, you're so interesting. Um, and... Wait, level up. Level up! Yeah, the Pleasure King is still out there. I really need to buy some more buildings there. Alright, this is kind of sort of worth it to say some time. <laughs> see them help you is great. Yeah. Getting to see them fight is nice. Hey, Blind Lurker, you have big PP energy. And for a few of them, probably not everything yet because it's even more expensive there yet. Uh, why? Why does it have to get so much more expensive? Oh, we gotta do all of the beast mode things too. Alright. Pleasure King is one of Rayu's utter titles. Thank you, Ground. You're fine, the guy. You're okay. You don't gotta be so dramatic. So I bumped into you. You're, yo, yo, recover. Let's see what we can get from the shrine, because it's been a bit since we visited. Exchange. You can't stop me. <laughs> that is the most intimidating thing I have ever heard. Alright, so I think we're in a Pleasure King district. Who's that clown? He's just some dude. He, he gives you like DLC stuff, I think. I assume they're DLC stuff that like came with like PS4 or something. They're just like extra goodies, some car parts. You guys are really crowding this one place and I'm just trying to see if I can buy any of these buildings. Please. No buildings? No buildings here? <gasps> Feels bad. This one looks like one I could buy. Yeah! Oops. I thought I have enough. Yeah! Where else counts as it? It's a telephone club! Although there are SM clubs here. Ah, uh, business. Oh, it's this whole fucking area. Oh, okay. How are we gonna find all of these buildings? Oh, another one. Lucky. Oh, that sign for the most expensive in this area. That was like 150 million yen. Take care, Varium. One of everything, please. Just a luxury store? Is there anything that Kiryu needs to use for? Because I know Majima can use like luxury goods to recruit women, <laughs> but but what can Kiryu do with it? Yes, I say. Yeah, these things are all really fancy. Take care, Sarkam Knight, part two.
what is this? Shoji. Uh, not today. Oh, not Mr. Shakedown. Hey. Got any telephone cards to show you? Here, did I already show you this one? I might have. Oh, thanks. Oh, fine. <laughs> Why are you in the weirdest, most shady place you can be? Shoji and Majum to finish every side quest. We'll find out. Remember me, he says. I won't. Twitch chat plays Shoji. I believe in you guys. You guys would be able to do it. We'll put our collective brains to it. Oh my god, I'm really just bumping the shit out of these people. My fault. Ha-pa! Still my favorite move. It's just so efficient. Three homies at once, you know? Which mode can you taunt in again, and how do you do it? I have no clue what buildings I can buy! You can taunt in any style? What button do I press? Oh. Homies, I just wanna buy- I just wish I- could, I wish it would just tell me which buildings I could buy so I don't have to pull up a guide and do it. I'm being pouty about it. Sometimes it's like the really shiny buildings. You're like, oh, I can walk up to it and buy it. Buy this, pants grab. Don Quixote. <laughs> Hello, Kirisama. What do you like today? Here's some fish. Champion district bars? What are those? Can I give you all of these? Uh. How about this one? Perfect. This will really help me. I'll prepare it right away. Hey, Dachi. Umayna. Oh, yummy. How is it, Kirisama? Uh. It's good. <laughs> really? Thank you. I feel like working with fresh caught fish like this really helped me grow. <laughs> I'm glad I could help. I really appreciate it. If you go fishing again, please bring me your catch. I got more for you. I, I don't think I brought enough to max out your, your thing, though. <laughs> Champion District Bars? Champion District is that area in the top right that's all cluttered and kind of small with two bars. Ah, uh, God. Oh, there's still a couple we haven't tried. Num 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 num. Oh, oh man. Man, I get such a visceral reaction seeing food I want to try. I want to go. I want to go eat it. <laughs> Golden guy? Here's a gobby. I thought you said food instead of food. Yeah, I get a really visceral reaction when I see a hot food girl. Uh. <laughs> I want to ride it. Okay, one more. You don't say nothing. <laughs> Imagine the sushi stuff is excitable when you brought him. It's just a purse you fished up. It only uh, accepts fish. Just a shoe. It's like, how, what do you mean this isn't a, a fish? 
I got it from the ocean. Uh. <laughs> All right, so how many more do we need? Like maybe two more and then we'll be done? Game has karaoke songs that are in later games. That's insane. Dude, honestly, this game is so well polished. I love it so much. I love that you go into a restaurant and the background ambiance is so different. <laughs> it's just so cool. All right. Oh, sorry, my fault. Go in. Do we have an interview? Maybe that was the last of our interviews. Oh, uh oh. Why are you angry with me? Hmm. Hey, what's the matter? You look upset. Mr. President, I'm disappointed in you. What did I do? Huh? I never thought you were the kind of person who'd go to these kinds of places, Mr. President. Oh. Hey, hold your horses. What the heck are you talking about? Well, just look at this. It's a coupon. For an adult shop. Dear valued customer, to show our appreciation for your repeated patronage, we'd like to offer you our services for absolutely free. Please drop by our shop with this postcard to redeem this exclusive offer. Mm. Absolutely free, huh? Wow. Aww. What do you mean, wow? You go to these kinds of places so often they're giving you loyalty rewards? Uh, uh no. That's not me. Well, at least I've never been to that shop. <sighs> then why do you get this postcard? And wait, are you saying you've been to other places? I don't know what to think. Yeah. Hey, don't judge. Besides, are you sure it's really addressed to me? You sure it's not for Yamanoi, son? Yeah. Well, don't drag me into this. Yeah. No, it's got to be for you. <laughs> the sender and address C are, huh? Yeah. What's wrong? It's addressed to me. See? I knew it. But the sender is the Pleasure King. Yeah. What? Does that mean the Pleasure King is challenging uh. you? Most likely, yeah. We've taken over a bunch of properties in the Pleasure King's territory already. It makes sense. The Pleasure King has gangs of hooligans under his control. You should be careful if you're going to face uh. him. Right. Thanks for the heads up. This little shop is on Sendryu Avenue. I'll go and check it out. Why not? It's absolutely free, right? Ugh, come on. You know that's not why I'm going. The Pleasure King wants to see me. I should head over to Sendryu Avenue. Sword fight with the Pleasure King. <laughs> no, my money. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, this grind is killing me. All right, so where? Sendryu Avenue. It doesn't mark it for me. It is Sendryu Avenue North and then Sendryu Avenue Avenue. So I'll just go there, I guess. I just realized they do put the street name as you're entering it in the uh as you're there in the bottom left corner. <laughs> I am about to have two problems. I'll be doing the bruising, I think. Oh, can I not grab that? Fuck! Misunderstood! That sign looks so tempting, though. So, I'm supposed to go in quick mode, and then I go up to him? <laughs> There's something scarier than, like, a quick key to you. <laughs> He's like... Killing him in every blind spot. Jesus, Kiryu, that was amazing. Oh, a diamond plate. Shit, that's value. Isn't, uh, there's a pawn shop. It's down there. Alright, this should be Sendio Avenue, I think, right? No, one more.
<laughs> fat kid, you're running at you in, <laughs> in fat rush style. I, 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 I trust him. He's coming here to give me a hug. Okay, this is a pink alley. Bum, bum, bum. Can I buy this? No. What this? No. I'm just checking these buildings here. Also, you know, like walking here in case there's some kind of uh, side story I haven't seen yet. Oh, nothing here. Oh, there's Mr. Shakedown though. Just turn left and walk down Center the Avenue and, and, and see where we're supposed to be. Is this it? Yeah! Hmm? Is that? It was so awful. Oh, honey, I know how you feel. I realize it was hard on you, but you know you really can't deny your customer like that. If you quit now, all your hard work will be for nothing. But, but it will be okay. Nothing bad will happen. Leave it to me, honey. You trust me, don't you? Yes, of course. I've never been able to trust anyone else in this business, but I trust you like an older sister. <laughs> then you do what your big sis says, okay? Just hang in there a little bit more for me. Okay, thanks for looking out for me. I'll work even harder. Oh. Hmm. What a basic biatch. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Complaining about a customer's little fetish like that. Jaguar Chan. Yes. I think it's about time we offer that little tuna to the usual fish market. To them? Don't you think it might be a bit too soon for that? Maybe we should see how things go. If that hussy is getting a huffy over a little thing like that, we can't expect to make much of her in the future. Besides, she worked enough to pay back her debt, and then some. She might realize it soon, so now is the time to do it. Understood. <laughs> oh, women are so stupid. And the men who spend big money on them are equally stupid. I suppose in the end, they're all just idiots eating each other out. Hmm? That's... Oh, my. If it isn't Kiryu-chan, you naughty boy. You should have let me know you were here. You look sexy as always. Heart. Mm -hmm. So, did you come here to have some fun? Our free coupon got your attention, did it? You're a big boy with a healthy appetite after all, Kiryu-chan. No, that's not it. You're the one who called me out here. Oh, now that you mention it. You're right. I absolutely forgot about that. Silly me. Honey, won't you play a little game with me? A game? <laughs> you took on the Leisure King in a karaoke battle, right? I want some one-on-one -on -one time with you too. What's it gonna be? What kind of battle would this be? Mm, let's see. We're all adults here, so we can make it something fun. Oh, I know. Let's make it a telephone club battle. What? <laughs> How does that work? Oh, oh my god. A telephone club battle? Yeah. Right. If you manage to score a date with a girl within three minutes, you win. How's that hot stuff? Of course, if you win, you get a slice of my property pie. If you lose, you give me a share of your holdings instead. Oh. How can I trust you? You run these places. Is there going to be some kind of catch? Oh. I'm not going to do anything shady. That's the T for truth. Oh my god. <laughs> I hate the way you talk. A game's no fun if you cheat. Don't you trust me? We'll use the Telltale Boys Club. I'm not involved in the management there, so the battle will be fair and square. Would that be okay with you? Oh, damn. Got cake, though. <laughs> the cake's kind of incredible, isn't it? I like how Clearo immediately zones in on a cake with me. Mm, those thighs could crush me. Sure, that's fine. <laughs> okay, then. Let's do this. Okay, let's get it on, honey. I win if I score a day with a girl in three minutes, right? <laughs> That's right. No shade, but you don't seem like the type to go to telephone clubs. Do you really think you can pull this off? <laughs> <laughs> don't judge a book by its cover. If you get a date with a girl in three minutes, you win. We did this once before. I have no clue how to do this. I hope I remember. 
The mechanics of a shooting game. Describe your body. Girls are calling. Chatting up the girl. <gasps> okay. If you want to hang up, hold L1. This can be useful if you have a bad feeling about a girl. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> okay, vital questions. Oops. <laughs> the premature e ejaculation version. He wasn't intense enough. Here we go, the real version. <laughs> I love him so much. <laughs> that was something. Mm -hmm. uh, how do I do this? Uh, do you do you worry? I guess, or is it do you work? A fashion boutique? I say so much. Yes, I do. I am. It's real exciting. It's Riku Ehara. Real estate. You're serious, Dan. You have big the energy. Loaded. Yeah. Loaded with a white sauce. Which one am I supposed to do? Describe your body? That's the right one? It's glowing! Why is that the right choice? Oh my! She knows what she's doing. She knows what she's doing. My boobs are bouncing boobily. Was it fun to talk to? Fun to talk to. Fungal to toenail. Oh my god. This is so hard. This is the hardest shooting game I've ever played. A Valorant who? <laughs> Why does he look so intense? What should I call you? <laughs> Stewart. Adana <laughs> Adana. Tara, what I think about her. Uh, easy to talk to. What's your face like? <laughs> These are not the right questions to ask. Oh my. I see everything. My goodness, yeah, guys! I uh, <laughs> to, uh, just uh, Twitch TOS. Why is I have to do this? To progress in the game. Oh, she has the double mole. She has the double mole. First kiss, French kiss, first aid. Please call the hospital for me. <laughs> I'm still waiting. Your type. Girls like Yuna. Girls like you. Who knows Yuna? Oh man, this is hard. So I can do like backflips and shit. Oh my god. What should I ask her about? Young baby ferrets. Your your blue feathers. Your best feature. Oh fuck! Oh, <laughs> <You're a bad laughs> <boss. laughs> oh god! I fucked up! I think so. I think so. Oh god! Oh my god! Okay, come on. We're gonna be okay. We're gonna okay. We'll be okay. We're gonna recover from this. Oh, she makes me feel. She makes me feel relaxed. Stop dodging me. Okay. Yes, it's getting kind of hard. Yes, nice and relaxed. Can we meet? Okay. Let's go. 
We're in, boys. <laughs> I feel like a perverted own man right now. <laughs> what the fuck is what what am I looking at? I don't know what you like. <laughs> Love. How's that? I scored a date. <laughs> oh, honey, I should have known you'd get around. You were fabulous. Congratulations. Fabulous. Wait, how do you know how the conversation went? No way. Yeah. Yes way. The caller on the other end was me. <laughs> it was me all along. Oh, God. Nani? No! No! How can that be? That voice was completely different! Oh, don't underestimate the Pleasure King. It's easy peasy for me to change my voice like that. <laughs> wow, but your seduction technique was so fierce. You really turned me on. I'm never going to make this mistake again. Oh, come on. Don't be so uptight. We had our little fun and I'll give you a share by area as promised. <laughs> Damn, damn, we were 1% away from 69. <laughs> I won, but somehow I feel like I lost. Oh dear, you've managed to close the gap with me again. I'd bet it gets pretty serious soon. Oh, Jaguar Chan? Yes. Hmm. hmm. What? Be a dear and take care of him, would you? Daddy. Hey, you haven't taken advantage of our absolutely free service offer, right? This is my present for you, honey. And don't forget, I'm not going to let you off so easy next time. <laughs> that is, of course, if you manage to survive after dealing with these boys. Well then, I hope you enjoy your service. Oh. Hey, wait. Whoa, excuse me, sir. You don't need to deal with us. No substitutions allowed during this promotion. <laughs> okay, and let's get started. Enjoy our absolutely free service. All right. No! Um, uh... He was dead. I'm here. Holy crap! <laughs> Let's go, Kiryu! <laughs> oh, God, it's brutal! Like wrestling moves, man! Let's go, Kiryu! Ugh, talk about a rough customer. Sorry about that. Don't worry, I never come back to a place like this. The Pleasure King. He's more tough and cold-blooded than I thought. I'll have to face him in battle soon, and it's not going to be easy. Yay, chat with friendly girls. Well, I guess we can just go get our money for now. Do you guys know where the nearest building that I can buy is? <laughs> I hate trying to find them so much. Let's see. I'm missing Cabaret Valentine Ogando Arts Moscow Western Cuisine. That could be anywhere. This area is pretty big. Damn. <laughs> Can't interrupt her phone call. Ba -ba -ba -da. Oh, he can, can he not walk here? Okay, I guess those are off limits entirely. None of the remaining businesses needs a friendship? Okay, that's nice. Good to know. Good to know. Are we close to the place? Yeah, we're close to the thrift shop, so I'll go there first. You <laughs> Robert, you have there is no shame for you having to look up the buildings at all. I just I just can't do it right now very easily without alt tabbing. 
and everything will be weird. <laughs> Guys, I'm haunted by the cabaret club music. <laughs> it's, it haunts me. Alright, let's see. Looking to sell. I want to sell all these plates. Can't wait, music hasn't played in a month and you're still haunted by it. I'm very susceptible to music. It's like once in a while I still hear the Godskin Apostle music in the back of my head. <laughs> It haunts me. You don't understand how much music haunts me sometimes. Ba, ba, ba. Cabaret Valentine's at the corner north from the save and taxi stand. I'll keep, try to keep that in mind. Renry, thank you. Can Apostle theme played in so many battles? Yeah, it really did. It was a bop, don't get me wrong, but God, it played a lot. Do we have to do this every time, Pleasure King? Shindom victory. Right, these are done. Um, guess I'll swap out here. Oh, if I get leave you in time. Going for someone lower, but I just didn't want to get cucked. <sighs> this is probably the stupidest way to spend my money, but I don't regret it. It's fine. It will pay us off eventually. You guys said there was something you do in the bars in the top right of the map? That's what investing is, you're right, Hollow. Clink, 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 clink. Water's the best with ice in it. Ice cold! So I said north from the taxi and the save point. Here? That all the way down there? Like that? Little that little corner? That seems so far away. Bum 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 if I buy the businesses now, I can make more money while I'm uh, idling around town still. Grinding things out on Kiryu. So here? Or was that the taxi or something? Yeah, that was the taxi. Whoops, got too excited for no reason. Why? Where could it be? Maybe here? That's not it. Maybe this? Yeah! Thank you, Renry. Whoops. Yes. Huh. <gasps> This animation is so much! 
Okay, so we bought the most expensive thing in this area. Nice. That was a huge chunk of it, too. And then, last thing for business is in this area. I'm missing Ogondo Arts in Moscow Western Cuisine, if you guys can take me there. I love sunshine. Is <laughs> you can look into uh, Majima's side from here, too. How fascinating. <laughs> There's nobody there. He's practicing. He's practicing for when there is going to be people. He can use the kind of homie to rehearse what he has to say like 20 times in front of the mirror. Number two in a Pleasure King is near Quarter Latin. I have no clue where that is, Vera Johnson. Quarter Latin. What is Quarter Latin? Is it a place? <laughs> What's this place? Mahjong? Yeah, I don't think we're gonna win Mahjong ever. <laughs> Morgana and Mouse goes to the far east. And learn Mahjong eventually. No! I missed the Mahjong so crazed that went around a while back. I don't want to bring it back. I'm in the east now, but where go? Like, these areas east? I'll just check this wall here real fast. You beat Millennium naked. You can handle Mahjong. I just have to learn it. I don't want to... I don't want to spend the effort learning it. <laughs> Here. I, I don't see him. I, I just walked around. At uh, the very corner? Oh. Nice. Thank you. And then there's one more place. This place? Nope. That's the last one we got. Oops. Moscow Western Cuisine. I'll check the other side. Go north a bit at the purple star. Hey. Yeah, the seamless battle transition is honestly pretty pog. Dude, you just took out a knife. Move on you. <laughs> I don't want to use a heat move on you so can you get up. Thanks. So you guys here north of it at the purple star, so here I assume this is the purple star you mean the entertainment star? Whoops, went inside. No. No, not, not again. I can't be catfished again, not twice in one night. <laughs> this one? This one? 
in here. <laughs> oh. I feel like I'm going inside. Trying to find this last place. It's not in here. So what do you mean, other side? This way? Oh, thank you. Oh, <laughs> they're right next to me. They serve light meals first thing in the morning. Perfect for folks who've been up all night. Which I do. Purchase. Thank you. I miss the cabaret club. I never thought I'd say this, but I miss the cabaret club. <laughs> oh, sweet cabaret club. Now we're gonna go there, and the Pleasure King's gonna have frozen my assets, and I have to go fight the Pleasure King. I saw her, and I was like, is that him? The Pleasure King? That was more fun because of the music. This one's just less fun because uh, you just have to go back to the same place over and over. Even if you're across town, you have to come here. Mm. And what's the matter? You look upset again. Again, Mr. President? Huh? You have postcards from sex shops again! In fact, you have two of them this time! Uh, I think my controller disconnected for a second. Two? Well, I bet they're from the Pleasure King. Dear valued customer, join us this holiday for a Christmas miracle. Our mistress will deck your halls by punishing you in a Santa costume. And of course, you can be the naughty red-nosed reindeer. Please drop by and check us out for a special event. We look forward to seeing everyone on the naughty list. You know, this is like the second Christmas thing, which means that Yakuza is a Christmas movie. Hmm. Is that a challenge for the Pleasure King? What on earth could he mean by Santa costume? Is that a secret message? Yeah. Hang on. This is addressed to you, Yamanoi san <laughs> What? Oh, is that from where I went the other day? No, that can't be. What? Aww. Yamanoi san mm -hmm. uh, Um, oh, uh, I, uh, so what? Don't judge me. And what about the other postcard? The other one is actually from the Pleasure King. The text is the same as last time. I guess he wants to go to the same place as before. <sighs> Considering the Pleasure King's area is mostly ours now, he must be quite desperate. I'm betting he'll try to shut us down by force. You'll need to make sure you're ready for anything. Uh. You're right. On the flip side, this is also an opportunity for us to crush them. I'll put an end to this. We're counting on you, Kiri-san. Please be careful, Mr. President. Uh. Yeah. Yamnoi-san, may I have a word with you later? Sure. I need your head to send your avenue to face the Pleasure King. <laughs> Stop using the business address for your weird, perverse things, <laughs> Yamanoi son. <laughs> then again, I guess Kitty still doesn't have a home, so he's continuously sleeping uh, homeless right now. Where's the drugstore? Is that it? Yeah, it is. The billionaire hobo. <laughs> that do be key to you right now. I like how the game just t completely ignores the money you make on a real estate job. Kitty is 19 in this? Yeah, he's 19 and Maji was like 22, you guys said it. Because I was like, I can't believe Maji was my age. It's going to make me feel real old when I'm older than him. <laughs> then again, I guess the rest of the Yakuza series exists. Where he's hella older than me. Kitty is 20 and Maji was 24. <laughs> Majima! There's the drugstore. Was that Mr. Libido? Libido? 
Ugh, I screwed up. What's wrong? You seem a little down. Oh, hey. Well, I went to a no-touching bikini bar and I reached out and touched the dancer. Ugh, sleazy. So you got kicked out? I just couldn't help myself. I guess self-control isn't one of your strengths. Anyway, are you getting any lately? That's not what I'm here for. Not everyone's like you. You kidding? Then what are you doing in Kamurocho, the land of sexy ladies? Is it? Duh. Let's see, for example, there's a girl who calls the telephone club who sounds really flirty. I'd do anything to date a girl like that. Maybe I'll look for her if I feel like it. <laughs> what? What wouldn't I give to get my hands on a video of a girl like her? I keep it under lock and key and treasure it forever and ever and ever. It's kind of messed up, but you know how in this game, this this whole gimmick here is basically you're finding uh you find girls like just doing their jobs and then you like pick up a card and you can find uh, a video of like like a soft porn, <laughs> porn tape at the tape club. <laughs> I'm realizing the modern day equivalent of just like seeing someone cute in the streets and then looking up their OnlyFans later. <laughs> Things haven't... Uh, this, this is it. This is, this is replicating it perfectly. Let's see. Then it's stock up. No, we did. No, no, I'm trying to get out. I'm trying. I'm trying to leave. Yakuza is kind of a life simulator. <laughs> life imitates art. Uh, then I just go one street over and just head down again because I have no clue where that building is. Probably where that crowd is over there. Yep. Someone's... They're kneeling. They're kneeling like obedient little puppies. You decided to come, Kiryu-chan. I love a man with courage. It's so sexy. I'm not here for your sweet talk. Hurry up and tell me what you want. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be so hasty, honey. I'll tell you what. Kiryu-chan, I'll give you one chance. One chance to pull out of this area right now. If you do, I'll spare your life and everyone gets a happy ending. And if I don't? Oh, you know what's going to happen. I'll get rid of anyone who gets in my way. If you don't pull out, <laughs> I will kill you and take it all back. <laughs> Fine, but let me say something too. Leave this area now. If you do, I'll let you live. <laughs> Fabulous. Then let's settle this, shall we? Um. I'm sorry, honey. You're all by your lonesome and I've got my entourage here. But you understand it's because I'm a vulnerable little girl, don't you? I'm sure you don't mind. <laughs> yeah, right. The muscles you're packing there say you're anything but, but that's fine. I'll take you all out. Oh, you're so manly. If you weren't my enemy, I'd be all over you, big boy. Well, I'll give you the Pleasure King's ultimate service, all for absolutely free, honey. Aww. So get ready to take it all in. <laughs> the point. Oh, hey. I guess it really is spike real time. All right, we're going to beast mode. No, beast mode, don't drop what I'm trying to use. All right. What the hell is that? What are you doing? Alright, here we'll grab this thing, go over the head. Because I remember, you can smack! Hiya! Are you guys proud of me for remembering that? I'm proud of me. <laughs> I always miss that one. Until now! <laughs> I 
I want you guys to get the double angle. Finally, under Oda, 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 Oda. Thank you, Clover. Finally, the recognition here. Game, recognize game. All right, I have no more. Ah, uh, dodge, kitty. No, put your guard up. Go stop, grab and snap. oh my god! I saw up the skirt for a second. Did you guys see up a skirt for a second? <laughs> I saw everything. I saw everything for just a moment. The dream is alive. Oh boy. All right, I saw God. Oh my God, please, Pledger King. Holy shit, I'm like, you're making me bounce off the wall and shit. Sean seems so raw, and I feel like I, I have to say sorry. Okay, smack! Yeah! Let's go! Grab! God, he's so hot! He's so cool! Oh, complete domination! <laughs> I knew the moment I laid my eyes on you. If you weren't my enemy, we could have been lovers. <laughs> if we weren't enemies, we could have been friends, maybe. <laughs> Aww! Kitty just like, no, I'm too much of a virgin. Never would have happened. Friends? Oh, you're such a tease. Like you promised, you need to leave this area. Sure, I did promise after all. Besides, now that people are starting to pick up on some tricks I was turning on the down low, it's time for me to pull out and sashay away. I'll start again somewhere else, honey. Some place where no one will get in the way of how I run my runaway. Next time, make sure you think about people over profits. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. After all, I don't want someone like you swooping in and snatching away my business again. Honey, are you serious about taking back Kamodocho? Yeah, you bet. Okay, listen, taking me down won't get hope you get rid of the five billionaires. A new billionaire will rise to take my place. There are plenty of rich boys ready to get nasty for that chance. So, what should I do? You need to find the beef beneath the bulge. <laughs> the beef beneath the bulge. The one who's really controlling the five billionaires. Isn't that one of the five? Oh, I'll never tell. I'd be killed if I said too much. I hope you understand if I bite my tongue, honey. Well, no need for me to hang around here much longer. I should really get going. Here's a present for you. What's this? Yeah. <laughs> My phone number, honey. Call me anytime, Kiryu chan. Uh, I don't want it. Oh, you're just being bashful. We're no longer enemies after all. And since we're no longer enemies. <laughs> He's looking directly at it. And since we're no longer enemies, I'd be happy to give you some pointers on managing adult entertainment centers. They're all time Welcome Peg. home, my ghostling. Think of tearing up for eight months. <laughs> Appropriately timed, Ray you Peg. Hmm. That might actually be helpful. Fabulous. Of course. It absolutely won't be for free. <sighs> You're still all business, aren't you? Kitty you! Kitty you, you sound a little disappointed! <laughs> I'll kill you! You into him? 
Oh, and my boy Jaguar Chan here. He still wants to work in Cabernet so would you mind hiring him? He's such a good boy and he's always eager to please. That's fine. We need all the help we can get. Thank you very much. <laughs> wow. See you later, Kiryu-chan. Maybe you can clean up this town a little bit and save it from all the greed and vice. I'll be watching over from afar, honey. Do your best. Open-minded Kiryu. Look at the way she runs. <laughs> so caked. So <laughs> uh, me and Kiryu both just watched her run, dude. <laughs> what a sight to see. <laughs> What is it? Hate to see them go, but love to see them leave. So then, who's actually controlling the five billionaires? Looks like this rabbit hole only gets deeper. It's kind of obvious. We, we kind of kicked like four of their asses. There's one left, Kiyu. It seems... Oh, there's still more. It seems the Pleasure King has been taken down as well. Indeed. That Kiryu character. I didn't think he'd get this far. What should we do? Should I take him out now? Yeah. No, leave him alone. We don't know if you're going to be able to beat him either. What? Ouch, my feelings. For once, we've got someone who could give us an interesting challenge. Let's sit back and enjoy this while it lasts. It is also a good opportunity to see what the rest of you are capable of. You understand what I mean, don't you? Certainly. We are merely the hands and feet at your command. Kazuma Kiryu. All right, so we got this whole area down. We can go get some mad bucks now. All right, let's help this dude. You want to get bruised, boy? Yeah. I'm a freak like that. I love Kitty so much. Seriously, the heat moves and the way it zooms out, it's all so slick and well done. <laughs> Yakuza is such a good game. Uh oh. Eh. Okay, fine. I guess I should go back to this one. After I went through all that trouble. Alright, which way was I going? Yeah, this way. Slightly better torridor. Stop giving me drinks you've taken a sip out of. <laughs> this is the weirdest thing. I'm grateful for the free gift, I guess. Indirect kiss. Who even is that, homie? You don't play, Yakuza. You live, Yakuza. Miku gets it. You become, Yakuza. Yeah, it's time for me to check out the Gambling King area. Oh, that's gonna be a pain. That's a whole other area, you know. Wow, spinning is falling off. Sashiko time. Do I have anything to level here? No, this place is done. Alright, Miracle. I think you give me the best value here, maybe. Maybe, well, actually, maybe, maybe Pleasure King does. Let me test it out. Is pretty well, too. Also, costs a pretty penny. But less than. Le, le, less than Miracle Johnson. Uh. Am I right to assume Miracle might be the fastest one? 
apartment was getting so expensive now. Fine. Oh wait, that was a waste. Don't look at me. No one even perceived that one. Just wasting my money. You know how it is. Looks like we're good to go. And start. And now it's time to do the gambling king area. Ugh. Is it a store list? Oh, what? Oh, it only shows it to you after you get it, huh? <laughs> Why did they do it beforehand? Alright, do we have any more interviews? Oh. Yes, we do. Mm. Oh, I looked at the application, but the photo was blurry and the writing was messy and illegible. But the applicant's a college graduate. He's a med school Boy. student. Hey, is it just me or did the quality of our applicants just fall off the cliff? Uh, don't get so picky. There aren't many college grads who are willing to apply to a company like ours. Not true. College grads... <laughs> Maybe true for the time, but nowadays college grads be ap applying for anything. We're short on manpower and don't have any other applicants, so beggars can't be choosers. I didn't know we were in such bad shape. Well, we are, so what do you want to do? Would you like to interview the applicant now? Yes. Uh. Okay, sure. I'll interview the candidate. Okay, then. Here we go. Please, get ready for the interview. Please put on your glasses. <laughs> She's no longer asking. She is demanding. Put on your glasses. Uh, okay. Uh, there's so just something about a solidly built man wearing glasses, you know? Medina is base and correct. No. No, I don't. Just waiting to see Maji wearing glasses. Oh, he's here. Let's do this interview. Uh, yeah. Maybe a Monaco for Maji. Come in. Excuse me. I... I am... I'm, I'm Saichi... Koshimizu, please to, to heat you. Heat? S sorry. Uh, <laughs> I like how cute he's like, heat? Like heat move? Are we fighting? <laughs> S sorry. Uh, uh, bit my tongue. Ple please be to meet you. Uh, have a seat. R right. Thank you. Mm. The guy's super nervous. Mm. Yes, he is. He's so nervous. He's giving me the jitters too. So, what kind of guy do we have here? What does that resume say? It says his handwriting is terrible. I can hardly read it. What I could determine is that his name is Saichi Koshimisu and that he's a university grad. <laughs> what the fuck does it say? I don't know. <laughs> he writes like shit. So, uh, we don't know anything about this guy. I'm surprised you even granted him an interview. I'm sorry. Frankly, we're desperate for any help we can get, but this guy... I, I think we have to turn him down. Uh, come in. Oh, come in. I'll get the door. Sorry, we'll have to put the interview on hold. S -s certainly. <laughs> and they were both bottoms. <laughs> Uh, Koshimizu, why did you apply with us? Eh? Pardon? Um, isn't the interview on hold? Yeah. I just thought I'd talk to you while we wait. And that should help you break the ice and be less nervous, right? Oh, Kitty is the sweetest man alive. <laughs> he makes my heart swell like 20 times bigger. My balls fill with cum. I love him so much. I... I guess that's true. Th thank you. When I was young, my father ran a small real estate agency. Oh, so your family business was in real estate? Eh. Yes. I remember the smiling faces of customers when they were leaving his office. Nobody went away unhappy. Kikyo dai! 
Welcome, welcome in. Thank you so much for Raid. How is your stream? How are you doing? Road96, never heard of it. How is it? Homies, if you guys haven't heard of KQ Diet, please check him out. He's got amazing taste in games. And he used to be my sibling what, back when we were both kind of, sort of, corporal. <laughs> All right. Oh, it's that balls. They're just on a different place than you're used to. Equestone, this is so... This is so frightening. I have the ball ovaries. All right, we be playing Yakuza. It's a branching narrative game. I do love branching narrative games. <laughs> I'll check it out. I'm really excited for it. I've also like heard Stray has been really good. I don't know if that's a branching narrative though. That's just because it came out like today and everyone's playing it. Yakuza's going great. We're interviewing a dude and, and Kitty was being a sweetheart. Memoria! Welcome all my ghosting. Thank you guys for five months. Let's go. Let's go! Five whole months. Thank you so much. Alright. Let's, let's finish up this sub story. Just uh, uh, too long didn't read. This homie so far is going for an interview. He's super nervous and seems to be pretty genuine, I think. Yes. I remember the smiling faces of customers when they were leaving his office. Nobody went away unhappy. My father always said he wanted to make people happy through his work, and I was always so proud watching him do it. What I didn't understand at the time was that he made very little profit that way. Our finances were in shambles. I respect my father, but I don't want to be like him. Why is that? I want to make customers happy, but I also want to make my own family happy. The family I might have in the future. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sure I probably sound like some idealistic kid with no knowledge or real world experience. Kitty's like, same, bro. Koshimizu, did you mean every word of what you just said? <laughs> uh, yes, I think so. But probably, I, I don't think I lied to you. Uh, he probably means what he said. He's not like the fake interviewees we had before. I think I can trust him with our work. <sighs> But either way, I don't think I'll get the job here. What made you say that? I overheard your secretary saying you had to turn me down. Oh, you heard that? You heard that? Oh, God. Oh, I'm cringing. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Koshi Music. I'm getting on my knees. I am so sorry. <laughs> I know I didn't say it, but I'm so, so sorry. Damn. He heard that. <laughs> Hey, Vulture! Oh god, damn! I don't want to waste any more of your time. I think I should leave now. Nani? What? You're leaving? Yeah. Yes, I'm sorry you had to do this for me. I don't need cat fare or anything. Hey, hold on. I think you deserve a chance. Don't just go. <laughs> really? But... In fact, I'm leaning towards hiring you. <laughs> what? Huh? But you haven't even interviewed me yet. Sometimes you can tell the measure of a man by looking him in the eye and having a conversation. Th thank you very much, but your secretary said I'm not good enough. Mm. Yeah, that's the problem. I let Merlina handle all the hiring decisions. If I want to hire Koshimizu, he has to win her approval. Koshimizu, there's only one thing I can tell you. Y yes Do your best in the interview and win my secretary over. But, but I get re really, really nervous. I always get rejected after interviews if I even make it that far. It will be fine. I'll help you as much as possible, so do your best. Hi. I... I'll do it. I m might get nervous, but but I'll give it my best... Le uh, my blessed effort. Oh, boy. I'll have to help him out where I can... I got <laughs> I'll have to help him out where I can so he can make a better impression on Marina. I'm sorry for the hold-up. Shall we resume our interview? Y yes please I, l I love interviews. I think this application is a bust. Let's get this over with quickly and send him on his way so we can arrange for the next interview. Hey, no need to be that cold about it. I promise you nothing, Pete. I'll choose whatever choices I feel is right. He gets too flustered. Even if he's a good worker, I can't have him getting all jittery in front of our clients. Okay, first things first. You have one minute, Koshimizu. Tell us about yourself. Whoa! <laughs> yeah. Yes! My name is C.H.A. Koshimizu. Pleased to meet you. At, at university, I majored in ego studies. Uh, ego studies? I, I think that would help me help you help people here. My str strength strengths are animals like me. 
Uh, um, my hobby, my my hobby is to dine out. I, I know lots of good pl places to eat around here. Th that is all. Thank you for your time, lime time. I don't think he said a single thing that's work related. More like a personal ad, wasn't it? He kept stumbling too. With that garbled delivery, it's impossible to tell if Kyoshi Mizuka would be useful to us. Marina's looking glum. If you don't turn around, you're toast, Koji Mizu. You said you majored in eagle studies? Can you explain what that is? Uh huh. I, I, I said that? Yes, you did. I think you said that you could apply your knowledge of eagle studies to help us here. Uh, I'm, I'm so sorry, I don't remember anything I said. Knowing Koji Mizu, he probably stumbled over his words out of nervousness. I better throw my life vest. What did he mean by eagle studies? It must have been something that would be of use to us here. English studies? Legal studies, I see. <laughs> Regal studies, beagle studies. Alright, alright. Legal! That eagle studies thing. Did he mean legal studies? That would make sense. If he has knowledge of legal matters, it would come in handy at a real estate firm. The housing laws go hand in hand with our business. Koji Mizukun, did you mean to say legal studies? Hi. Yes, that that's it. I have a legal studies degree. I'm sorry, I, I must have said something dumb. Legal studies. Well then, hmm. Marlena seems to have a slightly better impression of Koji Mizu now. Let's see. Your strengths was that animals like you. Your hobby was dining out so you know good places to eat. Is that correct? Hi. Yes. <laughs> so my strength is animals like me? Well, we don't have much time. We should ask him to get into either his strength or his hobby in detail. Which would you like to hear about? Uh, Marina needs to get the impression Koshi Mizu will be useful in real estate. Would focusing on his strengths improve her impression of him or his hobby? I think hobby would be good because this is real estate. And that means he knows about all the dining restaurants here. Tell us more about your hobby of dining out. Yeah. Yes, I, I love discovering good places to eat. So I uh, often dine out all over town. I've gone through Kamurocho thoroughly. I'm familiar with nearly all restaurants in the like in town. I I think I know them all. Hmm. I honestly don't know that how that hobby will be useful. All that walking keeps him fit. He knows the dining scene. Let's ask him his strength. He knows the dining scene. I think his knowledge of dining establishments could be invaluable. How do you figure? Dining establishments are commercial properties too. Popular places might consider expansion. Unpopular restaurants might turn into vacant storefronts. I see. If dining out is his hobby, he might have up-to-date information on things like that. Hmm. Melina's opinion of Koji Mizu seems to have improved a little bit. Okay, let's move on to the final part. Mr. President, do you have any questions for Koji Mizu-kun? <laughs> questions for the president himself? Y yes, indeed. Uh, I'm happy to answer any questions. Uh, okay. Your firm is an innovator of cutting-edge synergy that challenges the industry metrics. My career plan is a shared vision and engagement, insights, a conversion. <laughs> just buzzwords, oh, Ko Kojimizu. Oi. Kojimizu, just relax. As soon as he got back to the regular interview format, he got so nervous he just started spewing buzzwords. I better toss Koji Mizu a question that he can make a good impression with without getting flustered. Why do you apply with us? Tell us about someone you admire. What's your favorite color? <laughs> Tell us about someone you admire. Koji Mizu, there's someone you look up to, isn't there? Y yes, but I already told you about him earlier. Uh. You did, but I want to hear it again. Take your time, can you do that? Yeah. Yes. So that's why I don't want to be like my father. I want to be a real estate agent who, who can make both my clients and my family happy. Well said, Kojimizu. Well, 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 that might be because we, we were already talking about it earlier. You talked about this while I was away? Uh. Yeah. Kojimizu-kun is a pretty good guy, isn't he? It looks like Marina's impression of Kojimizu may have taken a positive turn. That's it for our interview. Thank you for your time. Uh, okay, thank you. Let's move right along to our decision. President Kitty? Hmm? I have no objections whatsoever. The decision rests with you, Mr. President. Uh. Okay. Koshimizu? Leave. <laughs> Imagine if they gave me a decision here. <laughs> I would have said leave just to see what happens. 
Kushi Misu, you're hired. W what? Really? Y yes! Yes! Congratulations and welcome aboard. Here's your cap there, too. Oh, really? Are you sure it's alright? I mean, you gave me a job and now even cab fare? Of course, that's what we promise. Now that you're hired, we would like you to start as soon as possible. Can you start tomorrow? Yes, I'm afraid I don't have any experience to offer, but I will do my best for you. Thank you! We're counting on you. Yes, sir. Aww. <laughs> awesome. Do you think Kochi Mizuka will actually show up tomorrow? I think so. If you had that much trouble with the truth, imagine what he'd be like trying to tell a lie. I hope you're right. Hmm? Uh, oh, Koshi Mizukan forgot his bag. We have to take it to him. Why would we need to do that? He's coming in tomorrow. Oh, for goodness sake, what if this has his wallet real pass? He can't be very far. Can you run after him and get him to wait? I'll follow with the bag. Okay, okay. Why didn't why didn't I grab the what? If I'm running after him to begin with, why didn't I grab the bag? Oi. Hey, Koshimizu, where are you? Where did he go? Oh, oh, oh my god, it's a... <laughs> it's a poorly rendered dog! Arf, arf! Hmm? Huh? Shit! I still get pissed thinking about that cutie guy. You assholes! Are you guys kicking a puppy? Asshole calls himself a company president. I totally get where you're coming from. You shouldn't take it out on a dog, though. He might piss on your suit. But that cry is so satisfying. I imagine Kiryu making those bitchy little noises. Isn't that right, dog? Where I will beat the shit out of you. It's them. Stop that. Stop. Stop hurting that dog. Koshi Mizu. Huh? What's with this guy? He's shaking like a leaf. Sh shut up. If, if, if you don't stop abusing the dog, I, I, I won't let you. Sheesh, this guy's a real piece of work. Ain't you can, will you make him go away? Oh. With pleasure. Let's see how you feel after. This. Oh. Oh. <laughs> how do you like that? That's what being a hero gets you. I'm, I'm not finished with you. Koji Mizu, let's huh? fight side by side. Huh? What is with you? Ha! Ha! Blah, blah, blah. I... I'm not done with you. Kiryu literally just watched this whole time. What is with this creep? He's freaking me out. Let's get out of here. Okay. No, we don't get to beat him up? <gasps> Lame. <laughs> I did it. Y you're safe now. Oh. I'm so glad. <laughs> Ouch, stop it. Dickles, you're getting slobber on my face. Ow, oh, 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 oh. Present Kiryu, Koshi Mizukun. See, aren't you glad we hired a guy? <laughs> Marina comes out and it's like, Kiryu, did you beat the shit out of Yushi Mizukun? <laughs> Why would he do that? Yes, yes, I am. Koshi Mizu, welcome to the team. <laughs> oh, oh, God, his stats are not very good. <laughs> but I will still use you. Welcome to the team. It would be cute if he was like one of those units that you like level up over time or something like that. You know, like 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 the more you use him, the stronger he gets. Oh, oh, like the farm boy from uh, Fire Emblem. Like he had crazy skilling stats even though he was one of the weakest units to start. Yeah, exactly like that. Yeah. Don't get me wrong, I love him. He did great. Let's see, there should be everything here is done. Thought I was so rad. Yeah, that's his name, KQ and I. Final Awakening was the best. I dated the stinky trash king Gangro though. Uh, okay, no art. Yeah, this leveling up part is actually draining me a bit, but once it's full, we'll just be reaping in the benefits. No panties barbecue? That sounds amazing. Hooters, move aside. I'm going to the no panties barbecue. Oh, 
All right, we're good to go. <laughs> wow, that new area makes money a lot faster than the old ones. Okay, actually, now I'm kind of looking forward to the, uh, what is it, the Gambling King District? That must make some mad bank. Scaling upwards. I don't think I have any money to buy things with right now, though, unfortunately. I do not. What can we do real fast? It's amazing because it's both the Yakuza devs made a good game and the translation team did a really good job with the translation. <laughs> Like, they, they, they were not worried about being stylish. They just went for funny things. How's it going, the god? Uh, I am never going to the arcade again. I refuse. Oh, that's a different arcade. Batting cage. You know what? It's been a bit. Let's go. Let's go do some pocket. <laughs> pocket racing. I really suck at this, so don't judge me. I just pick random shit and hope it works for the race. I don't remember where the main story is anymore. Wing story, what? Is it? No, this is not it. It's way more north. This way. Ah, oh, damn! I can't. I can't see injustice like this and do nothing. That guy just fade into nothing. What you got there? Give me your knife. Thanks. <laughs> this is your buddy's knife. You can blame him for this. Aw, oh, damn, what a waste of a heat move. The main story is a batting cage, is right. We're gonna master so many different <laughs> useless mini games after Yakuza 0. I won't do it again. We've been in this chapter for like 12 hours now. Same thing for the last Majiba while we grind out all those cabaret clubs. Oh, cart, cart, cart! Yeah! Look at that cleavage! Uh, how do I get into the pocket? There we go. Fighter! You came back! Alright, it's Fighter! Fighter's back! I just had to take a bathroom break. Sorry to keep you waiting. You took your time in there, Fighter. You had a bathroom break for like three weeks. Nice. We're buddies. Oh, I have to walk back in. Okay, Kiryu came in just to watch that and then leave. Chad move. Uh, ba -ba. Here for a race? Yeah, let's enter a race. Yo, I won't even test the uh, car, I'll just oh. wing it as we go. Let's do the rookie's race. Put your mining skills to the test. There's a slope curve, there's a jump. There's a jump. Um, How do I edit my car? Extra slim tires. Ultra low profile. Good for circuits with jumps. Well, you don't have to say that to me twice. Uh, speed frame, motor, extra balanced motor. Acceleration slopes. Actually, this might make my car too expensive, huh? There's like a basic cost for it. Balanced gears plus battery, regular battery. Size stabilizer. Detail. Is that too much? Is that too expensive? I guess it's fine. Oh shit, I skipped the animation! No, I'm sorry, you guys. I'll play it the next one. Don't worry, we'll be doing this a lot. Yeah. 
You're gonna be okay, I think. Maybe I didn't give you enough acceleration. That's my fault. Devastated. Try to make it to finish line. <laughs> finish line. I know you're not trying to BM me, Pocket Circuit Fighter, but I feel BM'd. All right, where did I go wrong here? Right, let's go with sick tires, frame. What cost can we do? We need even more, right? Let's go with this. Gears, balance gears, power gears. Let's go with power gears. Extra balance, frame, cornering, acceleration. You know what, guys? I see nothing wrong with this. Let's go. Oops. Max is 25. Go for endurance battery. <laughs> Hey, you know, that makes a lot of sense, Pete. I'll, I'll probably swap it. Full send it. Is 12 laps a lot? It is. It is more than normal. I'm gonna go a little bit greedier. Somewhere, I'm not sure where, but somewhere we can be a bit more greedy. Mm. You know what? It's fine. Let's just go. Let's go see it. Walter is right. Kiryu is the definition of how to be a real man. Remarkable Kazuma kid. Smooth start, you say. I'm so slow. I'm so slow, and I don't know what I did wrong. Maybe I should have changed the speedy wheels. We are the slowest in the world. The boost did nothing for us. This is the end. We're too slow. <laughs> Alright. Do you think we can even beat Yusuke? I don't think we can. I think we should just call it quits here. I think we made it too stable. Can we quit? Oh, your car's weight affects it? What? All right. I feel like the efficient way to do this is just to look up at the build, but I'm just gonna keep fucking around and finding out. What jumps? This area does have jumps. It's super expensive. Who needs a stabilizer? Alright, we still have slopes. Alright, now let's try this one. <laughs> Keep fucking around and finding out. <laughs> this, is, this feels like a really bad idea, honestly. I feel like my th my car is about to eat shit and die, and it's my own fault. Your speed is like your lowest stat. Yeah! I was hoping an acceleration could carry us. Or is it because we cap out on speed? Hmm... Of 
recording amazing. Alright, let's try this again. I've heard about the Yakuza movie. This time it's an okay start, we're not falling behind or anything. I use one boost when we're over here. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, that car was not gonna make it. It was upside down, cutie, you but but somehow it's flipping. <laughs> Whoops. Boost is blind. Dude, I think I think it went too hard there. It was straight up upside down. <laughs> I thought it was so funny that it was upside down, but as I was smashing the circle button, it was somehow flipping back around. Alright, do you guys have XM? Do you guys have more parts? No new stock, okay. Damn, we're, we're deep in this hobby shit, Kiryu. <laughs> oh god. Alright, okay. Dude, I don't know what to do. Try my best. All right, good for circus with jumps. Frame. Okay, there's probably a rocket frame that 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 destroyed us here. Let's try the metal frame. All right, now let's try it. <laughs> oh, gotcha for car parts. Like, like, those 10 million yen machines? Okay, come on. Come on, Kiryu. We can do this. Come on. We can't let- we can't just keep dying like this and losing two kids. What is this, like, Fortnite? Alright. I'm gonna risk it every time here. <laughs> You should be impressed by how far it went. <laughs> you should really be impressed by that. You should be too devastated. We had some wins here. Okay, what the fuck do I do? How do I balance this better? Fuck! Alright. There's only one jump, so maybe... When do you go with the slick tires? This one decreases balance. It's, it does so little against us. I'm just like, what's going wrong, wrong, honestly? How about some side space stabilizers? You're over the cost limit? What's the cost limit here? Park Jean. Am I choosing a wrong race? Yeah, that's what's going on. Okay, let's try this new balance. Go, 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 go. You got this, kid. You totally got this. Nope, we're too fucking slow. <laughs> Even with that, I don't think we're gonna be able to do it. Gum Tiger, keep going! No, Yusuke's catching up! Go, 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 Tiger! 
Okay. No, every time Yusuke is getting closer and closer. Damn, Yusuke, what kind of machine do you have? All right, I will. I will wait to the end. See just how far ahead Yusuke gets ahead of us. Damn, Yusuke, what kind of machine do you have? Let's see if I can catch up with this. Go, go, Tiger! Uh, I don't think we can keep this lead. Nope. Yusuke is too strong! What are the chances that Yusuke just runs out of batteries here? <laughs> what are the chances? Yusuke and Ishiro! Can you quick knock over the racetrack? That way they don't have to know you're about to lose to a bunch of kids! Just need more speed, huh? Kazuma, no, and we're gonna be last. No, we're third. <laughs> it's not the worst, Kiryu. We 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 improved a little bit. All right, customize the car a bit. Uh, how do we make it better? You guys say just a bit more speed? Extra slim tires? I feel like the extra slim tires is gonna make us eat shit and die. Gears, power gears. Battery, high capacity battery. I'm going to try the regular battery. Maybe. Oh, sorry to hear that, Peyton. Use code water. All right, let's go for the race. <laughs> Slim tires. Uh, actually, I worry about the battery. Okay, okay, we should be good to go. I think we're good to go. Let's go. Tanoshi. This guy is satisfying to watch in its own way. Go, Gon Tiger! Whoa! No! Why is it so hard to balance? <laughs> Okay, we can do this. I wonder if we even have a combination I can do it with. You know what? I would assume we would. We have so many things, honestly. Extra slim tires. It has side stabilizer. Kind of blows. When well, we can have a extra good frame then. Maybe not. I torque gears. Power gear. I'm gonna try instead doing it like this. Here. I think this is more well around for it. Uh, this is well. <laughs> well rounded out for it. Blah, 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 yes. word salad. Uh, I'm getting too invested in these stupid pocket circuit racers. この
Okay, maybe. I, I definitely don't think it's stable enough. <laughs> Looking at it right now, it's way too fast, and I'm too scared to boost because it will be the end of Golem Tiger. <laughs> oh no, it's already getting there. <laughs> this is unsustainable speed. <laughs> Speed is unsustainable, listen to me. We have to do this every time and our gauge is only so big. <laughs> okay, it was too fast. <laughs> Speedy, we fucked up. Golem Tiger is not out of the lane! <laughs> it fell back in, how- Okay, we got this. We got this. Alright, where do we go wrong this time? Customize. I need way more stability somewhere. Are you sure the side stabilizers do nothing? The exact same thing, but with the side stabilizers. And we will see the side stabilizers really do nothing. It's definitely slower this time. Let's go, Golden Tiger. Leave this. I thought the whole point was to be fast. You're doing great. No, Gollum Tiger, you're okay. I'll get laughed, Joe. I say this, but I'll probably eat shit before Tiger's going. Tiger, let's go! Let's go, Golden Tiger! Okay, we're okay, we're okay. Just one more lap. Come on, just one more lap. We have enough of a gauge. We have enough of a gauge. We just need to do one. Just one more, just one more Golden Tiger. You can do it. You can do it. Golden Tiger! Yeah. Finally, we beat some. You know how to push it to the limit, Cosmo. Come back and race again soon. <laughs> All right, that was mm -hmm. parts in stock. Hmm. Looks like they've got some brand new stuff. Parts for your slot car, make it even faster. Fuck! Just when I thought I was gonna leave. Be back. This is like rate up banner. I have a problem. Fuck them kids, Yusef. Was still blazed out of his ever loving mind. Well, if it doesn't say I own it, I probably don't, right? I'm just gonna buy everything. Godspeed. This place just seems so fun. Got another rake.
that stuff. Yeah, Renry, I like to think that all of the money that Kiryu has been con into the pocket circuit racer game. <laughs> Pro and so this time there's like loop de loops and shit. Sheesh. Ultra low profile tires. Tires, since we don't know what we're going for right now, we need them spiky wheels. Is there? I see the loop switch and wall, but I. Don't... Extra metal frame, extra speed frame. Okay, okay. There's a couple. reason to decrease that one. Extra um, skill for extra balance. Battery. This regular battery. Side stabilizer. Suspension. A light suspension. Let's go. All right, let's try it. This is the best. A giant loop. Golden Tiger. Golden Tiger. Golden Tiger. Golden Tiger. Golden Okay, I'm honestly curious to see how the loop is gonna go. Oh my god, let's go, Golden Tiger! That was. How's it, Merryweather? Hope you should go, Merryweather. He's a blast. Come on, Golden Tiger. You're you're just you're just so in the lead. You're doing. Someone ahead of me, I can't tell. I think if Blue's ahead of me, I'm gonna have to boost. Is. Go! Oh, Golden Tiger! I know this was my own hubris, but you can do it, Golden Tiger! Go, Golden! No! <laughs> no, this is all my fault, kitty! You. Spinning out of control, out of, out of lane. My fucking fault. Good luck next time. Why did you say that? So sad. I. I right, beat Golden Tiger. All right, guys. What? Self today. I don't. That's no good. I I I'm wrapped up in red. Aww. Do we have to beat the? I just want him to be okay. Fuck it, extra soft tires for fun. Let's see. Extra metal frame. That's an extra of it. I guess I'll go with it. Gears, extra power gears, extra balance. Stabilizer. Side saber's fine. Suspension should be fine too. in this one is there, so I guess maybe we can do the side stabilizer instead. So cool. What's wrong, Merryweather? Oh, 
，狗狗妞妞。Ah shit, we're so slow. I should use the boost there. I'll try it in a second. Here. Okay, maybe. <laughs> I know, that was the bad. Good debut, Mary. <laughs> Should I try? Don't use the boost. No, the boost is too good. Maybe, maybe. Need the spikes? Fine. Don't trust. Yeah. Fuck it. Speed. <laughs> Speed. Oh yeah, all of these guys have spiked tires. <laughs> all right, all right. We should be, we should be okay. I think our own good again, which tends to happen. All right. Published. We should have another turn. Ah! You're okay. You're okay. You're okay. You're okay. Tournament <laughs> sometime. Very wetter. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. Hope you had a fun Boy. race. Hey, fighter. Matter. I can't really talk about it here. <laughs> Is it about your virginity again, bro? Virginity again? Homie, me. Right. <laughs> Are you gonna trauma dump about your virginity again? Parents, oh, I'm sorry. I thought it was about your virginity. <laughs> yeah, I got a call from my mom. She said if I'm getting nowhere here in the for the family business. I see. What does your family do? Shop. No kidding. What should I do? You're the thing. What do you want to do, fighter? To be honest, I don't. Pretty soon, I can't go on living like this much longer. I an important job and going out with tons of chicks. I guess I it doesn't work out that way. Now I'm working for peanuts. Earning potential and a non existent love life. Pocket cigarette fight. We'll start your track record here. At this rate, it may be my parents, but. But. It's fun working with the kids. That's why I'm having trouble deciding. F fighter? Huh? <laughs> what are you doing here? Yeah. Oh, this is so embarrassing. No, come back! Come back! Here to He's gone. We just wanted to tell him something. Yeah, something really important. He might not come back anymore. I might know where he is. When he's feeling down, he goes to public park number three. Oh my god, that's so sad. <laughs> okay, I'll go check. If I find him there, I'll bring him back. 
<laughs> These kids just killed him without trying to, dude. Like, how am I supposed to know? Is that a park? Oh, just tell me. <laughs> just tell me where it is, game. You know where Bacchus is? You think I know where Bacchus is? <laughs> you know where he is? Is that where Bacchus is? No. The trainer dude at the bottom. Here? Save point. Man, I'm only getting more and more lost. Um, this. Found it! Yay! And we can go get our money at the same time. you guys for guiding me to public park number three. God, Gamer can read maps. Shut up. Shut up, you know I can't. Money. Nice. Got this. Got that. So here. All right. I think it's good to go here too. And then we can level some stuff up. So close. We can probably do Miracle one more time and that would max out. Uh, probably Pleasure King's the best here. So Does the cabaret club still haunt me when I'm doing all these other things? Alright. Um, I think I'll probably call it here for the night, you guys. Thank you guys so much for coming to through more of Yakuza 3. You know what? I lied to you. Let's go do the main story. Let's go do the main story real fast. But today, all we've done is side quests and, uh, you know, main story. Otherwise, it's gonna be like, damn, we really just dicked around. <laughs> Which one are you doing? Uh, I don't know. Up to Little Asia. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. We have to, we have to. Story. Maybe even swap back over to Majima or something. Money looking. I know, guys. I know. Yakuza. Oh. Oh. Nugget. That's true. Time. Go through here. Why is this entrance? <laughs> Why is it so sketchy and scary? Oh man, I feel like something's gonna jump scare me at any time. I don't. I don't trust. Yes, Renry, I miss the cabaret. I miss the cabaret after grinding it out so much, but I just like it. It's just such a fun management game. Management games are that fun. Oh, dude, this is like a maze. Hey. Oh, yeah, we can come back here. Right? I assume. Yeah, we can come back here. Right? I assume. 
そうか最悪が待ってる<laughs> like from that spot since the last time. Another got a lot of money. Another got a lot of money. Another どちらにしろ、oh, 長い時間かくまえるものじゃありません。空の一つぼの所有者を我々がいかに目立たないが限りになります。それもできるだけ。なるほど。それを俺と小田がやる。この役はやはりあなた。Take care, comrade. We pro probably. Hi, Rez. Kiryu san. Kara no hitotsubo ni donna kachi ga aru no ka to kiki. Ah, anta wa sore ni tsui cha. Eh, desu ga Kiryu dekiru to omimasu. With me. あなたが生きてそう。そのために生きてきてください、キリュウさん。それで、空の一粒の持ち主はどういうやつなんだ若い女性です。ただ、どうも目が不自由とのことでほぼ失明していますえその殻の一坪の所有者は牧村誠という人物です It's all connecting It's all connecting The branches From Kiryu directly to Majima Alright guys that was a great story mission <laughs> We did so much あ、ごめんなさい、マジマ。複数勢力から標的とされる牧村誠。彼女が狙われる理由を探る真島は誠の面倒を見てきた。I think do they have to show the booby grope every time and make me and make me <laughs> make me question Twitch TOS? Should they leave the recap for next stream? I think I think so too, but we'll do it twice. Why not? <laughs> it's so true, Glark, because we did three minutes of story. Balances out the past seven hours of digging around. <laughs> oh, yeah, Lee just got blown up, and then Hot Daddy Man came to, like, knock us out. <laughs> Lee fucking died, man. Lee just fucking ate ass and died. Alright, create new save. <laughs> A murky river bed. Alright, that was great. Thank you guys so much for coming to watch me play Yakuza 0. I really want to beat the game so we can see the rest of the Yakuza series. Uh, I, as you know, I, I played the game five years ago, so I remember a lot of the story, but you guys are seeing a lot of my, you know, I, I didn't do a lot of sub-stories. I wasn't a completionist back when I was like 15. So, uh, I'm, I'm still experiencing a lot of the things new with you guys, except for the story. I know the general gist of it. Um, that's why sometimes with the story things, I'm just holding back and waiting for you guys' reaction, because I don't want to spoil it for you. Alright, that was a blast to play. Uh, bu -bu -bu. <laughs> and then, tomorrow, I will stream again at 7pm PT. It will be more games. I don't know what games, though. It could be Yakuza, or it could be Hades. <laughs> Yeah, it is. It's just too good, okay? Let me scratch that itch while I can. 
<laughs> yeah, we did it. We got the turkey. We got the turkey, you guys. We became the bowling and dart master this stream somehow. All right. Thank you guys so much for coming and chilling with me. I had a lot. I had a lot of fun experiencing all of these sub stories with you guys and, and grinding out things. <laughs> Hope you enjoy the grind too, homie. All right, doing the usual plug at the end of stream, and then we'll raid a homie. Stick around for the raid. Uh, you can just make a homie's night with a nice big raid, spamming the raid message. It's just nice to stick around, you know? Um, and you also get channel points, which you can use for a bunch of stuff, like guiding the raid. All right, make sure to come follow me on Twitter for shit posts. <laughs> Regular shit posts. You do for lovely edited videos. Uh, you get to see the Yakuza Zero compilations if you missed anything in the past. Uh, they're all incredible videos, and the, and the editing goes hard. So if you are joining here late and you're like, man, I want to, I missed out on all of that Yakuza earlier. You can check out the lovely videos edited by Frosty and Peyton, <laughs> and you you will be like all up to date basically. Um, what else? And the last thing is come to the Discord so we can shit post. Oh fuck, I typed it wrong. Come to the Discord so we can shit post together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, now let me go find you guys a homie to raid. Let's see, let's see. <laughs> yeah, there's quality content there, Miguel. Yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow at 7 p.m. PT then. Let's see, who are we gonna raid? Oh. All right, um, I'm gonna raid Poppy. It's been a bit. It's been a bit since we raided Poppy because Poppy uh, streams before us now. I think time zone wise. You guys get ready for it to be loud. Get ready for it to be proud. It's heck. It's a hectic loud time in Poppy's stream. So I think you have a good time hanging out with them. All right. So yeah, I, if you're new here, I stream every day, Mondays through Fridays, uh, 7 p.m. PT, <laughs> and I just like hanging out with you guys and playing games. So, so you guys, Poppy. Poppy is playing Stray, the little cat game that came out and everyone's been playing. See you guys over to him, counting guys down, okay? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, goes night. See you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.